Come and join Tracy Spurgeon and explore ring making with silver clay. You will be guided through how to work with all the tools, material and equipment. Then Tracy will be giving you lots of inspiration on how to design your very own cocktail rings. You will learn all about ring sizing, creating bands, stone setting, polishing and finishing. The full course includes a buffet style lunch and refreshments, a tour of the studio and a chance to shop in our on-site store. For full details and available dates, contact our call centre or check out our website. Come and learn with Jewellery Maker. Learn great techniques with this fantastic DVD, Extruder Edition 1. Join guest designer Debbie Bulford and presenter Ed McKay and start creating new, exciting and colourful pieces of polymer clay using the multifunctional extruder tool. To get your hands on a copy of this fantastic DVD, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. Did you know when you book on a Jewelry Maker workshop, you are given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. Good afternoon, welcome back to today's show. Hope you're having a nice afternoon. I have loved it today. We've had such a great time and we've had some lovely messages as well uh, from uh, you at home um, because it is Helen's uh, first design inspiration show, if you like, um, today. Um, and we're loving the demonstrations today. I've had such a great time kumihimoing away. I really, really have. Oh, this is coming up very, very soon for you. Oh, mm. I love this. Only a few left. Should we do it now? I love this. Um, out of all the necklace collars that I've brought to you, I think this has been the most <laughs> popular. They are so, so beautiful. It's all about the metallics this season. We've seen lots of them all over the catwalk at London Fashion Week um, just a couple of weeks ago. And these, I, I just love them. I'm not going to get one now. This is the only one that I don't actually have, I think. I have most of the necklace collars. Um, what I love about these is you can really dress them up if you want to. You know, you can leave them like this simple black dress and it completely transforms an outfit. You can, because of the ridges in these as well, you could wire wrap into those if you wanted to. Add some gemstones. In fact, one of those amethysts would look gorgeous dangling down there, wouldn't it? Beautifully. You know the amethyst that we've just had? Stunning. Eight pounds and 95 pence for you. Uh, rose plated brass collar you've got here. Uh, Karen in Nottinghamshire, you're there. Well done to you. Uh, Karen in Surrey, well done. Louise in Berkshire. Karen in Nottinghamshire's just got two. Well done. Uh, Miss Pauline in the West Midlands, Louise in Yorkshire. Patricia, you're there. Collector in Yorkshire. Carola in Oxfordshire. Look at the luster. It looks really high end, doesn't it? Really, really high end. You could even, if you wanted to, glue a cabochon there if you wanted to. No problem at all. I love them just how they are. I think they're such a fabulous look. Y-A-P-O-59 is your code for this one. Um, how many? Oh, only nine. Oh. Oh, oh, nine left and 26 in baskets. Unbelievable. <laughs> 800, 644, 655. You're going to have to be really, really quick. I'm just going to leave this on for the rest of the show. I love this one. Oh, it's gorgeous. it is. It's really lovely. I know. Right then, Phil. Ooh, pearls. Um, oh, fossil coral. Uh, your multi-shaped cabochons, these are gorgeous. You know her, um, earlier on how I was talking about exclusivity? These. Um, no two will ever be the same. They are phenomenal. Look at these, completely natural. Look at these little fossils within the gemstone. Aren't they gorgeous? Ooh. Aren't they beautiful? 
I know they are oh. dreamy so individual I mean you've got thousands and thousands of years you know you've got a snapshot from years and years ago you know uh, frozen captured in time essentially <gasps> um, in this gemstone they are beautiful um, you have your um, fossil coral cabochons here now I have and I, I've got to say it must have been a good six years ago I'd say here at the Daniel Jamestown Company that I bought my fossil coral ring um, and it's just set into sterling silver and it's one of those that I get compliments on all the time because it's so unusual you know not everybody has seen this gemstone and it is just incredible I mean look at that that's oh. my favourite I think I have one two three four five six seven eight nine individual cabochons I've got here now I can't guarantee you um, the number of cabochons that you will get all the shapes and sizes but I can guarantee you 250 carats massive carat weight of your fossil coral there i'd be getting these home statement rings pendants brooches again gorgeous oh the the actual shapes in there wow they're phenomenal oh. aren't they and you just look at them and you think what? do you know what I, I yeah can't it's, me it's mes mesmerizing though aren't they you keep looking at them yeah. and you think, oh i see another bit of detail they are dreamy 1995 oh, did i say look. i had nine one, two, three, four. Yeah, nine individual cabochons here. Nineteen pounds and ninety-five pence. You could get more. You could get slightly less. You could get slightly bigger cabochons. But you can see there how different, how individual mm. they all are. You've got those gorgeous grey hues, those beautiful green creams, those mustard hues that you've got there as well. These have been the height of fashion for thousands of years. Your fossil corals, so individual. RB NV eighty-two is your code for these. Nineteen ninety-five. I've got lots of you with these in baskets. Get them home and have a look. Do you know what? If I were you, I'd be multi-buying. Picking my favourite ones out of there, you know? Oh, they're just so individual. If you come in and you get two packs, you're going to have, you know, quite a few cabochons that are completely different. And again, you know, against the block colour, long drop mm. in a pendant. How beautiful is that going to look in a brooch against your pashmina for the winter months? That's yeah. gorgeous. Hold those lines. Well done if you've got those. Is it called millefiori? The, the little flowers inside yes. that's it's sort of man-made? Yeah. That is nature's millefiori yeah, nature. or whatever. It's incredible, it is. isn't it? Yeah. Fabulous. Okay. Yeah. Um, Amazonite. Holiday strand. Look at these with pearls. <sighs> Amazonite in Rondells. Mm. Um, I can't say I've ever seen Amazonite in Rondells. I'm just trying to think. I've had quite a few nugget strands. Last 10 of these. And let me tell you, on the launch, wow, these were gone in minutes they went so quickly seven pounds and 95 pence for you are oh, i beg your pardon pg nv 64 completely natural at seven pounds and 95 pence they're going to work so well in your gents pieces as well aren't they that beautiful mm. beautiful hue that you've got with these makes me think of tropical oceans oh yes it really really does and um, well done if you're on those phone lines 54 carats you've got there it's just seven pounds and 95 pence they are last of stock so do be quick and um, they are graduated four by two to eight by four millimeters in size 15 centimeter strand it is indeed miss it miss out and um, Collector in Cheshire, you have confirmed and you are the first person um, to get your hands on this strand. I've got a collector in Lincolnshire, I've got a collector in Lancashire, I've got Yanath in Greater London, a collector in Northumberland, Eleanor in Barcelona, you're with us as well. You're going to have to check out, it is fastest fingers first as we are last of stock. Uh, Elaine in County Down, you've just joined me as well. We've got telephone bidders on the phone lines right now. If you're on the phone, little tip, just push that number one button. There is an automated message which you can listen to if you wish to do so. When we're low stock, you just copy quick. Um, um, okay. <laughs> Have a look at this. Oh, wow. Oh, look at this. Oh, isn't this gorgeous? Oh, <gasps> no. No, I thought they were diamonds. I did, honestly. 
If we'd have had seven carats of diamonds, <laughs> wow. Can you imagine? <laughs> but funny you say that, Helen, because uh, Spinelli is the master of disguise. Oh, you right. Know, often mistaken for that of a diamond. So oh. your black Spinel often mistaken for that of a black diamond. Your pink Spinel for a pink diamond. I mean, look at that, yeah. Lester. Six ninety-five. I'd be coming in and I'd be multi-buying. They are incredible. EX VX ninety-two, uh, two by one millimeters in size. You give me black spinel any day of the week. Over. Oh my gosh, there's so many of you there. I'm so so sorry if you've missed out on this. That's beautiful. Little solid stunning silver charm. Oh, dreamy. Well done. Okay. Right. Let's have a look at some peridot oh these are stunning do you know this is the first time i've had peridot today and actually early on when we had those amethysts we had some really high-end amethyst early on and um, peridot and amethyst look gorgeous together they really really do now peridot is the only gemstone other than a diamond to be formed in the mantle of the earth all gemstones are formed in the crest apart from peridot and diamonds and again this is one that is completely natural and you know when you see that color you just think how can it be it took me years and years and years to get that around my head that this was a completely natural gemstone that saturation it's so vivid in color this peridot they are beautiful you've got your three millimeter rounds here 18 centimeter strand 24 carats of your peridot peridot and citrine peridot and amethyst with the black spinel that mm. we just had wow they look gorgeous. Oh, yeah. The lemon quartz that we had earlier on oh, as well. Yeah. Stunning. Do you know, interestingly enough, when I went um, to Lanzarote in, it feels like ages ago now. I'm sure it was only like last month or something. Um, it, it does feel like ages ago. There was loads of peridot, and I'd never noticed that. I've been to Lanzarote quite a few times. Um, peridot and volcanic rock, because that's uh, uh, Lanzarote's volcanic island. So they sell a lot of volcanic rock in their jewellery teamed up with peridot and do you know what it looks phenomenal it really really does however prices i could not mm. believe it not not even any solid sterling silver simple stretchy bracelets for peridot and some volcanic rock there i was looking at price tag of 30 euros no not here Six pounds and ninety-five pence. Collect in Cheshire. You've got two. Well done, uh, Beverly in Cumbria. Trisha in Essex. Collect in Worcestershire. You're there. Um, Davina in Cambridgeshire. Emma in Kent. Collect in Lincolnshire. You've got yours. And um, collect in Cheshire. You've just joined me as well. That's an absolute giveaway price tag for Peridot and twenty-four carats. You know, twenty-four points at six ninety-five in a ring would be, you know, amazing, wouldn't it? But you've got 24 carats here. HB YY 68. Quick question for Helen. We've got um, this is from uh, Lindsay in Greater Manchester. This Hannah and Helen. Does Helen? This Hannah and Helen. Does Helen have a <laughs> website? Does Helen have a website we can go on? Fabulous designs, Helen. This Hannah and Helen. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, Helen, do you have a website, Facebook page? I've got a Facebook page you can yep. join me on, Helen O'Connor. Okay. Um, I haven't put the JM bit on, but you'll see see it easy enough because um, I the photograph is me in JM jewelry ah, maker. Okay. So that's okay. Brilliant. Uh, I've kept it all as one because I've got so many lovely yeah. family and friends, and yeah. if anyone wants to join me on there, that's great. Oh, brilliant! And I do do some different tutorials. Um, I'm hoping, obviously, a, a DVD or cd yeah. whatever they are these days will come out yeah. and um yeah so the lots happening and um obviously i'm i would like to do sort of a youtube type of yeah. presentation because i've done it for a long time good few yeah. years but i didn't realize that people weren't actually aware of yeah. it so yeah it's great that people want to have a go and please yeah. please do have a go please yeah have a go. definitely give it a go because i tell you i loved it i didn't want to stop um, right, let's have a look. Oh, it's one of my favourites. Yeah, it has. Deborah, the Bruges, the bag. Oh, the bag. Yes, I remember the bag. <laughs> I'm not over it. 
Got to be honest. You remember the bag. Yeah, I remember the bag. <laughs> it was my first project that I started with the bag. Not finished that one yet either. Um, Deborah Rudge, when she was here, she used um, five metres, the whole reel of chain, to create the most amazing bag. Uh, if, you, if you saw that show, I was beside myself. I nearly rugby tackled her to get it off her before she left the studio. But she ran. She ran for the hills, she did. Um, there will be, uh, you'll be able to find that on YouTube somewhere actually, and I know it was in last month's hub um, on how to make the bag. This chain is fantastic, and for those of you that love to shop, you've probably seen a lot of chain around lately. Um, you know, in necklaces, um, you know, to embellish dresses with as well, handbags, just for your a handle on your clutch bag or your handbag. It is the look right now. It really, really is. There's so much that you can do with the chain. And again, little black dress completely transforms the look. Six ninety-five at uh, five meters of your gold plated. Thirty chances is all we have left for you. Oh eight hundred six double four six double five or on the web at jewelrymaker.com. Uh, QKTO zero one is your code for this one. And that bag, if you did see it, it looked so high-end, didn't it? It did look amazing. And uh, I, I remember the show well because you thought you were going home with it, if yes. I'm honest. She was having none of it, <laughs> I'd have to tell you. She was having none of it. My idea was to recreate the bag with the chain and use one of the leather nappers to line the bag yeah. with. I'm still working on it. Yeah. I will finish it. £6.95, that's an incredible, incredible price tag. Well done if you have managed to check that one out. Gorgeous. Belts as well. Yeah, it's so easy to use as well. Yeah. It, you, you can really just utilise it really well. Gorgeous. Love that. Um, okay, Labradorite for you. Now, do you know, it was just the other day, and you, you may have heard me say this before, that a couple of months ago I, I was upstairs in the office and um, I overheard, I was eavesdropping, I'll admit it, <laughs> <laughs> I overheard Paula Bennett say, um, you should see the Labradorite that we've got coming in. And I did think, no, it can't be any better. It just can't be any better than what we already have. Um, that's not right. Okay, um, right, this is not, this is going to be on and gone. Um, I didn't think it could get any better. Fact of the matter, it has. Um, I've got 10 at £9.95. and pence. I'm so sorry to those already that are going to miss out on this. Look at that Labrador Essence. The yellows, the blues, the greens, the oranges, the copper hues are there already. It is fastest fingers first. One of those wire wrapped into a ring. My goodness me, that would look incredible. Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen individual gemstones. Um, wow, I think we could probably um, sell these out ten times over right now. There's a lot of you with these in baskets. R Y Y Y zero seven is your code for these. They are stunning. Well done if you've got those. Absolutely loads of you there. And I'm sorry if you've missed out. Oh wow, gorgeous. Okay, <coughs> righty ho. Um, oh, some more Labradorite. How many of these do we have? Okay, slightly better quantity, still not enough. Um, only 35 chances to get this strand of Labradorite. Wow. Again, 90 carats, different shapes, different sizes. So again, it depends. Oh, look at the blues. Um, so again, you know, it depends on the design that you're going with, really. Maybe you'd want to use those larger coins there in statement rings. Maybe you'd want to use these in simple stretchy bracelets or earrings, you know. Stacking these up, maybe four or five of those. Gorgeous. They are fabulous. 90 carats of Labradorite. Now, it has been voted your favourite gemstone for three years running now. It's one of those. I don't know about you at home, but I've never, ever met anybody that said, nah, I don't like Labradorite. Everybody loves Labradorite, don't they? It's such a mystical, magical gemstone. It's truly beautiful. And for me, and I know Helen, um, you know, has mentioned quite a few times about, you know, if you're quite spiritual and, and you're into that kind of thing, 
for me, this teamed up with Moonstone. Oh, That's yes. like, you know, in a sun catcher or anything where it just yeah. catches the light. It has almost those therapeutic properties where you could get lost in the gemstone. Yeah, all those positive feelings. It banishes all that negativity and gives you such mm. a positive vibe. Yeah. And then if you've got, like you say, if you've got it hanging in the window, all that, that positive energy is flowing through your house. Oh, I love that oh. idea. Love that idea. Uh, Tracy in West Yorkshire says, Hi, ladies. Just discovered the red button. At last, I can watch <laughs> all of the shows. <laughs> yes. Brilliant. We were discussing this earlier on. That's fantastic um, that you found that. Well done. Uh, red button. Use it. <laughs> I'm terrible, you know. I'm such a, such a technophobe. Um, when it comes to... I can't, I can't do a PowerPoint presentation on the computer. Our remote control at home, and now we're next. I, I, I don't really know. I, I'm, I can barely change a channel, and I'm not even joking. You know when you have to type yeah. in, like, three digits on your remote control? I can never do it. What, like, Why what? is this not working? Can, just very basically, yeah. for, like, the technophobe as well, yeah. what is the red button, then? What? Well, what it's it a catch-up button. So if you press your red oh. button, it kind of um, takes you to, um, not the off button. <laughs> it, uh, it <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, on your remote control, you've got a few different colours. You might have a purple, a blue, a yellow and a red, I think. So the red is a catch-up button. Oh. It's a catch-up button. Press your red button when you get home. See oh, happens. I can't wait. <laughs> Nine pounds and 95 pence. Thanks for that, Tracy. Uh, WMRU41, nine pounds and 95 pence. Incredible. Excellent. Okay. Um, five chances. Oh, that's not going to be enough. <gasps> oh. I love green. Oh, me. Look at the size of these. <gasps> oh. oh. Wow. I've never, ever seen these before. Oh, they are wow. phenomenal. How many do we have? Six. Oh, you're joking. <laughs> I'm not joking, Alan. I'm sorry. Imagine that with the antique bronze wire we had on oh, earlier. Yes, of course. Imagine it with the pearls as well. Oh, my word. I, I, oh. Six. That's all you've got. Yeah. I can't change it. I'm sorry, Helen. I'm sorry. I feel really bad. Um, £7.95, <laughs> SIGP 64 at £7.95. 30 by 22. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So unique. I love those eye gates. They're beautiful. Okay. <sighs> um, oh, do you know what I'd put this with, if anything? That spinel that we had. Uh, what do you think of when we talk about sapphire? Mm. Blue, Blue yeah. royalty. It's normally one or the other. You know, a lot of us think about the royal engagement ring. Um, which makes us think of royalty, and a lot of us just think blue because you know, um, oh, that colour. Can I just say, hands on heart, this is the nicest strand of sapphire, blue sapphire, that I've seen here at Jewelry Maker. That colour, it's spot no. Right. Okay. No, 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 <laughs> no. <laughs> right. Oh. Okay, this is Burmese spinel, not Burmese spinel, sorry, Burmese sapphire. Um, can I just say, Burma has given the world some of the most incredible gemstones, Burmese spinel being one, uh, Burmese ruby, Burmese sapphire. Do you know what I would do straight away? Get that authenticity card. You've got Burmese sapphire. Um right here extra 50 pence if you add it to your order or you can print it off free of charge on the web www.joymaker.com burmese sapphire how many carrots 40 40 carrots that's the nicest strand of blue sapphire i've seen here at jewelry maker oh, it's just but it's beautiful you know again you know when it comes to uh focusing on a color that you really, really want. You know, when, because when, I'm a lover of emeralds, you know, so in my head, quite often when I see emeralds, I'm like, right, I want it to be this colour. I want it to be this colour. And then you see it, and it surpasses 
what you were thinking. That's this strand, isn't it? 1995 for Burmese Sapphire. That's an app. This is the deal of the day. This is the deal of the day. FANV54 is your code for this one. Um, Valerie in Kent, Dawn in Gloucestershire, Wells and Clare in Cambria, Suzanne in Norfolk, Collect in Northumberland, Antoinette in Belfast, uh, Maria in Yorkshire, Collect in Cheshire, Deborah Jane in Derbyshire, Jacqueline. If you've got, how many have we got, Phil? How many? 20. I really thought you said 120 then. I was like, yes. No, he said oh. 20. I'm so sorry. Um, you've got to get this home. Again, 30-day money-back guarantee. If for one minute you get this home, you think, do you know what? Nah, it's not for me. 40 carats of Burmese sapphire at 20 pounds. No. Send it back because there are so many people, Uwen and Aaron, in the gallery right now. They will take this off your hands. They really, really will. F-A-N-V 54. I wouldn't put this with anything else. I think it's too beautiful. Again, with pearls, maybe. You know, we talk about teaming up um, any of your big five with the big five or pearls. I think it would... Imagine that, a big cluster of that, you know, on the neckline. You could have a pearl necklace, you could make a big cluster. And you're walking through the door and everybody will stop and stare. Oh. It is absolutely oh, bedazzling. It is, isn't it? Okay, it's from here, just it's bedazzling. Gorgeous. And that with those spinel earlier would blind you with oh, that yeah they would <laughs> wouldn't they um sean in denbyshire i'm so sorry if you missed out on the collar i'm just going to take you around the back there as well because you've got a nice extender chain in there in fact i didn't show it you did oh, i when we auctioned quite this? nice you could add a little learned. gemstone on there if you wanted to so if you've got your hair up a little uh, a bit of attention to detail well, you could even wear it that way round. you could that's really unusual it's something different and in fact because of the fluidity in these i mean you can see how how well that sits on yeah. the neckline because of the fluidity you may have seen Gemma crow once she actually used one of these as a handle on a clutch bag wow. with the leather nappers it was fantastic it looked incredible i think um i would add my um cabochon there at the front mm. because you've got the attachment you could have the attachment on the side of the cabochon yeah so you have that and then the dangly bit coming down oh, yeah. you can have a little one you know uh, spinel or okay. oh. I know. Oh, There's two different gemstones, isn't there? Oh. Um, Sonia in Greater London, she says, I've got this one and it's fabulous. Oh. Buy it. That's a sapphire. Oh. Love that. Okay. Um, I'll just go and grab that. Spinel. I'll be right back. Spinel and Ruby. Um, I've got. Ooh. Set <laughs> that together. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> oh, now these, Phil, I had the other day. Um, now, guest designer Claire McDonald was here. Um, and she had these as a challenge. They were so, so popular. So popular. Um, I don't know how we've got any left, if I'm honest. 40. That's not enough. Oh. Now, you are looking, I think it was eight carats per gemstone, if I remember rightly. Yep, eight carats per gemstone of black spinel. Bezel set into solid sterling silver that is gold plated. Oh. It does make you do that, doesn't it? Now, this is cream oh. of the crop, isn't it? You know, your high-end pair of earrings that you want to wear out, maybe, um, if you come into the Gemporia Christmas ball, the snowball. Um, and it is, you know, party season, it's upon us. Now, again, for all of you that are quite new to us here at Jewelry Maker, basic jewellery making. If you've got any gold-plated findings, simple shepherd's hook, you've got yourself the most beautiful beautiful pair of earrings haven't you they would look beautiful. phenomenal they read really, i wish we had claire's jewelry because it was her challenge um i think she made a pendant as well um and a pair of earrings <coughs> excuse me and you're going to get five pieces now i'm just going to try and hold these up as best i can so do bear with me just so you can see in the ear, I mean, look at those. Oh. Look at the luster. Oh. 
23 by 10 millimeters in size eight carats in one gemstone one gemstone 40 carats in total Ulia in Surrey you've got two collector in Cheshire you've got two congratulations to you never I'd completely forgotten 14.95 is that how low we went the other day it's no wonder that so many of them went 14.95 I didn't expect that price I, I really have to say I'd completely forgotten where we went on price tag the other day when I had them that's ridiculous mm. three pounds each for eight <laughs> carats of spinel in a single solitaire so you've got five pieces so it could be the pair of earrings it could be one in a pendant um, if you wanted to and um, you could put one and use that as a charm in a bracelet maybe if you had the black spinel that we had oh, earlier no. on the strand of black spinel that we had earlier on and just popping one of those on there oh, oh look at that oh hello I want more that looks gorgeous doesn't it really really beautiful and um, philip in derbyshire you've got yours jean in cambria you're there well done to you lots of you on the web right now with these in baskets you need to be checking them out i don't know what you think kia helen because i know that you um, um do craft fairs and stuff but eight carats that's encased in solid stone silver with gold um for me that's a 60 pound pair of earrings definitely you know definitely people forget that these are jm prices they're yeah. really wholesale prices so that we can make and craft with them and then it's for us to to make yeah. the profits actually yeah we're the ones that benefit from it um and these are perfect for that mm -hmm. because they're so easy to do so they don't take long yeah not time consuming at all and on the stall they'll catch that light for people when they're walking past so they'll they you know they'll stop and look yeah they'll see the quality uh, so you need to put a really good price yeah. say like I say 65 pound because you've got the five there you could do like say a pendant the bracelet yeah. uh, and earrings you could do a full set and you know I'd say even if you went to 30 40 pounds for each set mm -hmm. yeah um, and then 65 for the pendants or the earrings you know you're talking over three figures for three for three of those yeah but that is their value it is you know, and you know again you know we've had this discussion hell. quite a few times because a lot of you do have press stores we're not categorically saying put this price tag on them of course do your research into where you're saying where you prices are. will differ but let's just remember that you've got eight carats per yeah. gemstone in solid sterling silver that's gold plated they are high end They're and beautiful. I, to be honest um i'm obviously a been in the craft world for about five years now and if I went to a place where they didn't sell for six five pounds I wouldn't sell them there yeah. I would do something slightly different there mm. and take them to a place where they would yeah because they are quality so yeah why why sell them anywhere mm. yeah. yeah they're gorgeous beautiful um Ruby oh this looks spoiled today. I know. Um, this looks suspiciously like Ratna Pro Ruby to me. 100% um, natural. Now, I actually prefer the hue of Ratna Pro Ruby because you've got a real depth of colour, a real richness to the ruby. Um, it's like a real deep raspberry hue, isn't it? <laughs> I have no warning what? for that price tag whatsoever. £12.95 for Ruby. Only got 10 chances. Wow. GKRU56. Oh, Natural Ruby. 95% of the world's Ruby is treated in some way. That only leaves the entire world with 5% that is 100% natural. That's incredible. GK, are you? 56. Uh, Suzanne in Norfolk. Ooh, Joanne in Midlothian. Time's gone. Joanne's just got four. Oh, I, I, I love don't that. blame her. I don't blame her. That's like... We're talking ruby. Moment of panic, isn't it? It's <laughs> a big money spinner. Uh, you know, if we're talking making jewellery and making money, that's it, isn't it? Oh, it certainly is. Mike, there's one left. One left. Oh. Who's it going to be? <laughs> um, well done if you've got that, by the way. There's a lot of you with those in baskets. Okay. Let's... Ooh. 
Bronze pearls. Christmas. Oh. These are gorgeous. Look at the colour of these. They're so rich, aren't they? Uh, you know, and, and the thing is, we talk about prices here at Jam a lot because they're so ridiculously low. But whenever I look at pearls, you know, whatever form, even if they're cashy pearls, I just think, don't they look expensive? They really, and maybe this is the perceived value that I've got of pearls because obviously in the industry, you know, and anywhere else, you can pay an absolute fortune um, for pearls. But I just think they just look so high end. Whether you know they're in a simple stretchy or whether you're knotting them, whatever you're doing, they look expensive. And they feel expensive against mm. the skin. And they, they give you different colours as well, give you a different glow. Yeah. That is amazing against the skin. Gorgeous, Imagine that, you know, the pearlescence coming yeah. off that against your skin. It's beautiful. Really rich, isn't it? It that is. Colour? Yeah. Gorgeous. In fact, with your kit that we had, oh, all yeah. those pearls that we had with the yeah. antique bronze. Would you mind, actually, Helen, just passing me one strand of those pearls and some antique bronze wire? Yeah, That sure. would be great. I, um, just one reel off the front there, lovely. Or the reel. Yeah, that that's great. Any of them. Oh, bless her. Oh, see, no worries. Guys, I drop everything. No, it's absolutely fine. Knock everything off. Look at these. This was the kit that we had earlier on. Thank you, Helen. That's okay. Look at that for a match absolute match you've got there oh, haven't yeah. you i would definitely be getting those and those pearls were natural by the way in the kit and oh, if yeah. anyone's going to have a go at the dragonfly yeah so we've got the amethyst wings that we yeah. thought about earlier and what about using those pearls then in into the wings yeah because they're really nice shapes they're elongate oh they'd be perfect oh definitely i perfect. love 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 those so if you came in for the kit earlier on maybe get these pearls um as addition an addition to oh of course we saved you so much money on that kit we're at six pounds and 95 pence <laughs> n-e-g-p 86 is your code for that one 0800 644 655 or on the web at jewelrymaker.com and um, Carolla you're back in Weldon Jean in Cambria Collector in West Yorkshire Sean in Berkshire Lynn in County Durham Isabel in Angus Deborah in Leicestershire you've just joined me at 6.95 for pearls uh, I'm do you know what? I'm gonna really really research this weekend I'm gonna find the absolute lowest um, price tag for pearls somewhere else you know, I'm going to see what the lowest price I've is looked. that I can find. I really have looked, mm. and the, it's not out there. It's not out there at all. Uh, these prices, are J, they're just JM prices. Mm. They're pretty incredible, aren't they? Mm. And also, a film just said, you can't prove they're real if you're just looking on the web. I'm just going to see what I can do. You know, I'm going to come back, and I don't think I'll come back with a no. figure that's double figures. I think it will be three figures for, for genuine mm. pearls. I've seen synthetic pearls in three figures, and Helen. Me. I have sad, as well. Isn't it? Really sad. Yeah. Um, NEGP 86 uh, collected in Buckinghamshire. You've got two well done, so you collect in Cheshire. Sean in Berkshire, Lynn, Isabel, Margaret in West Lothian. You've just checked out on the telephone lines. Well done. NEGP 86. If you've got a phone in your hand, <laughs> just hold those lines. I'll be right with you. Mm. I love those in with that kit. Gorgeous. Um, I knew you were going to say that one. Mm. Oh, look oh. at these. Oh. Oh, these will be on and gone. How many? Five. Oh. <laughs> oh. 600 carats of your fuchsia crackled agate slabs. Look oh. at those. They are phenomenal. Again, you know, as, as simple or as elaborate as you like, you could put one of these into a long drop in a pendant. You could re-strand them all. In fact, just one of them with this necklace collar. Pretty fantastic there. Only, did we say five? Ah, oh, five chances to get your hands on 600 carats, 45 by 35 millimetres in size. You could do some wire writing across those. They're so huge, aren't they? MP, GP, 34 how low can we go maria in yorkshire she's got the first strand first strand straight down there's a lot of you with these in baskets i'd be very very quick 17 pounds and 95 pence that's five huge gemstones again i think that gold edge gives them that richness doesn't it it, it does uh, so I can imagine sort of mm. being in France or you know in the Provence sat with a, mm. a bottle of 
bubbly. I love that, a bottle. I love the fact that you said, <laughs> and then he said friend for life. <laughs> yeah. Friend for life. And Not a glass, a bottle. And a straw. Yeah, a yeah. <laughs> bottle and a straw. That's my girl. <laughs> and those, you know, elegantly swooned around my neck. Yeah, I don't know if they'll be, be elegantly happy. swooned around your neck after that <laughs> bottle, I tell you. Okay, GP. <laughs> 34. Uh, Zena in Greatland and Rosemary, you're there. A couple of you with these in baskets. Stay exactly where you are. Fantastic job there. Gorgeous. Hmm. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, agate. Oh, wow. Do you know these remind me of amber? Look at this one here. Got all the richness of colour of amber in there, haven't you? Aren't they gorgeous? Mm. Caramels and marshmallows, they remind Ooh, me of. caramel. <laughs> With chocolate. 500 yeah. carats of your top drilled brown agate drops there. 30 by 20 to 42 by 25 millimetres in size. And look at those colours as well. Yeah, nice Again, nice. all individual, all unique. That banding in every single one is spectacular and actually there's a lot more than I thought there was here actually I didn't realise how many I was covering up. Yeah. <laughs> um, you have two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve individual gemstones there, 30 by 20 to 42 by 25 millimetres in size. Um, is that Mike directing? Director Mike says pendants, yes pendants and again with your antique bronze wire. Why, wire, wire hemo flower. They're the petals. See it straight away. Yeah. Oh, look, they're perfect for petals. They are, aren't they? Oh, and it would fill yeah. that. You know, I was saying that. You know, when you're wire hemo and you do get that yeah. sort of shape, but then mm. you've got you need to fill it. Yeah. There you are, filled up straight away. Perfect. Well done, lots of you already there. Do you know what? We're going to go down to the lowest ever price tag for you today. Um, well done if you're already checking out. Thank you for trusting us. Six pounds and ninety-five pence. Oh yes. Love that. Six pounds and ninety-five pence. Add it to your order price tag. They are fantastic. And again, with this season, um, you know, everywhere you go right now, it's all about the autumnal hues, isn't it? You know, your mustards, your browns, your burnt oranges, your burnt reds. These are very, very on trend for this season. They really are. Um, Margaret in the West Midlands, collector in Louisiana. Well done to you. Um, I've got collector in Cheshire, a collector in Staffordshire, a collector in Suffolk there as well. Um, well done. Get these home. 30 day money back guarantee. Who's going to need that at £6.95? It's a no brainer, oh, isn't it? Yeah. Gorgeous. Well done. Oh, another colour for you. Do you know what? I love these. Now, it's entirely up to you what you want to do with these because just by themselves, if you wanted to take this chain off, you've got a 17 and a half inch length of chain there. To me, I'm thinking, do you know what? If you wanted to, you could take that off and use that in a necklace. So essentially you've got two pieces of jewellery here. This necklace collar will sit around the neckline just as it is. And I'll just show you there. If I unfasten the chain, I'll pop that around my neck for you so you can see that even when it's not done up, it will stay put quite firmly. And again, look at that lustre. I love the rose gold ones, my favourite. You know, mm. we've had gold, we've had <coughs> silver, uh, and we've had the rose gold coloured in both of these styles. Um, essentially, that's two pieces. Or you could wear it, if you wanted to, the other way round as well. So you can have the chain, um, the collar at the back, the chain dangling down the front. You could attach some gemstones to the end of their gorgeous cluster of gemstones. And again, if you've got a low back dress on, having that dangling down the back um, with your hair up, that's going to look fantastic, isn't it? Six pounds and ninety-five pence. You could kumahimo around these yes, or waihimo yeah, around yeah. these if you wanted to. Um, macrame around these if you wanted to. You could stamp on these. You can hole punch. The, the, do you know what? The collars and the cuffs that we've been bringing you lately are fabulous because there's so much you can do with them. Yesterday, um, guest designer Natalie was with us and she was uh, hole punching some of the collars and some of the cuffs there as well. Just seeing what else you can do with these. Um, QAPO10 is your code for this one at just 6 95 Add it to your order price tag. Um, and I'll just show you this chain as well. Look how substantial that chain is. You could quite easily attach um, one of our smaller That's lobster good. claw fastenings to that and attach charms, couldn't you? Ease, I mean, that is substantial, and even by itself, 
that looks really really nice doesn't it i love that yeah i definitely remove the chain yeah keep, keep it as uh, a talk type yeah. necklace i may even turn the talk around the other way yeah so that you've got the open points at the front well they are hole punched but already if i, if I so leave say one or two links of chain on them yeah i had lovely pearls so they sort of sat on your collarbone Ooh. and then the chain then you can utilize as you say yeah. as a bracelet it's lovely chain as well yeah really really so just leave a chain. little little tiny bit of chain on there just so that you can hang mm. either pearls or i'm thinking of flowers again because my head's yeah. going that way or remember the leaves in one of the packs we had earlier yeah imagine a couple of leaves just coming down the front offer mm. a couple of, so you don't have to just wear it as a front necklace yeah, it can be different there's loads absolutely loads mm. that you can do um with the necklace collars they're fabulous they really are well done if you got that one um let's have a look at these they're gonna be really really popular um the black star connectors these are so substantial i'm just going to give these a wipe do bear with a second i don't have a jewelry cloth over here um but there's such a surface area to these you can see all do you want to use the conditioning class i think i've done it you're all right thank you anyway oh look at that christmas tree there you could wire you could wire wrap those together can you there's a christmas tree right there i love that um 10 pieces in total you're going to get one of these you know as a charm again or in the center you know a centerpiece in your bracelet they are so so pretty stars hearts they're everywhere right now aren't mm. they seven pounds and 95 pence that's 79 pence per piece you've got there what would you do with these then Hannah? well i would actually put a little bit of chain yeah do that design that you just had mm. and i would actually put it onto a card so i'm given a gift but the card will be the stars into the yeah. shape of the the tree okay but then you could remove it and all you need to do is is hole punch in there and just wire it on so you're giving the card a christmas card and as a little present yeah. as well maybe on your stall yeah, you could do it as yeah. well yeah definitely and you could use them again for decorative purposes so you just, on that special so you just take take it off then you've got a necklace yeah you know that's a fantastic idea um and again just one of those i mean you can see how substantial that is on the wrist there you know either side of that with the black spinel that we had earlier on just delicate bracelet with that star that is so designer looking mm. i love that really really do uh, apw sorry apmw 68 is your code for those 10 of those you're going to get as well gorgeous you could wire hemo very simply like we did earlier a strand yeah curl the ends over pop the star then to hold the two together as your connector oh. my 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 brain is starting to think now <laughs> the oh. design of it love is coming it in. love it okay let's do these pliers for you then oh. these have never oh no once before once before um, Helen, you don't have these ones. I know, <laughs> I know, I I'm don't. Sorry, I, I saw them earlier. It's the oh, only one I don't have. The short nose no. pliers you've got here only been seen once before. So this is a fantastic, fantastic opportunity um, for you to get involved here. Um, as we were saying earlier on, zero on pliers. Uh, just the next level you know if you're starting out and you're using our pliers fantastic because our pliers are really really great um however the zero on range this is for the ultimate professional you know we are talking cream of the crop as far as tools go here and every single guest designer that i've worked with and spoken to about this range has said you know what i'm not going back I'm not going back to anything else because these are just so good. They are built for absolute precision. Um, built, made. Um, and as I showed you earlier on as well, because uh, guest designer Helen does have quite a few oh, pairs. Them so we showed you them all together um, because we were always saying, you know, they're built for precision, every single one. And we, you could see on all of them how fine the tips on every single pair so it allows you to get into some really tight spaces you know if you're working with jump rings and opening closing jump rings um if you're doing any uh, chain mail designs if you just need to get into tight spaces that's when they come into their own the zero on pliers you know with the um have you got the, uh, yeah, you have got the round nose pliers over there. I've got more bar yeah. for those. The, the round nose <laughs> pliers as well. It. You know, the tightest spirals, the yeah, smallest, most one, intricate yeah. work you can achieve with the zero on pliers. So they've only been seen once 
before. So this is a great opportunity this afternoon uh, for you to get involved and add these to your uh, to your tool stash. Helen and Gwent. Ployas, do you want them, Helen? Personal <laughs> Shopper is still online. Okay, yes, please, if, you, if she doesn't mind. I love this. I love it. <laughs> I'll, oh. I'll pop up and see her. She's actually got a lovely craft store. I better mention it now. Yeah, can actually, I mention the market? Yeah, of course you can. She's. I think she's up in Abergavenny oh, uh, this weekend. Jealous. There's a proper craft fair going on. Oh, is so, that? So um, yeah. So I'll, I'll uh, pop up and sort oh, her out there. Oh, if you're around that neck okay. of the woods. I wish I was this weekend. My mum and dad are this weekend. I really want to go. Yeah. The only oh, reason that, I didn't that, is because I'm here today. The rural market's fantastic, aren't oh, they? Oh, beautiful. Really oh, how fabulous. Hope that goes well for you, Helen. Uh, and you might see some jewellery making viewers as well while you're there. Uh, NSWB92 is your code for these. Add them to your order. 30 day money back guarantee. I love that. Feels like. Yes. Helen and Gwent, she's got them. <laughs> she's there on the web. Checks out. You're sorted. Thank you. You're sorted, I tell you. Uh, Veronica in Gloucestershire, collector in South Yorkshire. Stephanie in Sussex. Carolyn in Bedfordshire. Candy in London. Well done to you. Um, Angela in Surrey. Lots and lots of you there. And um, as you were saying as well, Helen, that you do have a problem um, with your hands as yeah. well. And we were all saying, you know, if any of you have dexterity problems, actually the resistance, the spring action in the zero pliers is so good you know you're not going to have any problems with these you're really not they really are comfortable to work with yeah. and they make work so much easier they do you know they're very light in the hand yeah they're, they're not heavy at all you get that uh, open action as i say i'm not really sure how they make because there's no big spring yeah i used to use one with a spring in the middle and yeah, the wires a lot of them get do, caught they? in there mm. and the yeah and, the, and your threads but this one doesn't no that spring so it's, it's it? really effective you can just see in fact it's just there Look. But most crafters, because we've constantly got tools in our hands, um, you do get that, uh, is it called tonight, uh, not tonight, just that's ringing, isn't it? Double tunnel? Yeah. RSI? Yeah. Just sort it's of a... It's strain injury, uh, yes, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So, obviously, then, you need something to fit your hand. Yeah. And it doesn't matter how big your hands are, I found. Anyone that picks mm. these up, they seem yeah. to fit. They're just so comfortable. Because I've got little on. hands, but, yeah. you know, they're perfect for mm. me and, and all the other... Design this as Fantastic. Well. Brilliant. Helen in Gwent. She's such a good I've friend. Got mine. Thank you, such Helen. Thank you, Aidan. <laughs> oh. Um, ooh, these are lush. Look at these. Um, these are huge as well. Jump rings for you. Quite possibly the biggest I've ever seen. 18 millimeters. And they're your twisted jump rings as well. These are fab, aren't they? So decorative. Ooh. They are Gorgeous. Oh, Fleur yeah. would love these, oh, wouldn't yes. she? She would absolutely love them. Um, they are really, really sizable. You could just use two of those in earrings, couldn't you? You know, in a pendant as well. They all the work's done for you there. Yeah. Uh, I would I would love to have a go. I must go on one of Fleur's workshops. Oh, you'd love it. Because yeah, that that I always thought could I manipulate the, the rings, but yeah. especially with the Zurons, it's yeah. like so easy now yeah. anyway. I think that I would love something like that to start mm. with. Yeah. They're really, really pretty, aren't they? So you could add those into your design. Um, and they've got that roping effect on them as well. Very designer, very high mm. end. And you could just simply, if you wanted to, use these as spaces with your bigger gemstones if you wanted to at all. Um, they are just so lustrous. Put aren't a few they? together like you're doing there and just pop uh, either a kumihima or yeah. wh whichever you want to do cord through there even if just yeah. a, that lovely the braided zari yeah, thread you've got it. the thick one yeah. will go through the middle of there kind of what a designer look yeah very much so really really would very nautical i love that 6.95 as well um great great price tag add those to your order cs az 37 is your code for these and you've actually got 20 pieces there 20 pieces in total and again if you want to multi-buy take advantage of that opportunity um, I would be Uli in Surrey. You are. Well done to you. Fabulous. Have a look. There is back. Um, who is that, Ali? <laughs> I had my hair cut, you know. Ali just said, well, your hair's really long. I had it cut as well, like a week ago. Yeah, I know. It's out of nowhere. Are they natural curls as well? Because it's really pretty. Well, my hair is wavy, although I did use um, my curling tongs to assist me with these waves today. But it stayed in, hasn't it? It's so yeah. lovely. Mine just goes, Power you just hold it, you Off know. Off a can of hairspray. 
Oh. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um, Citrine, have a look at these. These are beautiful. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Hang a minute. Just say that price tag again. I thought that's what you said. Wow. I'd be really, really quick. 45 carats of 45 carats of citrine. The peridot that we had earlier on would look gorgeous. Just gorgeous with these. Oh, they're stunning. You know, I think of summer automatically, but Citrine is actually November's birthstone. So if you're doing any of your birthstone jewellery, these would be perfect. But look at that colour. It's so warming. So warming. Um, four by one to five by two millimetres in size. And that's a 30 centimetre strand that you've got there as well. Oh, they do look like honey amber. They really, really do. I think this could quite possibly be one of the lowest priced Citrine strands I've seen that aren't nuggets. Um... There's loads of you there, by the way. At just seven ninety five, collect in Cheshire. You've got two, Helen and Gwent. Oh, I'm sure. I'll She's tell back you, in. I'll tell you why. Yeah. Citrine uh, is a is a big money uh, yeah. maker. Yeah. But not only that, all crafters mm. doesn't matter whether you're into jewellery or whether you're into woodwork will have Citrine on their stall because it's said to bring in financial prosperity. Did you know that? I didn't. Uh, yes, very attracted. The, <laughs> I'm the many, filling my basket, I am. So you will see a lot of craft people. Ah. And some people will just pop it in their till. Yeah. You know, in their oh. little tin where their money goes yeah. and keep it there. Mm -hmm. It's, uh, yeah, if you're a believer in all yeah, that. Yeah, if you like a little believe, bit of that myth there and folklore. We are. There you go. You never know. Our oh, hundred six double four six double five HB RU ninety five is your code for this one. Uh, Dawn, Bridget, Claire, Barbara, you're all there. Just make sure you're checking out as soon as you can. Um, and if you're on the telephone lines, stay where you are. Stay where you are. Um, is that still? Wow, how quickly has today gone? It's wow. absolutely flown, I tell you. It really, really has. So, Helen, how has your first um, mid-show been? Well, it's fantastic. I really you enjoyed, enjoyed myself. Yeah. I hope I didn't go too quick. I've got so much to share with everybody oh. that sometimes you get, you know... Yeah. Um, and um, there's so much more to learn about mm. why hemo as well. This was really is the basics. Yeah. Uh, and I uh, hope somebody is inspired to have a go. Oh, um, Jane in Greater Manchester says I've my lottery ticket with Citrine, but I haven't won yet. <laughs> gotta believe, we've gotta believe. Yeah, you've gotta put the thought out there, haven't yes, you? Positive thinking and all that. Um, well, Helen, I, we've really, really enjoyed having you today. It's been an Thank absolute you. pleasure, it really has. And I know you as viewers today have loved it as well. The, the text messages have been non stop um, about Helen's designs. Oh, DVD, lots of people want to see the uh, Waihimo DVD. I'm just going to go and have a word with management when I leave today about that because I think that would be fantastic. Um, do you know when you're back at this moment in time? Oh, gosh. Um, I, it's towards the end of October. October, so I think it's something like the 28th and maybe a little bit before yeah. then. Yeah, is it another mid-show? Is it, we it um, some demos? Oh, I'm ever so sorry. I no can't worries. remember. No I know worries. it's, uh, I've got about a week or two grace and yeah. then I've got quite a few in one go. Yeah. Okay, few brilliant. Shows. So um, look out for Helen. Go and have a look. Uh, see if you can find her on Facebook as well. Um, I will certainly let you know on my Facebook page uh, when Helen is up next as well, so you can go and find uh, myself on there and uh, get all the backstage gossip as well. There's a lot going on behind the scenes here, I tell you. <laughs> it's juicy! <laughs> um, Annie is up next. She's taking you uh, through the Late Show and she's joined by guest designer Wendy this evening as well. They've got lots and lots of treats for you. Um, so do make sure. Oh, she looks gorgeous. Oh, she looks stunning. She's up next. Um, I will be back with you on Monday. Whatever you're doing for the rest of your weekend, have a great weekend, have a safe weekend, and I shall catch you Monday at 1 o'clock. Take care. Bye. <laughs>mining for amber in fact let's not call it mining he's been netting for amber for 43 years we're standing on the edge of, of the baltic sea and many years ago and we're not sure exactly when but around 25 to 30 million years ago out here was a huge big forest 
Nobody knows exactly what the trees were, what variety of trees that, that, that formed the amber. Pliny the Elder had his, his own ideas. Uh, scientists, gemologists, botanists, all sorts of professions have had their own theories over the years. But just out here uh, is where the amber actually formed. And the day after a storm, if it's been a windy evening, the, the miners, the gem hunters, they come down very early, uh, some five o'clock, six o'clock in the morning, and try and beat everybody else to the few pieces of amber that wash themselves onto the shore. Do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. Join guest designer Rachel Norris on her Artisan Earrings DVD. Get creating stunning designs in no time at all through the fantastic tuition from Rachel. The easy to follow steps shown on this DVD will make you feel like you have your own personal tutor and experience many different techniques specifically designed for creating earrings. This DVD covers how to make your own findings, Aztec, Art Deco and Aphrodite earrings. To get your hands on a copy of this fantastic DVD, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. Do you want to tell everyone about the great purchase you've made from Jewelry Maker? Do you want to shout about the great service you've received? Then why not download the Jewelry Maker's Viewer's Voice app available for iPhone or Android and record a video that could be played on Jewelry Maker. Simply search Jewelry Maker Viewer's Voice in the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store and download our Viewer's Voice app straight to your phone or tablet. You can record as many videos as you like and send them straight to us here at Jewelry Maker. All you have to do is then carry on watching us as usual and wait for your video to be played. Download the JM Viewer's Voice app and you could be the next face we see here on Jewelry Maker. Good evening, welcome to Jewelry Maker. How are you? I'm Ali, it's fantastic to see you. Hope you're well, hope you're ready for a fantabulous night. Oh, it's not just good, it's not just going to be awesome, it's going to be. I was, I was going to say, it's going to be Mariolite. Well, that's all we're going to say. Mariolite is an amazing gemstone. You may have heard of it before. You might have actually heard of it previously as Scapolite. It's a fantastic gemstone. I've got it coming up for you tonight as the ultimate showstopper. This gem has only ever been seen by myself once in this channel. It is so, so collectible. It is a collector's dream. Here at Jewelry Maker, many of you will know, we're here to bring you all your jewelry making needs, anything you possibly need to make your own jewelry by yourself. This is outstanding. It's arrived today. You're the first to see it. It's 125 carats here. They're pear shaped. They go from eight by six to 14 by seven mil on a 20 centimeter strand. The only downside to this is there's 50 units. That's all we've got in quantity, a limited edition, but 50 is more than one, which is more than some, so it means we've got a good chance. Um, very, very limited. It is, for many, a collector's gemstone. You're going to adore it. If you love the optical phenomenon that you get with your cat's eye gemstones, with your feltzbar family, with your gorgeous sunstone or labradorite, you will adore what this gemstone has to offer. doesn't come across so well on the camera, but, of course, when you get it home, you've got your 30 day money back guarantee. You can really, really enjoy it. Take it out into the sunlight. Oh, my word. So that's coming up about 7.50 tonight, which is... Um, not long at all. Biwa pearls are coming up. Oh my word, they're amazing. I hadn't seen them. They hadn't arrived by the time I was um, ready to join you tonight. These are phenomenal. There's a gorgeous length on these. How many? <gasps> 38 centimetres. And you had peacock biwa pearls. I did not know exactly how awesome they were going to be. We had bronze bewa pearls the other day. Goodness gracious me, we didn't have enough of those. And tonight, these will be at half past eight. It's your superstar buy. There are only, again, 53 of these limited stock, but 
as I say, some is better than none. These are amazing. They've been seen but once before in March. I know, months ago. That's seven months ago since we've seen these. They are huge and they are so so affordable compared to what I thought they were going to be. I reckon they were going to be about 49.95. They are nowhere near there. If you've ever fancied huge 10 by 11 mil pearls, then these are 100% the ones for you. And amethyst squares and sapphires, not to mention one of the longest neon appetite strands we have in the building. 37, 38 centimetres, it's Gorgeous. Stunning or stunning? Talking of stunning, we've got a gorgeous lady with us tonight. Oh, yes. Very, very thrilled to be able to offer it. Wendy is our guest designer. How are you doing? Hi. I'm hey. fine. I'm really good. I love your piece. Now, this piece you were telling Rob about, and I missed it because I was trying to update Facebook. This is a very special piece you've made, isn't it? Yeah, it's a piece that I got for um, the stone from, I go down to Tembe um, quite a lot. I love mm -hmm. it down West Coast. And it was a stone I got from down there. And it's very kind of your game of Game of Thrones. Thrones. Oh, <laughs> I love like, it. It's a bit of a statement piece. Oh, absolutely. Um, Rob's loving it. Yeah, so many it. treats coming your way. Let me show you these. Now, this is the kit um, Wendy's been working with today. It's such a dream choice. It's, I'm going to be slightly biased because I adore moon, uh, rainbow quartz. Rainbow quartz? Moonstruck? I can't, I can't get my words out today. I adore rose quartz. You've also got within this kit a really, really special, you've got peridot and you've got prenite in there too, as well as your three different gauges of wire. I cannot believe how far this kit went. Earlier today, um, when Wendy arrived, I had asked if I could have a wee look at what, what she'd made, um, and she very kindly obliged, and then she took the second tray of jewellery made from this. When you, can we look at what's been made? Because this blew me away. I, I, Wendy, I can't believe you got all of this, all of this from just two reels of wire and three strands of gemstones. Yeah, it, that, it's literally the kit. I literally just used that, but it's my first time I've had kits, so it's yeah. kind of like Christmas, the two kits turned up, um, and I really wanted to use the whole amount to show people what you can make of it, and it literally is, it, it goes quite a long way. It very much does. Way, yeah. I mean, you've added in what one findings pack, maybe? Yeah, there was um, a findings pack, um, and that's it. I didn't that's it. That kit. I, so all else you need a little bit of chain, maybe some shepherd hooks, which yeah. you can of course get yourself. Maybe you've got some in your stash, or maybe we could supply some for you. It's not a problem. But but this blew me away. Um, we've got hair combs coming up later as well. I know there's one used within this. We have got some hair combs coming up for you today in bundles. We've got plenty coming your way, but right about now, love is in the air um, with our gorgeous Wendy. So, you've got your two different, uh, three different gauges, sorry, should I say, 0 0.6, 0 0.8 and 0.4 millimetre gauges in your three reels of wire. Each one has 10 metres. And then you've got yourself a variety of gauges. They've all been base with the copper, then gold, then sterling silver plated, then copper plated on top of that and then finish with a clear seal. How amazing is that? Do you know, we've been offering this and we weren't aware. Well, we were at the top, but I wasn't aware of this. None of my fellow presenters where we had training the other day and they just said, you are aware that all of our coloured wires silver plated. And I was like, what do you mean all the silver, all the wires? So you mean just the silver in colour? And they were like, no, Ali, all wire is plated with silver because silver takes a better colour co coating than just bare copper. So we've got your copper, then your silver plate on top of that, and then any colour on top of that, and then you've got the clear seal to finish it off. I didn't so, know that. Yeah, no, I didn't know that either. And I worked here for five years. <laughs> um, so yeah, so it's amazing things you find out. So you, all the wires that you've got at home, you've actually got silver plating before the colour because it takes the colour better which is awesome yeah. for all of us. And just think of the price, we thought, oh, actually, hold on, we got those quite affordably, so That's we're probably expecting to be paying a lot more. <laughs> Obviously, the silver colour wire is going to have two sort of coatings of silver and the gold plating will have, or gold colour will have silver and then the gold on top. It's amazing. Anyway, you've got three reels of wire. It's 30 metres across the three. The three gauges, 0 0.4, 0 0.8 and 0.6 millimetre, as well as my favourite, favourite treat, rose quartz plus 
pre-unite in your hearts and then peridot. Now the peridots are fabulous. They're they're not hearts, but they're also very, very close to it. They're they're pear drops, but they're very wide pear drops, which I think is I call them a puffy pear. Yeah. It's yeah, a close they, a close to a heart, isn't it's it? It's very close to a heart, yeah. And they can and, and this, as I've used them with the leaf for leaves and accent beads, but they they are very close. It's just that hasn't got the little the wee cleavage yeah. part at the top, but for the size of them, it would yeah. be very, very dainty to do that. So yeah. probably put the cost up if you were to do that, because of course a lot of work would go into that. So for the three strands, all plain in their polish, so they're all finished with a lovely soft luster, not too sparkly, but lovely. 32, no 34, forgive me, 34 pounds and 20 pence is the price we should be at. But let's go way lower, because it's, well love is in the air, <laughs> apparently. Um, let's get it down to two, 22 95 that's more than £10 off. Loving your work. Um, you may have gathered, you may or may not, I don't know if you put a post on Facebook, but it's our Rob in the gallery's hot seat tonight. Poor Sean's not so well today, unfortunately, but fortunately it means that Rob on his Friday night was free. They wasn't actually free. You're meant to be going out with some friends for some drinky poos, aren't you? And you very kindly came in to join us and then he's going to join them later. That is dedication. £22.95 and you get the three strands. And just looking at the jewellery that Wendy's made, just one piece, I imagine you would probably... Now, Wendy, we're new to working together, really. Yeah. <laughs> um, so for me, I'm not too sure about... And I'd love to know more, as many people who are your regulars, they'll all know this, but for anyone who's maybe tuned in for the first time, for you, do you sell your jewellery? Do you make it for yourself? Or? I make it a lot for friends, yeah. um, for family, for gifts. Mm -hmm. um, I'm one of those people that just likes to make things. Yes, I like have, me. Yeah, I have loads of hobbies, take them to the extreme. Um, but I do like to make, so sometimes I sell pieces. So would you, I mean, these pieces you would have as, um, any of them price point wise, would you have as stocking fillers, would you have them as a main gift, how would you gift these? I think these? Um, the larger pieces and the wire wrap pieces would be main, um, main gifts, gifts. and the smaller pieces, um, birthday presents, things like that. Um, Lovely. It's, it depends, I mean, I'm not organised enough to get up, get, go and do a stall and do all that sort of things yet. Yeah. Um, but if I was going to do that and sell these pieces, I would be looking at 30, 35, 40 pounds for some of these pieces. The, the wire wrapped heart would be more. There's in a fact, lot of work in the end one. Wow. So <laughs> we're actually going to, the one in the middle, we're going to get to have a look at today, yeah. actually, which we'll probably do right about now, actually. So I'll, go, I'll come over and join you. Okay. Your side of the table is much more fun. Um, and I'll take my friend here, Mr. Paddy. Oh gosh, lots and lots of you have got this already. So £22.95, you've got sort of quite spring-like gemstones with your rose quartz and your pre night and your peridot. Whether you want to keep them together, whether you want to use them separately, that's completely up to you. You might just think, actually, that's quite a good deal for the wire and the gemstones. I'll use them at separate times, so whichever is most convenient to you, whichever you prefer. What do you think of the desk? How, how many times have you been inside this side of the um, studio or is this your first? My, Forgive me. My first show was, you'd only been here about two, three days. So oh. It was all really nice. Oh my gosh, so yeah. is it even a bit more settled now for you? Yes. Yeah? Yeah, slowly it's been manic for a little while. But it it's has, lovely. isn't it? And I love your, your ruler has been drilled yep. down in the middle as well because it was sticking up the other day. But um, our very kind IT gentleman, <laughs> as um, Leah said, it wasn't IT, <laughs> the technician <laughs> guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love it. She's like, she's in the gallery. She went, I forgot his name. Have you remembered it yet? Adam. Adam came in and, um, no, it wasn't Adam that screwed it down, though. It was the other gentleman. They're not both called Adam, are they? I don't know. Either way, we got <laughs> screwed down, so hopefully we're not going to bump our wrists on this or catch ourselves. So you should be hazard free now. Well, that's the best for me. Well, <laughs> we can always get in trouble. And you're next to me, so it could be very interesting. So I'll let you take it away. You're going to okay. show us the central piece, actually. Yeah. Well, I say central piece out of the four, but this butte here, which you've incorporated a little bit of hamming, hammering with. Mm -hmm. We do have a, a block coming up later, um, which would be handy if you have a hammer. I think we do too. Coming up. Um, that's coming up in a bundle, actually, so oh. that'll be perfect. We've got plenty of other wires coming up, and if you need some chain, we can get some for you. Yeah. But that's... Um, Gauge wise wire, what did you start with or what um, you started with just now? It was the 0.8 Perfect. I started with for the main framework. Right, and you um, get that. And then the 0.6 to wrap mm -hmm. around and the 0.4 for the hot. So the all flowers. three gauges we used I in did. this one. I Fabulous, I love it. 
on You've the got wire. them, use them. <laughs> Brilliant. I did. <laughs> so where do we start? How do we go about okay. making this? Basically, would you mind passing the... Sure. Cool. Here you go. Okay, so basically we're going to start with the wire work frame mm -hmm. and bring it up to the top and hammer some of these. Awesome. Okay. So I'm going to start with that. And your first piece, I uh, measure, sorry Ali, can oh, I just... Oh, sorry, yeah, of course. <laughs> I measure three pieces to around 20 inches and cut three pieces. And that's the point eight. Yeah. So if you're at home and you're thinking, I've got some point eight at home, go and grab it, join in. Yeah, I mean, I had a few, um, I did have a few gemstones left on this and I would have, if, if I, I'm not allowed to, but I would have added some more yeah, wire. Yeah, of course. And it would have made a lot more pieces, to be honest with you. Oh, well, there you go. Fantastic. Okay. So you need to cut. Sorry. We've got a flying reel. <laughs> Plenty that on that. Toe. <laughs> it wasn't your toe. It was. Oh, no, are you OK? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Oh, it really was your toe? It was. <laughs> my oh toes have had worse than that. OK, so. You're all right? <laughs> yeah. OK. Yep, I'm fine. Because that's a heavy reel. <laughs> it was a bit of a big reel. Steel toe caps next time. <laughs> okay. The wire hasn't quite made it. <coughs> oh dear. Okay. So, first of all, I need it's to cut right. three pieces that length. And I need one more piece. Sorry, I just went all back okay. up. And I would cut this one quite a bit longer. So, maybe the full metre. Sorry, I'm using this because I used up all of the other kids as well. Ah, no, uh, no, it's fine. Well, you're getting the point eight anyway. That's just a... Yeah. you just got a bigger reel there. It's from easier the, to unwrap the off this one. There okay. we go. So, your first part to this is... You need to just take your wire and twist slightly. You don't want it completely twisted, so I'm not using the wire work twisting tool for this. Just with your hands. Twist. Okay? Mm. And then with your flat nose pliers, find the center point. Okay? And bend your wires up slightly. Alright. Once you've done that, come back to the top and you want to form the heart piece. So take your right hand wire and bring it down to the middle of the heart, okay? And then your left hand, and I push out with my thumb and it just naturally forms the wire wants to go that way anyway, and bring it down. Okay, so you've got, you've got the heart and you've got the two pieces coming down the centre, okay? Now, go back to the top crown of your heart, and at this point, just make sure it's where you want it to be and the shape's roughly right, okay? Then take your back wire and pull all three through the front of the heart. I'm doing this backwards, sorry, so it's... And pull no, it you're fine, thank you. Thank you for um, sorting it out without the overhead. We thought it would be ready and reading to go by today, but I haven't heard otherwise I and know. it's not there, so... I was hoping, but never mind. Sorry about that. We'll manage. And then take the front what three wires and pull them back through the back of the heart. And if you just push, I'll turn it around for you. If you just push these two together, like that, take your flat nose pliers and crimp. Just squeeze them together and they'll lock and hold. Okay? So you've kind of got pear shape now. Okay? Now take the centre piece and push. And then when you turn it around, you've got a perfect little heart shape. Oh, it's lovely. <laughs> it's cute. Okay, these, whichever wires you choose, but the th one set of three go upwards mm -hmm. and splay them out. And then this set of three, I'm going to take one of the wires and I'm going to bind this centre heart piece, bring it around the front, through the heart, 
and back up and around. Then take your next wire and do the same. Bring it around and I go around each wire. It helps to keep them in place mm -hmm. and bring it back up. Okay. Now, just while you've finished that wee section there, just to let you know, we have got that point eight, same gauge that you've, you've done the, the basic mm. structure with in turquoise for you. We do have your second kit, which is coming up with the hematite and the pearls yeah. and turquoise pearls that this will go perfect with. We'll also go lovely with the rose quartz as well, don't get me wrong, but it's just so for those of you thinking, all oh, right, I love what, what uh, Wendy's doing. I really want to get that gauge. Have you got another colour? Here's the other colour that we have at the minute for you in turquoise. I'll let you carry on, sorry. That's okay. And then move to the other side and take your wire. Again, you're, you're just binding the top part so that the wires don't move at a later time. And move up. And then again with the next one. And that. Bring it to the front and squidge. So take your flat nose pliers. I love that technical term, squidge. Squidge. That's what you do babies in it, a squidge. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that should hold all of these wires in place. Now, I'm going to take my flush cutter pliers and I'm going to cut. I want the spirals on this. Oh, yes, they're at the top, aren't they? Yeah, they're at the top, and you've got the longer pieces going down to the shorter pieces. Mm -hmm. So you do exactly the same when you cut it. You cut two top pieces slightly longer. Ah, yes. Okay, so your two top pieces will be about there and I there. love flush cutters. These are gorgeous. Aren't they? I've only just got them. We had them the other day and lots of people were debating about them. Don't, you don't debate them about a flush cutter, oh, do these, you? These, just go for it. I, I've been playing with them since I had them. I've literally I've just got you don't them. Don't put them down, do you? And they are gorgeous. They're, They're really good. Sorry, I didn't tell you. It's eight pounds and ninety-five. Well, that's because the price wasn't there. Eight pounds and ninety-five pence for fifty meters Ooh, in the turquoise. That is really good. It's a really pretty color. Yeah. That's perfect with the other kit. Yes. Really lovely with the other. Yeah, kit. with the kit that's coming up later, there isn't um, the silver wire with that silver color yeah. wire, but there isn't the or silver plated wire. There isn't the turquoise. This would be a great addition, or um, maybe it's an alternative. We've got we've got appetite coming up tonight. We've got Biwa pearls in the peacock color. Combine that with the 0.4 um, silver wire. Mm, really from the kit? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, amazing. Yeah, it makes a long way. And you've got one mil in the red just because Rob's feeling a little bit happy mm -hmm. today. So he's going to do that so we don't interrupt you again. Um, so we've got the red, which is one mil gauge. And that's at double the size. That's 100 metres. Mm -hmm. You're fair doing, oh gosh, you really could do your exercises with that. I was doing it with my chopped tinned of tomatoes the other day because I didn't have any weights. Got some fizzy tomatoes to use now. <laughs> um, that is lovely. Oh, I like that. Right. Um, 100 metres at point, well, no, no point at all. One mil gauge. And that's great for your structural. Could you use the one mil for that? Oh, or yeah. would yeah, you yeah. maybe just not use three? Or would you would you still with, use the three? Yeah, with one mil, it's a lot thicker and it's yeah. a lot more sturdy. If you, this one is quite a delicate heart. It will add to the weight of a piece. Yep. But sometimes you want that. Yeah. If you hold have larger stones, this is the ideal for. <gasps> so that's a possibility because I'm thinking red hearts, Valentine's mm. Day, quite oh. lovely together, and 100 meters of it, you've got plenty. You can make look, mini hearts, you can make big hearts mm. in all of the designs that you've made throughout this. I mean, some of the structural work with that being again with the point eight, could that be yeah. substituted with the red? If you if you think, oh gosh, I love that, I absolutely want to make that. I'm thinking Valentine's Day. I mean, I, I I've used point eight because again with the kit, but yep. um, I quite often use point one and point um, four for especially with I've got larger structural pieces, right? And I quite often use the the one mil, brilliant, and sometimes higher if you want. If you want the structure, it makes it easier when you're wire wrapping for it to stay put. Yes, if you've um, got a thicker gauge. Yeah. So that's there. I hear Alison Tarry's in. Guest designer Alison Tarry's showing an interest tonight. Hiya! She's loving her wire work too. Twenty-seven ninety-five is your should be price. But as Rob's not supposed to be here, and bless Sean's sick, Martha's out the back. We're just Martha's our executive producer. She said we're, she's going to be there if we need her tonight. No. Not that we, we don't need her, but we're just trying to make her feel like. She, she could be of use, like we can get her running in the gallery now go, why did you go to 1495? We'll say just to get you out your seat, just to get you up and about, Martha, just to get you involved. <laughs> <laughs> she is, she's literally in the conservatory at the moment. £14.95, we are in a house. 
I know it's bizarre, it's but it's awesome. Uh, 14 pounds and 95 pence. You've got 100 meters in there. Jennifer in Hampshire is straight in. Lots and lots of messages coming through. Catherine's in, Cumbria's in, Claire's in. Lovely to see you. It's only 14.95. It's not even half. What? It's 14. It should have been 27.95. Taking way over ten pounds off that, Rob. Are you feeling all right? Well, you're not feeling all right, actually. You're meant to be out drinking with your friends, aren't you? I love that. I know, right? You would rather be with the jewelry makers anyway. And thank you very much. Rob's telling me I've had a message about my dress. Not just a message. Apparently, you like my dress. Thank you very much. I got it when my friend got married in Mexico, and she came back and she had a wedding reception with all her friends, and it was a Mexican-themed wedding party. And I thought this was mm. Mexican, and I had lots That's of little stick. Mexican things and flour in my hair, and, and it was all good and fun. So thanks for that. Thanks very much. It cost about twelve pounds from um, a shop with look where it's new and new look. I think. I think that's where it was from a while ago. Anyway, <laughs> let's get back onto this because that's much more exciting than the price of my dress. It was really expensive. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. We were cutting the, the that was the top <laughs> ones, and they were the longest ones, and they were going to go down from there. Sorry, okay. forgive thank me for interrupting. No, thank you. I've got a bad memory. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You were listening. The BBC were talking about that the other day. People don't use the memory anymore. We use our mobile phones, apparently, mm. and you use notes and save things. Can you remember our mobile phone number of anybody? My husband's. Well done, you. I can remember my mum's, and that's because it used to be mine. <laughs> and my own, and I think that was it. Anyway. Okay, yeah. Okay, so we've done the top wire, we're going to go to the middle wire, and we're going to cut that slightly shorter. And then the last wire, just slightly shorter again. Okay? And you do that the other side. One, and then two. That one's a little bit. Okay? So once you've got to this stage, you take your 0.8 wire and you cut a longer piece. So this one I'm going to go to about a metre because it's going to wrap around the heart. Oh, Wrap go. around wrap the around heart. The heart. Like I love it. I'm feeling the love. <laughs> so with this piece, you take it and pop it into the into the, the corner there. Bring the tail, the smaller tail end around and pop it in the front. Now this piece you're going to wrap all the way around the frame of the heart and all you need to do, you need to do this randomly so you just anchor it around and wrap and then around and then bring that curve in. Each time I'm just curving with my finger and this wire is really soft so it'll just well oh, that's leave. lovely the way that just flicks there yeah it's just it's, it's such a flexible wire it's really amazing um and you just keep wrapping this around the heart until you're happy and forgive the me the wire. gauge on that one was 0.8 oh that's oh, the same gauge yeah is it? i've used the same on the on um on the, on the actual frame fab okay wrap it round you see that okay Put it through. We've had a message regarding the necklace you're wearing. <laughs> Lots of messages. Can we see them? I love reading messages. Um, we're going to get the graphics back in for the kicks, and a lot of, a lot of you want the kit, but the, the necklace you're wearing. Maybe we should um, have a look at trying to get a, a design inspiration on that very oh. necklace. <laughs> That'd be nice. Mm, we've had a message to say um, from Amanda in Norfolk to say it's not coming up on my screen, but I'll try and read it from a distance. I am mesmerised by your necklace. It's stunning. I want to make one. How? Love your dress, Ali. Oh, thanks. Thank you. It, um, well, possibly we could do one on this one. Yeah, we could do. We could do like a two-part. Yeah. In one show, we could do the first one for first part, second one for the second part. Maybe do something like that. We'll put it forward to Pip. And another message from Eleanor from the example. Hiya! You said, um, I'm just reading it that way. Forgive me if I'm rude. The other kit sounds amazing as well. What time is it happening? The show has been fantastic all day. I've had a very happy shopping today. Oh, lovely. Um, Eleanor, we'll do that one about 7 o'clock. That's all right, T. Okay, we've got to this stage and we've wrapped around as much as we want around the um, frame. Take your wire and just basically wrap it around the bale again. So you're just anchoring this in place. I wrap it around twice and then back up. And cut this one off. Okay, so there's your basic wire heart. Uh, sorry if I'm off screen. Do you need to, ooh, animal. This is my little anvil and it's really cool. 
<laughs> We've got one coming up later. From, I don't know if it's as cool as yours, though. This is one of yours. This um, one we've had in... Do we have a hammer at all? If I had ha We actually have one coming up, but whether I've got it already... I can get it. This Coral's off to find it. She's got it. That was, that was hard to find, wasn't it? The one with the big <laughs> hammer sticking out. <laughs> she found it. It's our Amble Lake. Where's oh, this Amble? Thank you. Yeah, I love that. I love Coral. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Okay, so this one, basically yeah. what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to the top of the point. Just there. And I'm going to curl these. I'm going to do this quite quickly around. So you're now making the very top. Yeah, well, you'll have more time at home, won't you? Yeah. You can so take I'm your time. Do we this. just want to get the. Otherwise once I we won't know exactly what to do and we've got the idea of it, we can take as long as we need, really, don't we? Yeah, I won't get time to sort of hammer it, and I like the hammering bit. Oh, no. <laughs> you love it. Directors hate it. I do. It's all that banging. They're like, oh, no. Sorry, Rob. Okay, so you make the three just spirals and you bring them in like that. And then the last one, just spiral. And it's just a basic spiral. We've done this before, so you just hold your pliers in and turn. Now these don't want to overlap. Now I don't know if I'm going to hold Can you see this? Okay, when I hammer these, I flattened these in the original one. So you just simply hammer. It doesn't take much pressure. And you simply hammer the top. And if you pull your hammer out, it, it spreads the wire. A lot easier. And there you go. And you just take each, three, each of those and you give it a hammer. And... But just make sure you don't cross the wires over your, or you'll compromise their strength. Okay, so we've got to this point, and your next point is going to be your little flowers. Sorry, I was doing the thing to Rob, he was looking for a board. <laughs> All I can see is your hands going like this. Sorry, I was looking at Rob, and then Leah was like, Everyone can see you. I was like, oh. <laughs> Thank Leah. No, it's fine. Whatever. Oh, sorry. Maybe it looks like a plonker on the telly. I'm board. very quick. He needs a board. I'm trying to explain to Coral where the board is. <laughs> you got any anyway. Money? What do you need? What can I get you? 0 0.4. That's 0 0.6. That'll be fine. Okay. Okay. So take a piece of your 0 0.4 or your 0 0.6. It's entirely up to you. And so that's quite good that you, if you do run out of the 0.4 or you're working with something else and you don't have that colour, you could always yeah, these maybe are do quite, a 0 0.6 these are quite something else. wide, so they'll, uh, 0 0.6 will go for easily. Lovely. Now, I wrap five, put five of these onto a wire and I do them and then, ooh, lost them. Okay, once you've got it on, bend your wire over the back of it. Can you see that? Yeah, okay, and twist. And you just need about two twists for this one. Then take your longer piece and thread on your next. Just remember, I always thread these on, on the crown first. Ah, uh, through the top part, the yeah, cleavage, the widest part. Yeah, because otherwise you get to the bottom and they're, they're pointing the wrong way. Yes. And I, I oh, get, um, gosh, I bet many of you have done that, haven't you? I'd it, probably do that if I'd... Uh, yeah, I haven't worked with many heart gemstones. It will look as if it's on the wrong way, but you're going to twist it. Yeah. So when you twist it back on itself, it puts it up it right. Put it the right way. Okay, and then twist. And I think on this one I did four. Yeah, you did. Yeah, on the top one, the first one you did yeah. before. So you Ooh. twist. And your next one. And twist. Sorry, I'm going to get no, the eye in a minute. <laughs> I'm taking myself out many a time, don't you worry. It's a pesky wire. I know, I know it wasn't... Was it intentional? No. <laughs> no. I know it wasn't. It's all right. That's why I'm I take myself out about a gazillion times. Having to wear glasses when you're dry working is good. Well, it doesn't help when my face is like this. I don't know what's what you're doing. It can't be okay. easy. Last little heart. Wire it on. Put it down. And put it backwards on itself and twist okay so now you've got four little twists okay yep 
basically all you need to do is wrap these around each other. It gives it strength. And what, you, what you'll end up with is they're slightly closer together. And, that's, and then you just shake the petals into the position you want. Okay, turn that one a little bit. Okay. And then you should end up with a little flower shape. I used one of the small peridors. I don't know if the little peridor oh, will yes. go through this spiral. They're mandala. gorgeous. These are beautiful. They're a stunning little really stones. Really lovely. Um, and really clear, eye clean. Clarity on they them are. is gorgeous. The clarity is... Uh, it will go through some of them and it won't through others. Yeah, the strand, the strand probably okay. more in the middle, it might not, but... So you basically wire you the same one of thing those on, on and yep. wrap them. And then you take your little heart flower, put it onto the... Uh, can you see that? Put it onto the frame. And with your long tail that you left, you simply wrap it onto the fly frame. Flame. And... Keep and wrap it if you can see it. Wrap it around each petal. It will stabilize it and pull it slightly. And then wrap it around again. Okay, can you see that? And pull. Okay. And again. And each time you'll find that it is forming a little frame behind it. Yeah, it'll start to to make it that little it, bit stronger. It becomes more stable, yeah. What you can do at this point is continue, it, once you've wrapped it, mm -hmm. I take it and I wrap it around the flower. Ah, around the bottom of yeah. it. Yeah, just to get it, pulls the flower petals up slightly. Yeah, almost as a flower it is naturally, isn't it? Yeah. Flowers aren't naturally flat. And again, it That's gives me it being a flat flower, but they're never <laughs> flat. <laughs> I didn't realise you were coming back, thanks, Leah. <laughs> You'll never be a flat flower. Flat flower. <laughs> And yeah, with, this, with this tail no, end, wouldn't, Mike. you can actually just continue and make um, more of a binding around your heart if you want to. A lot of binding heart. <laughs> binding around your heart. Sorry. Yeah. So easily pleased. <laughs> Bless it. Okay. And you can just tie it off like that. And again, the same with this part. So you've so got your framework. And then for the other peridot flower, did you do the same? Exactly the same, but I did it with five, five. petals, and that was... Let me turn it around so you can see. And then again, the same with the final one, which is three petals. Yeah. And then you just used a oh, fancy spacer instead of the peridot yeah, those Yeah, they times. were in one of the you've just defined in this packs. Yeah. Um, but you can equally just use the little peridots, two or three in the middle. Yep. If you did... If you wired the same technique, mm -hmm. two or three of the little peridors, yeah. and push them through, you get a centre ah, petal Ah, that matching. would be lovely. They're and then you've done nice. some sort of tiara twist ideas with the peridor around yep. the top of the frame. Mm -hmm. And I'll show you some of those that I've, in the other kit I've got. Yeah, so perfect. I'll that so we can you. go through that there. Yeah. And then just as a note, as you suggested earlier, when you're attaching your chain, the one side where there's no gemstones is, is no problem at all. But yeah. the other side you were mentioning, the way you would attach that would be slightly different. Yeah, I mean, when I attach the chain, because it's heavier mm -hmm. on this side, the, the heart will go lopsided. Yep. So I attached um, an, a jump ring to, to this part yep. and fastened it. And then slightly lower down on the, heart, the other heart side. And that will pull up one side and allow a little bit of room on the other. So it, it will sit on your neckline. So when you see it from behind, if I turn that round for you, you'll see that you're looking at it thinking, oh, actually, it's d not 100% accurate yeah. as to where it is, but that's on plan because when you wear it, as you can see, it's hanging perfectly. Thank you so, so much. We love that. So many people have gone for this. Oh, um, any questions you have, please do send them in. Any texts that you've got, anything that you, you want to ask our gorgeous Wendy, please do. Don't hesitate. If it's a, a question you want to know the answer to, then it's a good question. If it's not jewellery based, then I don't know. We might yeah. not answer it. <laughs> we'll decide whether we want to yeah. answer it or not. Mm -hmm. These are fantastic, but we will absolutely let um, the design team know um, about your love for Wendy's necklace, and we'll see if we can maybe get that into maybe take two separate at least yeah, two separate design would, yeah. inspirations. But we can we can work with that. We can sort it out. 
with with planning mm -hmm. mulberry colored freshwater pearls oh they almost have this high end gloss there's a particular shop that do these fancy desserts and they do a gloss over like a mm. raspberry dessert and i really want it that reminds me of that glossed raspberry. Mm, what does it glazed. make you think of? Yeah, that's the one. Glossed. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not going to need a painted raspberry. That, that reminds me of um, oh, the, the Christmas you, cranberries. Cranberries. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, then they get in the sauce, though. <gasps> that is what it reminds cranberry me of. Cranberry sauce. Warm cranberry sauce. And it's perfect Christmas colours. It is, it really, is isn't it? Lovely. I saw something today, actually, this colour. Um, and I possibly might have bought it, but I'm not going to tell you what it was because <laughs> it was a Christmas present that I've got in advance. What for yourself? Really well, no, <laughs> <laughs> for a, a for, um, for a very very dear friend. So I'm thinking I don't want to say just in case they're watching because then they'll know what the present is. I'm trying to be organised. The lady said, "Oh, is this for yourself? Are you getting ready for the winter?" I was like, oh, "No, I'm not ready for Christmas." <laughs> and she was like, "All right, love." Um, mulberry colour. They are delicious. Although in saying that, I'm thinking autumn time with your sort of autumn leaf tones. You're yeah. at, I'm looking at the, the necklace you've got on with the antique your sort of bronze and coppers. Coppers, bronzes. Yeah. That, that I was coming at us, I was coming up, I was looking at the trees and everything's going that reds and oranges and colour. And they go perfect. Because there's six For six ninety five. Wow. I've just noticed Take that. Them. Yeah. Grab them. They are fantastic. Mm. Oh, I'm really excited for you. They're very, very sizable. They're baroque, which gives you that lovely flat edge at one side and then shaped at the other. Do you find them as a jewellery maker easier to work with or delightful to work with or yeah. not so? If you're making things like the flowers or you might, you're lying something flat mm -hmm. onto a wire, yep. they're perfect because sometimes when you've got around and you're doing wire, well, I do a lot of wire work, but um, it's hard to sit it and it bulges. Whereas with those, yeah. you can sit it flat. You've got you've flush on one got, side. Yeah, you've still got the nice, nice curvature on the top. So, for example, if we were to put that on a finger, if you, you pick whatever one, say this one, just because it's the first one that I've gone for, you might not be able to see because there are so many on that strand, but if I tilt it that way, can you see how flat it gives mm. me that flat against the finger, but still that raised, yeah. gorgeous be beauty. Um, maybe with silver wire, yeah, we've got some silver wire coming up with diopside, maybe. That red, that red, got that red wire, maybe. Oh. Is it nice, little, is it? I'm oh, not sure. Depends what mm. you're making. Yeah. Oh, a lot of love for these pearls. Lots and lots of you treating yourselves to them. Again, approximately 38 centimetres, but I'll go with um, the ruler. I've got our inches, so we've got about 15 and a half inches, which, if my memory correctly, is not far off 37 centimetres. I don't. Um, <laughs> I only work in inches. So I'm old. I'll, do you know what? I'll take them with me to my desk and check. Thank you so much. Thank you. I love that. We've got another design inspiration to go, and you've got some yeah. treats to play with, as far oh. as I'm aware. Uh -huh. Or Rob is working on it. <laughs> I love it. Uh, They've yeah. forgotten that bit. <laughs> well, Rob actually wasn't meant to be in today, so he's working away trying to get some second samples of lots of treats for you. So yeah. there'll be plenty of your for, for you to do. Once uh, Rob sorted it out. Rob usually finds lots of things for me to He does, do. doesn't he? Yeah. <laughs> Most best designers he say does. that. He's mm. Who calls you a slave driver? Guest designer Alan. <laughs> Taskmaster. <laughs> yeah, oh, there, I like that one. I love that, Taskmaster. Enjoy these pearls, they're fabulous. I'll quickly measure them on my little desk. They are, oh, a telefib. 15 and a half is 39 and a half centimetres. So it's actually longer than 38, even better. Wunderbar. Where did they come from? Do you know? Box number by any chance? Nine. Perfect. Um, just to let you know, they're gorgeous colour pearls to go with the teal wire. There, there. Did you say nine? No, five. There doesn't seem to be anything in any box. I'm not entirely sure where the storage boxes might be. Hello, if you've just tuned in. I normally have what I'm doing and know what I'm on, uh, on but um, we've got lots of special treats tonight because both Rob wasn't sure what was going on tonight, neither were I, because uh, he wasn't meant to be in. I was, but it um, doesn't mean I know what's going on. Have a look at these. Here we go. Storage boxes. Got three of these. Oh, I saw somebody working with these the other day, actually. It made me really, really happy in the beating buddy room. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking, yeah, I love seeing storage boxes because usually I get them, they're all empty. I don't get to see what people stash in their storage boxes and obviously we've all got different things we want to put in them. What do you put in yours, Wendy? Everything. Everything? I've got a massive thing about storage. I'm not very good at organising things yeah. and, I, and I'll take them out and leave them, so I'm not that good, but I love... Ah, you look quite organised. Your makeup tray looked quite organised today. I use those sort of things yeah, for do. my makeup. Yeah, <laughs> it's so 
um, the bits and pieces that are left over. Um, I've used them for crane it, well, kids' stuff in the back of the oh, car yeah. when they're going places. But I have a big thing for storage. I love boxes. And well, um, I think this is for you. These should be 14.85. You've got hang or on each one if you want to tidy up and hang them on the wall. Mm. Depends if you want holes in your wall or not. If you've got a cupboard, you might want to do it. I don't know. Um, you've got inside each one. Oh, I'm opening it upside down. There we go. Pops down. Um, opens up inside. You can remove these if you wish. Change them around. Then there's single ones in there. They're removable too. So it's up to you how you want to store uh, and what you want to store in it. You can take them all out. You can take some of them out. It's up to you. Price point down to £8.95 for the three of them. Wow. Now, for a, a regular storage lover, what do you think of that price point? That, that's a really good price point. I've, yeah. bought, I've paid a lot more for it. And those are, the thing I like about those is that not only the small centre sections come out, but the middle one does. Yes. Quite often you'll get the boxes where the small sections will come out, so you've yeah. got, you can put things long ways. But you can't put wider. Yeah, you can't just have in. the whole length of the box if you wanted. No, length uh, and width. So that's quite nice that you've got. It's not often you find both sections coming out. Yeah, yeah no, it all comes out. Every little bit. Mm. So you could have, for example, a flat. You could use it as a packed lunchbox if you wanted. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's that big. But likewise, if you're if you're away and you take your pieces away in it, um, your, your components, and you make something up, it means that, like I make bigger uh. pieces, you can actually store. Put it your in finished store piece. It, yeah. So you can keep them separated for before you make it, and then once you made it, take them all out yeah, and I then them. Job done. Six ninety five for the three because it's Friday night and Rob's feeling it. That's brilliant. And it's Friday night. Da, 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 the West Side. Don't know the rest of the tune. <laughs> no, I'm just pleased I remembered it. Is it West Side? West Side. I'm from the West Side of Scotland. There we go. Eight pa six pounds. My favourite number. It's my favourite number. Six pounds and ninety-five pence for the three. Now it doesn't matter if they don't fit through your letterbox. It, it will still be the same post and packaging in any one day. A wee message here from Kellyanne in Stirlingshire. Oh, hello there, my friends from Tillicutry. Um, the ha little hanger is also great for using to, uh, as handle tags to pull out with ease when the boxes are high. Fab price too. Oh, I like that. Mm. It's a really good idea. I was trying to get a shoe box out the top of my cupboard today and literally pulled it, lid fell off, everything fell on top of my head. It was all the shoe cleaning products oh. so I was like, oh, shoe polish bonking off my head. So um, I really like that idea. That's much That's easier. Good. You could actually put even a little bit of cord or ribbon or something on it to, if it's oh. going to be at the back of the cupboard or to make it a little bit easier as well. It's a great idea, Kellyanne. Little tags just with it hanging down and then you know which one you're pulling, what's Absolutely. in it. Absolutely. Oh, I your work. I that. Really Kellyanne really Sterling shirt is on it. Loving your work, sweetheart. Right. Let's put these over there. I quite fancy those. They're quite sturdy. They're very substantial. They're not flimsy in any way. No, they're I'm nice, loving them. Nice stacking size as well. Mm. Right. Should we do some teal pearls? Mm. Like them. They're nice. They go with them. Um, oh, oh, Rob. You know those uh, lovely drowsy, fabulous cabochons we were looking at earlier. Are they still coming up tonight? Are they ours? <gasps> they would go amazing with these. Do you think or no? They would go. I'd, oh, you want? I don't know if you've seen them yet. They are their top secret special treat. They are amazing. They're very much frozen esque. If you've watched the movie, um, they're just gorgeous, oh. and they're druzies that are a pear shape, but white, but pearlescenty white. They're gorgeous. They're mm -hmm. and they're cabochons, and you get about well, the one we saw, at least six, seven, or eight. There was a lot in there. Just one of those in the oh. middle of that. Oh, I think you need it. And Rob kept I know that I need from it. You. Sorry? Rob kept that from me. He did. <laughs> he knew I'd have to find that one. <laughs> Rob didn't have much time to look at anything True, today. Yeah. <gasps> Match made in gemstone mm. heaven. That That is gorgeous. Yeah. Isn't it? Dare that I put in the neon? I mean, I don't know how it would go. Oh! Do you know, strangely, Pop. I think I might just like, like it a yes. little bit. Yeah? Put the lilac lilac with it because there's lilac in the um <gasps> my gosh this mm. is like heaven what do you think very um and it's all coming up tonight plus much much for 7.95 is it for the light teal oh well there we go then Oh, I'm sorry, but I, I genuinely feel I can't have the light teal without the peacock, and I can't have the peacock without the light teal tonight. I feel I need them both. 
No, they do go perfectly. That's amazing. Love those. Well done. Check those out when you can. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I love this clasp. It is the nicest thing I've ever seen. It's gorgeous. I don't know where the other half of the clasp is, though. Mm. Right, I don't know where the, bo the tongue is to my box clasp, but I've got, the, um, I've got the main part that we all want to see. Have a look at this. Gorgeous. <gasps> In a stunning round. Now that is white topaz or clear topaz to the highest degree. Hand faceted, they are divine. 925 sterling silver box clasp, tongue and box clasp. We get 10 millimeter round. Isn't this divine? I mean, this is 100% what you would use with your sapphires, your emeralds, your rubies. Oh my word, your Mariolite that's coming mm. up. This is one of those top caliber sapphires we've got coming up. Some of your finest gems, zircon in there as well. Oh, is that all? Oh my goodness, see in all fairness, I know that it hasn't got the other half of the box, but I actually quite like it like that as a pendant. <laughs> I know yeah. I should probably actually use it as a clasp because that's its function and it will be coming as a clasp. I don't know where we've put the tongue. We've just obviously had a look oh. at it while we were recording it. I don't <laughs> know where it's gone. It um, doesn't seem to be in my little square, my drawer, but you will. Well, you saw it in the picture. You will get the other half of it, the clasp. It slides in. You can't really see that part anyway. That's the bit that slides in very quickly. Um, it's divine. Every, everybody who's making a special piece, I think, needs yeah. something like this. You love it? Yeah. Once when, you add a clasp like that to a piece, even to pearls, you increase the value of the jewellery. People of see it, they see the standard, and they, they'll pay. But people will buy. Yeah. Okay. And you know what it is. You know what topaz, most people have heard of topaz and everybody's yeah. birthstone and most people know what sterling silver is and when they know it's a clasp with those and it's so sparkly, it really was, mm. wasn't it? It's just gorgeous, divine. And then add to that some sterling silver sparkly earrings. We've got finished off with the fancy shepherd hook. These ones have a 20 by 3 millimeter hook with a topaz of a round billion, oh, flying away, round billion, Oops. Flying away again. Round, brilliant cut. And then you've got your loop at the bottom. So with the quality of the gemstones that we've had of late, I mean, we've had diamonds, we've had sapphires, had rubies, emeralds. Um, we've had a, a great collection of gemstones. Something like this would maybe be the perfect, perfect pair for one of those special gemstones you've got maybe in your safe. Uh, something you would, would set aside for something special. Um, a lot of the stones that I have, the Tanzanite, I've, um, I've sapphires of varying different degrees um, of quality, but I would only set them with silver or um, gold-plated silver. And mm. but I tend, I am tending to go to for mainly silver. Yeah. Um, and people know what there is, and people know that it's not going to affect yeah. their years. They're not going to have any reactions to it. Absolutely. And oh, they, sorry, I've just seen the seven ninety-five. Oh. Then these all start up higher in price than seven ninety-five, Rob. I love it. He's just gone. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Oh, one of those ones. Sorry, not sorries. Um, seven pounds and ninety-five pence. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt no, you, Wendy, no, but I saw fine. that price point. I thought, oh, gosh. That's need, a really good price point. So there's quite a bit of silver in those. I've found. Um, so yeah. I've had those, and they are they're, they're really nice quality. They are gorgeous, mm. aren't they? Yeah. I mean, whether you want to add a drop to it or not. Mary's message in uh, out in Kent. Hiya, Mary. You've just, uh, in fact, as well, as well as yourself, Wendy, you said, I've recently joined your customers. I love and adore everything. Oh, sorry, I thought you were saying I recently got them. <laughs> I've recently joined your customers. Um, I love and adore everything I've received. I've spent today sorting them out. Stunning, great fun, and so many ideas now. Ta. Aww. Oh, T-Y, thank you. I thought it was, like, cool for ta. For Kent, <laughs> but no, it was thank you. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I love it. Love, love, lovely to hear from you. You can text us in at 60777. Put GM Studio at the start of the message and we'll get it. Alternatively, jewelrymaker.com, your normal network charges would apply in a text. And of course, on the website, it's completely free. If you want to be anonymous, just click the box. Um, and that's you, ready and waiting to go. Should we do a star buy? I think I fancy those pearls. What about you? Yeah, the big pink ones? Do it. Oh. 
These pearls are stunning. I cannot remember the last time I brought you one pearls of this size, two pearls of this shape, and three pearls of this color. They are divine. Everything we've been looking for. Great length on the strand as well. So sizable. What I look for in a pearl is shape size, how smooth the gemstone is, what the orient on the gemstone is, so what sort of other colours you can see going on, what kind of personality it's got, whether it's got banding or not, whether it's a sizeable gemstone depending on the shape as well, maybe then I would go on to where it came from, but these, these are ticking every box, 40 centimetres, now I guarantee you 38, um, but you could get 40. These for me, it says 10 mil um, by 11 mil. Personally, I think it's actually 10 mil to 11 mil because these are not, these look perfectly round to me. Mm. Um, they are that close. I mean, I, I appreciate one millimeter is not a lot, but in jewelry industry, pearl wise, it is a lot because for every one millimeter larger your pearl is, that's on average a year longer for the pearl to form. Now, they launched um, in January on the morning show. That was January this year. So that was over eight months ago, nine months ago. Hmm, they, they completely sold out. I'm not surprised. So it must have been a good price, as much as we all love the shape of them. I'm struggling to see, well, there isn't any banding on them. Um, there isn't any pitting on them. Little, actually, there is the odd pitting. Let's have a good look at them. Very, very, very mild pitting. Which just means it's got indentations within the gem, which I actually mm. quite love. They remind me of those really expensive um, chocolate eggs. They have a really thin, beautiful wrapping to them. Do you oh, know the God. ones that are like really luxury and you wouldn't just buy yourself, but somebody bought them for you for like a special occasion they would just be the best person ever that caliber of them um, luxury these are fabulous great orient on them you're seeing lilacs pinks greens obviously it's a pink strand but you're seeing different hues of pink you're seeing these wonderful greens coming through the orient of each and every single one and they are just fabulous the size of them in how close to perfectly round are they? Don't they look magnificent? From here they look perfectly round. They don't, they, they, there's not an awful lot of um, difference, difference really, isn't there? And you, you can't see the, um, I say I can't see any even from here. You usually say I can't see any pits in or... No, it's, it's really, smooth. really minimal. I mean, we're zoomed in on the camera and I'm trying to show you as close as possible. Mm. So you possibly might not even see that with your own naked eye. I'm literally zooming in because I want... It's different. I always find when you're in a shop, you can pick it up yourself and you can look at it and you can feel it and you've got that luxury. Across the television, I appreciate you don't have that. So I'm, I guess, your eyes w yeah. with that uh, and, and your hands, your touch. So for me, I try and get it in as close as possible. So for me, I want you to know that there's very, very, very minimal pitting, but it, there is. But for me, that makes it all the more natural. It yeah. makes it all the more special. These are genuine pearls. They're freshwater culture pearls. They're not random pearls that we've never heard of before. They are genuine pearls. Multi-purchases coming through. I mean, in Northumberland, a very regular has, has joined us, I believe, uh, and gone for three, which is fantastic. Mm. Multi-purchases of two. Tina was straight in in Cheshire. In fact, Tina was first in. Jane's in, Vivian's in, Bridget's in, Berkshire, Lincolnshire, from all over the country, worldwide. In fact, I've got Aberdeen in Nottinghamshire, and I appreciate Aberdeen is still in the UK, but I mean, we have lots of viewers who join us in Louisiana and, and elsewhere in the world. Um, £17.95 is all we're looking at for these. I honestly thought they were going to be about £49 when I first saw them earlier today. I was so excited about them. They look a far better, a far more expensive strand than that. They that do. The price doesn't pounds. really um, sort of correlate with what they look like, does it? I mean, I, I remember a few years back buying pearls uh, from the company mm -hmm. and thinking twenty-five, thirty pounds was a good price. Yeah. Um, and they was. Yeah. But those, those are uh, the next level, uh, up, and they're seventeen ninety-five. They're actually now twelve ninety-five. Oh. I <laughs> did just see that. Oh, we just took oh. five pounds off. You're being um, a monkey tonight. 
I love this. Rob wasn't supposed to be with us tonight, as, a, yeah. as you know, we were supposed to have Sean um, as a producer. Bless, Sean's not so well, and Rob's on his night off. So, and he's done an extra shift this week. He was on last night and the night before, weren't you, Rob? So he's been cheeky. This is day five for him. He literally uh. doesn't mind. He's like, whatever, it's Friday night. What are they going to do? Who's going to get involved? Well, could be anybody. Who's going to get telling Rob off? I don't, th I don't think Martha minds, does she? Doesn't know. I love that. <laughs> producer, <laughs> producer Rob says, I don't know. And director Mike went, Martha loves it. He doesn't actually know it. He just decided she loves it. £12.95. Um, well, if we were going to give away pearls as a trial, yes. trial is out for our size and our quality and, and what we've got. I think that's a, a fabulous... Would you spend that on your first purchase or would oh, you yeah. spend less? I, don't, I would, I would buy, buy one of the kits and add that to it because... Yeah. And I've learned over the years, you can send them back. You can yeah, of course you can. Get something home, have a look at it, feel it, touch it yourself, and send the, if if not, send them back. And I've you know never had a problem. It just it, it's refunded, and that price is is a ridiculous price for the quality on them. Yeah, I always I think one of the main um, one of the main sayings that a lot of people in the business, as in I mean the business world, not just jewellery making or any any business. Um, Warren Buffett, and I don't know word for word um, if this is 100% word for word, but it was along the lines of it's about perceived value, maybe not actual value. And mm. what we perceive these to be, I perceive these to be at least for a jewellery maker price at £49. They happen to be £12.95. That's not to imply a value or a worth. That just happens to be the price they are today. In fact, they should be £17.95 as a good jewellery maker price from January. They've only ever been that one price. This is a, is a new low, a different. It's the only time it's ever changed in price. Uh, Jane's message in to say, thank you, Rob. I will now have <laughs> to, Jane, and go to Manchester. Well, at that price, you can understand why people will multi-purchase. I thought it would have been, even when you multi-purchase this, it would be, what, £16, £26? Yeah. I would have thought it would have been about 49 for one on its own, so... Uh, yeah, and I, pay, I, and I have paid more for one strand that, uh, that aren't as round as that. Yeah, it's amazing what the buying power can do mm. over the years and, and how, how much, well, I don't think we could buy that at 12 95 but it happens to be there. Enjoy it. I'm going to go for a break because I need to lie down after that. And we'll see you on the other side with sapphires, with amethysts, with these amazing marionites, with uh, your gorgeous, mm. be what pearls are just a dream. They will go lovely, as you suggested earlier, with those together. In fact, let me show you these together while we go to oh. a break. Have a look at these. Myself, the gorgeous Wendy, will be back with the rest of the team on the other side of a really, really short break. Amethyst is an incredibly popular gemstone. It's one of the rare gemstones that everybody can instantly recognise. This is owing to its beautiful purple hues, and it can be seen in light purple through to a really, really dark, rich purple too. Amethyst is, is called several things. Uh, you get lavender amethyst for your light purple, and rose de France for your more pinker tones. It is thought that the um, colouring element within amethyst itself is derived from titanium, but this is still not something that has been scientifically proven. Amethyst is perfect for the use in jewellery. Being seven mohs on the hardness scale, it means it's incredibly durable. Amethyst also shows um, tiger-like inclusions, like tiger stripes, and these are identifying the inclusions within the gemstone itself. Jewellery Maker have an extensive range of DVDs for all abilities. Each of our mediums has an introductory DVD to help you get started. If you're already an experienced jewellery maker, we have a collection of projects and more advanced DVDs to take your designs to the next level. We are always filming new DVDs with our specialist guest designers, so visit our website for more information. Do you want to tell everyone about the great purchase you've made from Jewellery Maker? Do you want to shout about the great service you've received? Then why not download the Jewellery Maker's Viewer's Voice app, available for iPhone or Android, and record a video that could be played on Jewellery Maker. Simply search Jewellery Maker Viewer's Voice in the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store and download our Viewer's Voice app straight to your phone or tablet. You can record as many videos as you like and send them straight to us here at Jewellery Maker. All you have to do is then carry on watching us as usual and wait for your video to be played. Download the JM Viewers Voice app and you can be the next face we see here on Jewellery Maker.
Why, hello. How are you doing on a Friday night? What have you been up to all day? Can I tell you what I did? I entered a competition today. I did? Yeah, I didn't win. <laughs> 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 it was, uh, I was telling all the team earlier because I said to Coral, if I win, we're, all, we're not all going home and Martha nearly cried. She was like, what do you mean you're going home? Well, I could have won £10,000. I didn't, mm. but I could have done. Um, it was for if you hear three songs in a row by certain artists on a radio station, um, if they play, then they pay. So I am... Um, so what I did was, I'm just pop them away before I get in trouble for playing with things. Um, so yeah, so I entered the competition, but I didn't win. Because <laughs> oh. I heard the three artists and I was really, yes, yeah, I was like, yes, I heard them, I heard them. Oh. Didn't win. Not have you ever entered a competition before and not won? Or have you never entered a competition in your life? Or do you enter them all the time? Drop me a message, jewelrymaker.com or alternatively on the web. How often do you enter competitions? Do you enter jewelry maker ones all the time? Have you ever won one? Do you, do you do lotteries? I don't know. What do you do? Have you, Wendy? Um, I do the lottery now and again, but I'm not a massive um, gambling, really. Um, no, me neither. Now and again, I've entered a few in magazines and things, but not, not yeah. like some people do. Some Have you ever course. won anything? No. I've won one thing. It was a really good thing. It was from Michelle Moan. It was her fake tan, and I retweeted something on Twitter. And uh, they messaged me and were like, you want some fake tan? I was like, thanks. Put it on, it was really good. <laughs> it was really awesome. And now if I were to go to a shop to buy it, it would be between that, hers and my friend's. Because my friend makes one, so I can't not get hers. Because ah. hers is lovely. It's totally natural as well. It's oh. quite nice. No parabens in it. So I can't go orange as well. No matter how much you put on, you can't go orange. And it smells like roses. So I quite like that one. Anyway, um, this is bright pink. That would go amazing with that teal wire we had earlier, the 0.8mm gauge. Um, wowza, these would go lovely with the pearls we've just done. Because if you're thinking the pearls are quite pastel and these are quite hot, put it together, would you get it? A little bit of a camming. You can cam it down with just one of these in the middle of the pinks or lots of these and one of the pink per lighter mm. pink pearls. What do you think or no? Would you just not? Um, I think that's a much fresher, younger look. Yeah. So for youngsters or younger people, that you, um, the proms and things like that, it's perfect. Mm. The pink... I would just not, as we said, with with the um, for the next generation. Oh, I don't yeah. know. How to, I was people like me. Oh, bless <laughs> you. I am. Um, uh, that I would just not them, but the two together are beautiful for proms. They are something mm. different, aren't they? Nine ninety five. There's plenty on here. It's the shape that I quite like about these. They're glowing. It's almost like little lights that have been turned on. If I turn it that way, it's almost like little Chinese lanterns. You know the ones that go up in the sky, mm. you light, they go off. Apparently they banned them in Thailand. They used to do them at weddings, but certain places have banned them because they send all these kites into the sea. Yeah. But they are just fat. I love the shape. I love that they graduate. Seven mil they start at. They go all the way to 14 mil. I'm, I'm remembering um, a wedding that I was at not too long ago, and the, one of the ladies was wearing black and red, uh, black and pink, sorry, hot pink. And I was thinking she had black and pink, hot pink fascinator, a black and pink outfit. And I don't know, I think in my head I probably wouldn't have worn black to a wedding. I just think it's in my head that you don't do that. But yeah. it looked lovely. It looked really, really nice. And it was hot pink. Really hot like this. Very 80s. Yeah. yeah. I'll tell her that, she'll love it. That was the <laughs> <laughs> No, I don't, I don't tell her I said that. <laughs> no, I won't. It's just on the telly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Charles Sidney. Let's have a look at this earlier. You're really excited about this one, Rob, aren't you? Me too. It's quite unisex, I think, but I think for gents as well, the colours in here and the shapes, I think they'd be awesome cufflinks. What do you reckon? Do you think? Hiya, if you just tuned in, I'm Ali. How you doing? 140 carats. It is quite colourful, but I do think it's quite... Out of all the strands I've got for you tonight, this one is one of the more unisex strands, mm. do you think, or...? What do yeah, you reckon, Wendy? Yeah, definitely. That, that, those will go, go for male jewelry, gents jewelry, just as well for ladies. It's kind of nice toned, autumny sort of colours in there mm. as well, and perfect for gentlemen's jewelry. Shape wise, I mean the fact that they're sideways, that could be quite mm. a quirky cufflink. They are really unusual that for with the way they're drilled. Um, yeah, I could do a few things with those. <laughs> mm, are you thinking the same as Wendy? Mm. 140 carats. The code on is OTGK47. I had to say the letter A five times today from somebody who kept thinking I was saying the letter E. 
I think it's just my accent. Uh, it's E for Alpha. Like <laughs> <laughs> Alpha. I have the same. both ninety-five pence. <laughs> I have the same problem. Well, it was quite important. It was my passport visa, so <laughs> I didn't mean to get it right. Nine pounds and ninety-five pence. I have no idea how many's on there. Let's do a we count. Two, four, six, eight, ten. It's quite easy to count because of different colours. Twelve, fourteen, sixteen. Sixteen. It's not even a pound each. Sixty-three pennies a stone. Now, for a pair of cufflinks, well, I saw a pair of cufflinks the other day for three hundred pounds, and that was the cheapest thing in the shop. It was a lovely shop, don't get me wrong. Um, I couldn't afford anything from it. I don't even think I could afford their pen. Like, <laughs> that they've just had <laughs> on the table. Like, maybe the notepad, maybe a piece of paper. Um, right. Blue right. Oh, and there's a cheeky cabochon in here, just so you know. Ah, oh, these are huge. Excuse me, that was a really odd noise. <laughs> I was on the phone to my friend today. He said, Ali, only my dog can hear you currently. <laughs> I was really excited. <laughs> oh, I think together that would be a, whole, a match made in heaven. What do you think? Would you? The fluoride? Yeah, definitely. Those, those pills are going with just about everything, aren't they? There's uh, yes. so many colours. Um, that definitely, mm, yeah. Gentle. Could you make little, um, because of the shape, because they graduate, they start smaller. Could you make, I mean, not too dissimilar to the flower design yeah. that you made earlier? Yeah, just with the points in um, and with, is, with those I would use, <coughs> oh sorry, excuse me, <coughs> maybe one of the pink pills. Oh the yeah. Middle. And just wrap it up. You'd easily, you might have to add a few more in other than five. Yeah. To, just to fill the gaps in there, but they'd make beautiful flowers. And then a centre one. Oh. With the smaller stones. <gasps> yeah. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, sorry. Should be price is twelve pounds and ninety-five pence. That means we're going to go down. Oh, well. Not only are we going down, I'm going down and falling off the chair. Um, not again. Don't worry. Sixteen centimeters. Oh, fluorite is never that price, especially not blue fluorite. Nah, and that's really pretty. The size of them, isn't it? Mm. I mean, they might not be the longest strand at 16 centimetres, but they are certainly big. 26 by 9 mil. I mean, it's not exactly shy and retiring, is it? Just one on its own mm. would look quite a statement. You just wrap the one centre one with some um, silver wire. Oh, gosh, and yes. Because uh, not everybody wants big things. Like yeah. Some people just like delicate. And oh, yeah, I'm, I'm a perfect. sucker for delicate. Yeah, and there's times... Layering and delicate. Mm. Sorry, carry on. There's, there are times that you just uh, everyday wear it, and you could make quite a few pendants out of the, the centre five of those. Oh, yeah, you could. Oh, right, lots and lots of people getting involved. Lots of multi-purchases in Kent and Cheshire and London and Wiltshire and Midlands, Nottinghamshire. Loving your work. Fan dabby dozy, as the crankies would say. What <laughs> one's next? Can I show you what's coming up at half past, actually? It's your blue sapphires. Mm. I've got um, Amethyst and Classic Sapphires today. Mm. Amethyst is first, sorry, and then we'll do the Sapphires at the end of the hour. I'm in love with the Amethyst. What would you expect for those? Oh, I, just, I, I can't quite see from you. I've just seen yeah. them in there. They've got to be a high-end strand. That's Definitely gems of distinction. Like, they are gorgeous. As, do you like uh, them together? Oh, yeah. Yeah, beautiful. Mm, these are t the star buys. Both of them are in this hour. Biwa pearls are coming up in the later hours. Lots and lots coming your way tonight. Mario Light, it's gorgeous. That's coming up for you as well. Did you say seven or nine? Nine. These I love. This is perfect for those of you who want to have your huge, I mean, your key rings. I, I don't know how you are, but after I dropped my keys down the lift shaft, <laughs> I've never, ever again had a small key ring. Well, I actually had a quite a big key ring at the time. But um, ever since then, I like lots of jingliness on my key rings so that they're not going anywhere. And also so I don't lose them. Something like this, I mean, they are sizable. This is going to be a feature lobster claw clasp, or if you're making a big jewellery piece, a chunky, maybe you've got some yeah. of our chunkier gems, you need a chunky clasp, I think, to go with them. I personally would always recommend that. What do you think? Yeah, Wendy? definitely. When, you, when you're using larger stones, um, the weight, a smaller clasp, the, the small clasps are strong, mm. but um, it doesn't, 
it's not aesthetically pleasing if you put something small with something really large. Yeah, it's you nice to, to have that continuity, yeah, isn't it? And you need to measure, weigh it up, really, so they're equal. And those are lovely. They are whopper. Just to put it into perspective, I'm going to get for you the Stranded Bebo Pearls, just because they're to my, to my hand. Um, and mm. you can see the size of these. They are 25 by 15 by 5 mil. I mean, they are big clasps. So for me, I'm thinking key rings, I'm thinking bag charms, I'm thinking purse charms, mm. I'm thinking mobile phone charms. Yeah, even for on the bracelets, mm. so you just uh, hook them on. Um, so the chunky winker, win winker? winter winter <laughs> bracelet. As a pendant mm. um, to hook just, so you can give interchangeable pendants yeah. to people. Yeah, they could buy sets and um, just swap over onto a neck, onto a simple chain. So, for example, if you had sort of quite a chunky chain or quite a lot of layers of chain or big nuggety gemstones or bigger gems for over your winter jumper. I bought a bobble hat today. <laughs> I literally bought a bobble hat. I was really excited about it. Walking about the shop with a bobble hat on. I'm gonna buy, I've never had a bobble hat in my life. I wanted one, bought one. £9.95. pence. You've got a what kind of hat? A Christmas pudding hat! That sounds fantastic! I bought a bobble hat for my brother, St Mirren one, a black, white and red one. It looked really cool. Six ninety five mm. for ten of them! Well, no there is ten. Looks like eight. Why is there only eight in the picture? Two, four, six, eight, ten. You get ten. The graphics say ten, I've got ten. Just, somebody must have half inch two from the picture. Or maybe, no disrespect to whoever took the picture, but I was told after congratulating Dan many, many moons ago on his splendid um, setting out of crimps, when he set out a thousand crimps or a thousand head... It was a head pin, wasn't it? I congratulated him on how neat and tidy and how incredibly straight they were. He's like, yeah, it's, and then he went, it's a pair of Photoshop. So he'd taken a picture oh. of one and copy and pasted it a thousand times. Oh, that's so cheating. Yeah, it's not, isn't it? So I'm, maybe, maybe an extra copy and paste had been missed out there, so I do apologise for that. But you are going to get 10 for just 6 95 It's a brilliant price point. Get green onyx. you got to get green onyx. June this was seen this year. A fair few months ago. Do you know, it's so funny. I met, um, I met a couple last night who I had met in Stratford-upon-Avon eight months ago to the day in the restaurant next door. And I was with the same person I was out for dinner with and they were out with the same people and neither of them live in Stratford-upon-Avon. How weird is that? That's strange. They were like, we were just talking about you two the other day. How weird is that? We were both in Stratford-upon-Avon the same day and we both went to the d restaurant next door to the one we've been to eight months We'd spoken that evening, and then we spoke again last night. Really funny. It's, really bizarre. it's a very small world. Yes, isn't it? One of them was from Yorkshire, the other one was from Scotland. Oh. I think that's, that's crazy. Right, let's see what we can do on these anyway. 9 by 5 mil to 14 by 7 mil. I was just thinking of what's passed since June quite a lot. Um, 18 centimetres, 75 carats. Should, is it? It should be a price of 9.95. Let's clear the vault. I'm all for that, Rob. Yes. What do you reckon? Rob's my producer. He the man. I'm Ali. That's Wendy. And we've got, oh, sitting down on me now on camera. So, oh, yeah, loving your work. <laughs> Emma, who offered me a chocolate biscuit. Then when I bit one and ate it and said, would she like one? She said, no, I've just had some mail and I'm on a diet. <laughs> 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 and I've been saying all night, nobody give me a chocolate biscuit, nobody give me one, I don't want one. And then she gave me one. And I broke my diet, my one day diet. I can't last more than a day, I'm rubbish. £6.95. Boom, are you joking? £6.95. Mm. It's genuine green onyx. I know I was telling you my wee story earlier, mm. but it's £6.95. Some places these days, that's one starter for one person. And a starter's not going to fill you up, is it? Absolutely, usually with silver. How lovely would these be with silver? And how many mm. people want this green and, and how few people get it in any other gemstone? Do you know that, that sits lovely along your neckline as it is and then have a long chain at the back. Oh, so gosh, the back yes. Because the backless dresses are really in. So <gasps> that would sit along the front of a dress line and down. That's, that's lovely. And Do it's long know. enough. I nearly wore a backless mm. dress tonight and I would have been in fashion. There you go. Shows you I'm not fashionable, but I could have been. <laughs> <No, me. laughs> <laughs> Love those. 
enjoy them. Um, this cabochon is fascinating. Mm -hmm. It's incredible. I've never seen anything like it. I have seen a blue opal caption once and I was really, really upset because somebody else got to present it and it was <laughs> new and I was like, oh, I can't believe blue opals in the building. I don't even know it was here. If I hadn't been in that day, I wouldn't even have seen it. It would have been gone in and out in a flash. This is huge. The markings on it are so incredible. They're totally natural. I just had to check. Totally natural markings. Wait till you see this. Looks like somebody's gone and swirled little clouds on the surface of it. How crazy is that? Oh, how unusual, totally natural. It looks like a frost on your windmill on the mirror. Oh, yes, it does. Mm, it's right fascinating. Right. Imagine what you could do with this October's birthstone. I'm thinking we need these. 29 by 20 centimetres, 20 carats of blue opal. How many have we got, Rob Rob? 48. Oh, I'm his mate. 48, mate. <laughs> I like that. £24.95. I don't think I'm anybody else's mate. That's the first time I've been somebody's mate. I like it. Cheers, mate. All right, mate. 1795. Cheers, mate. I don't think it sounds right from a girl, does it? Mm. I think it sounds fine already. £17.95. pence. If that's the price you're going to give us, I'll, I'll take meat all night long. Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, I love, I love opal. Um, and that, that's brilliant. Something different, isn't it? Yeah. And how many people in the world have an opal cabochon? I've, I've seen one. I don't think I've ever seen one, to be honest with you. I'd love to write Well, you that. would have had to have been watching that very, very one day yeah. that I just <laughs> happened to be in. Otherwise, I, I would have been saying, no way. I haven't seen it. No. Uh, £17.95. You know what, Wendy? Do you fancy... Oh, sorry. Having a play oh. and doing something with some wire. I would. Yes. Yeah? Yep, it's all I'd yours. It is all yours. Enjoy. Oh, thank Have you. Have fun. Oh, Ali, I like you. <laughs> that's because... I mm. don't know why. It was technically really Rob is that it? said it was OK. But... Still, I'm still going to do it. He wants to see it in jewellery. I want to see it in jewellery, and I'm quite sure you, mm. seeing as you've never seen one, you might, and you love opals. It would be only be, it would be rude not to, really, wouldn't it? Definitely. It's my mum's birthstone. Is it? Mm. Oh, Rob, there you go. <laughs> mm. Dibs for Wendy. Dibs. <laughs> yeah, dibs. Rondells, what do you fancy? Ooh. Let's. Ooh, hello. Oh, these are textured. These are lovely. I've seen these before, actually. Oh, yes, these are stunning. Wait, you see these? I really, really love them. You can put lots of cords in them. I saw a bracelet just like this mm. the other day, as in one of these um, on some cords. It was so, so considered. Oh, my goodness gracious me, I couldn't believe it. I could not believe it. And it wasn't even real silver earlier. Um, these are genuine in your your beads they're 15 oh no tell 16 by 6 mil silver plated on top of copper real silver and there are 11 no why are they 11 10 pieces where am i getting my numbers from <laughs> just speaking really i think i don't think i'm oh there we go they look quite celtic in that picture they're lush oh imagine those with some polymer clay beads in between mm. that'd be quite fab you can put those on with um put a head pin through another stone and pop that in um, so it's got it, it through the hole, mm -hmm. so it sits as a collar around it. That's quite Ooh. pretty. Um, like that idea. Leather cord with some of the, the, the men's leather bracelets that Mark mm. did. Yeah. That would be lovely, um, just with a simple knot either side. So you can actually do ladies and gents yeah. pieces. You could do family, couldn't you? You could have mum, <laughs> dad, if you're fortunate enough to have any bairns, you could have that them with some as well. Family bracelets. Yeah, yeah. Oh, good idea. Is that really sad? Would I have that? Would I be like, everyone looking at me like, Ali, you would be the saddest mother ever? Um, Do you imagine? You think I'd, I'd be a good mum? Really? What do you want, Rob? Six ninety-five. <laughs> you want me to not tell Martha you've done that? I'm not going to tell a single soul. Just everybody watching. B E X L ninety six pounds. Is it? 
six pounds and ninety five pence. That's superb. Mm. Oh, I'm really chuffed with that price point for ten. They're really, really sturdy. Weight wise, there's twenty grams on here. Yeah, they're not exactly shine retiring. No. Do you want to and feel the, one so you yeah. can feel the quality? I Ooh, think I got have, stuck. I think I have these ones. Yeah, I do. Um, yeah, and they're quite a nice size for the yeah. leather cords and for the um, drill hole ones. Yeah, the actual size. Of, there's quite a lot will go through that. Even your larger wires easily go through it. Oh, really chuffed mm. with those. Um, oh, is this the, the the new ones to me? Oh my gosh, I cannot believe these. Wait, you see, they're so popular. Apparently, when Rob had these the other day. I haven't seen anything like them. So if you think of an amylite, or an ammonite, sorry, amylite is a, a gemstone you can get from an ammonite. Ammonite is a fossil, which you probably all know very, very well, especially if you're in geography, you might know a bit about the earth and, and ammonites. Um, don't worry if you don't, um, I'm about to show you anyway. But these are really, they're fancy. What, what you've got with these is the shape of an ammonite but with some quartz in there as well. It's really unusual. Have a look at this. You've still got the drusy effect in the middle. You've got the shape, but not the traditional ammonite. It's so, so unusual. What do you think? These are individual, as you like. I mean, no two are the same. Never seen anything like them. Are these totally natural? There's no treatment at all. These are fascinating. Look at that. These are really, really unusual. Because it's all the shape of an ammonite, but not the traditional look of an ammonite at all, is mm. it? No, they've got, they are, um, they're quite highly polished, but they're... Highly polished on one side, yeah, and flat on the yeah. other, giving a slight cabbage in there. Uh, but they are very highly polished and they will sort of sit really nicely because they're almost flat, they're not that concave look to them. Really different, very different from the ammonite I've had previously. Four ninety-five, as mm. you should be priced. Two hundred carats, you're guaranteed. But we're not finishing there. I can't believe we're reducing on the price on these, especially when you had them and they were so popular. Um, is it? Well, there you go, nineteen ninety-five. That's a ticky wee five pounds off per person. There, you are getting a really, really stylized look. You're getting something that so many people talk about: those ammonite shapes, those ammonite fossils. You're getting totally natural fossil ammonite, so it's ammonite shapes, it's that quality, totally natural. Collectors are in in Cheshire, Staffordshire, Kent and Angus, there's lots and lots of you getting involved and quite rightly so, especially with the saving that you've just made. Sylvia has just come straight in, lovely to see you joining Sally, joining to new viewers as well. Imagine that's our first purchase. Janet's in in Surrey as well, lovely to see you Jani, Janet, sorry, it's really, really busy tonight, which is so great to see. It is a Friday night, the start of your weekend and we like to start it in style. Um, Rob so much, couldn't even stay away, he had to come in. No. Can you believe that? Well, it's fun. It is. It's much better right? than going out on a Friday. This is very true. <laughs> and to be fair, we're on till nine o'clock, so even if you still want to go out after, later, so you can. Fun. Why are you laughing so much? Has someone sent you a funny message? Chunky. They are chunky, Rose Charms, though. These are so chunky. It's unreal. Wait till you see these. These remind me of... You know I'm going to absolutely talk about Disney at some point, because I do every night. These remind me of... Beauty and the Beast. You know the rose that's in the jar? Oh, yes, yes. Right, wait, you see this and then see if I'm, if I'm just obsessed with Disney or whether this really is the Beauty and the Beast rose. Yes. It's totally that rose, isn't mm. it? Wait, you see how chunky these are? Oh, wow. These are, I mean, they are chunky, mm. hunky chunky. Um, you are getting five of them. They are 16 grams across the five. Have a feel. 
Aren't they so, I mean, they are solid. Yeah. And they're really intricate. There's a lot of detail in them. I'm 100% with you there. Really gorgeous colour. They are gold plated, rose gold on top of silver plated, on top of brass. I mean, there's a lot of plating there. There's a lot of quality there. And to still get, as you pointed out, that intricate detail mm. with two layers of plating, they're special. And that plating means sterling silver and then rose gold. They're only 11 95 There are 33 in quantity left. You get five pieces each. But we're going to take a reduced price for you tonight because it's Friday night and Rob shouldn't be here. And I'm just, well, I'll go along with it. It's fine by me. I didn't think it would be quite so reduced. Six ninety five oh, for them. That's amazing. That's Do you think? Yeah, that's a really. You're really price. happy with that. If you're so watching at home, I mean, they don't look that chunky from home. They're no. sixteen grams across five. I mean, that's. These are a good weight. Yeah. They're really nice weight. Really nice for a char just one on charm bracelet. And I've got just. I'm gonna. Can I pinch this one? I don't know. No. Can we, can Wendy half inch that one? No, no. We've not, <laughs> I'd got, love to, going in a piece, we don't have the stock, it would go in that piece yeah. if it could. Um, okay. They are selling out, so if we did that, somebody would get four instead <laughs> of five. So I don't know if we would be in favour of the month if that was the case. <laughs> well, I, I'll buy it and then I'll have the fourth. <laughs> oh, good luck with that, I don't no. know if we've got enough, but hopefully. Fair Fingers enough. crossed, it's 6 .95. check those out as soon as you can. They would go lovely with the first kit, actually, with all mm. the hearts, the lovely yeah. roses in there. Fantastic. Perfectly copper. Right, sapphires I've got coming up for you as well. But for your rose gold plated, oh my goodness gracious me, check those out as soon as you can. They, they feel amazing. Especially if you make um, special pieces for February, you know that month that we all kind of, mm -hmm. some of us love it, some of us loathe it, some of us just don't really bother. Do. That month, the V day, you know the one? No, actual V day. But yeah, Valentine's Day. Anyway, we've got a superstar buy coming up for you. It's the Peacock Pearls. You're going to love them. But before that, I fancy doing your presenter's pick. Suit you? Good, me too. Do you know what would be cool? If your face just popped out from that, like, <laughs> it ripped, like, you know when people rip paper and pop through? That would be quite cool. If you didn't feel ill, you would see if you could do that. Oh, bless you, Mike. The thought's there. I'm Ali, if you just tuned in. Poor Mike's not feeling so well. Oh. Um, right. Stunning. Possibly the finest Gems of Distinction Sapphire I've got of the night. And what a treat for you here. Genuine sapphires. They are coming in at 10 carats. They are one by one mil plus uh, up to two by one mil. They graduate. There's an 18 centimeter strand and 45 units in stock. Price point on this is fabulous. I wanted to do the amethyst, but then when I showed them earlier, you said that the sapphire was first, which is why I went for the sapphire. But we're getting to do the amethyst. I'm 99.9% .9 sure because I had it in order. It's all good, Rob. We'll do this one. We're going to do them both anyway. We'll do the sapphires later. There are 64 in stock of these. I'm quite chuffed because I thought that was my presenter's pick changing because I'd picked these. <laughs> and I didn't want to say, hey. But, but I just did. Uh, love, 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 love for these. What sort of price point would you expect for amethysts? We were talking about these earlier, weren't we? Yeah. Just gems of distinction, calibre. They are very high. Mm. Late 30s, 40 pounds, 45 mm. pounds. Okay. Lovely. So between 30 to 40 pounds for this strand, as I thought. Quite mm. rightly so. Quality of the cut, the calibre. Stock wise, we have in stock si uh, 54. It's not going to be enough, is it? They are 9 millimetre in size. It's a 7 centimetre strand. No, 17. <laughs> going to say it's not much than seven centimetres. Um, 17 centimetres strand for you here. There are two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, seventeen approximately on your strand. Do you know what? 
I feel like doing something out of the ordinary tonight. These are totally natural. So everything you were seeing about clarity, the strength of the colour, the hot pinks that are coming through, normally that would have possibly mm. some sort of treatment going on there, maybe a little bit of heating to get that strength and that depth of tone. Totally natural for you for these amethysts. Mm. Their quality and their cut, you can see that. That's why you're getting such great luster and such fabulous brilliance. Yes, the gemstone has to be good at a start, but you have to have the calibre of the, the lapidus to be able to get that finishing look. Clarity on them is amazing. The shape on them, they're corner drilled as well, and they're top drilled, if that makes sense. So they're drilled on a corner, but at the top, so with lots and lots of you involved already, I can see you all in Suffolk, in Bedfordshire, Carmarthenshire, Avon. I've got Wiltshire, multi-purchases, Chris's in Norfolk, Rowena's in Ken, Essex. Lovely to see you all in. Thank you so much for joining me. I mean, those colours, those purples, that makes me think of a very special chocolate that comes out at Christmas time. <laughs> it's big and it's purple and it's got pink wrapping inside. Yes. Yeah, and it's got mm, that lovely, almost see-through, but purple, and then the hot pink underneath. underneath. Is that what you're thinking I know, of? Yeah, I know the one you mean. It's gorgeous. Mm. Nuts. And a man with a tray <laughs> of chocolate milk. <laughs> oh, I want chocolate now. Um, right, what can I do for you? Are you ready to treat yourself? Is this something we could have at 14? What? <laughs> okay. It shouldn't be. You were, on, you were quite on. You were quite on um, yeah. on thought with your original guess. Seriously, that's wrong. I know, but it's a presenter's pick. It is. It's and an I'm amazing a one. And I picked it. <laughs> <laughs> well picked. Contrary to what Sapphire we nearly did, I was like, where's my oh. pick? Not that I wouldn't pick the sapphires, but that's a producer treat. Oh. Can you imagine? That's a star by for the end of the hour. If you take those little. Uh, diamond shapes and centre drill, drill them you'll have perfect snow like snowflakes and, and they'll go they'll sit perfectly like the float in the flower wrap gorgeous on a ring oh Ugh, that's lovely and amethyst is my birthstone is it well we've yeah. got 17 amethysts on this strand as your birthstone i wonder how much that is an amethyst oh it's not even a pound 88 pence what suits you what suits you, what see? Loving it. Do, 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 do. But we need these to be fully allocated because otherwise we'll probably get caught and told off. And they'll say, well, well, why did you go to £15? Why would you do that? And, well. then, and then I have to explain. Well, my explanation will really be, ask Rob. It wasn't me. It have, was we Rob. Got, have we got many? How many have we got, Rob? We had 54... 35 have already gone, I've got a couple in baskets, not to mention those of you who are thinking about picking up your phone. Um, they're stunning, they're absolutely yeah. gorgeous. Whether you just have one of them or a couple of them, they would work with the Biwa pearls as well, colour-wise, they, they work with a huge amount. February's Bristol, can you go wrong in just one of them on a charm, yeah. as a charm? The, the, just the glitter on them, they're sparkling, the cat on them's amazing. Um, I don't know if they might go in the prong set rings. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, absolutely. You could, you could do some sort of prong setting. Yeah, the oval. This you know the silver oval ones we have? Ooh, I and don't know. They might be quite might, specific. They might, might go in them. I don't know. You can always try. You've got yeah. your 30-day money-back guarantee. You could, do, um, you could do a prong set ring of your own. Yeah. Um, and you don't have to use that drill hole because that drill hole can be ignored. But you could also use it as your security. Mm. It's a 9 mil, that's more than most people's engagement ring, which is on average a 5 mil. 9 mil is pretty big, just shy of 1 mil, shy of double the average engagement ring. <laughs> which is pretty special. Big. Imagine that, oh yes, it's double the average engagement ring. Do whatever you want. Oh, set it Why with not? the diamonds around it. Oh uh, my gosh. <gasps> Heaven. If you've just tuned in and you're thinking, yeah, right, diamonds around it. We have had diamonds on the channel, mm. actually more than once. It's amazing, I know. Mm, love it, enjoy it, I hope you got them. Right, sapphires are coming up, they're just divine. Producers pick, they'll be near the end of this hour, which is only about 20, 25 minutes time. Uh, I'm gonna do for you the big hearts, is it? Oh, let's get it on, something's biting me. Oh, cheeky. Mmm! <laughs> oh! Oh, I like these, right? How are you doing? Fancy hearts, gold plated, copper. So, copper, sterling silver plated, and then gold plated on top of that. I like these, you get loads. 
You get 10 and there's 88 in stock. So you've got your big jump ring. Pop that down. That one's just been opened. Closed very, very badly. Um, <laughs> don't know, put that one away. Um, right, so you've got your jump ring. You have on either side. So that's actually a component that you get that you don't need to add on yourself. 11 mil jump, I don't know any 11 mil jump rings that we offer all easily. Very sizable jump ring because you've got a very, very sizable heart. Oh, I really like these. I love the pattern on them because when you move them, it almost ripples across like those very, very expensive chocolates, you know, the Ferreros. And then you have Roches and like a triangle. You know those ones? They have like a kind of crinkly wrapper because the hazelnuts kind of get in the way of the wrapper and make it a little bit crinkly. Do you mm -hmm. think you remind you of that? Yes. Yeah, they are. Uh, to have anything that's um, already textured for you mm. is brilliant because it means this, um, they're already done. You could stamp into them. Yeah, you can, and the backs. Yeah, yeah if you wanted the, backs it, claims, the same. It? Yeah, if you wanted the same shape. Those would go lovely with the first kit. Would yeah, they on. would. The love as kit. a centerpiece. <gasps> Oh my word, could you imagine? And then you save mm. yourself a fair wee bit of wire as well. Yeah, yeah, and you could just wire around the edge of why If you use the um, hole punch, <gasps> the little round screw hole punch, yeah. and punch around it, you can actually drop some stones off it. Oh, wow. Or use it as a, that, as a base to wire wrap around it. <gasps> really so for nice. six ninety five for 10? That's... That is really, really, really good value. It's supposed to be twelve ninety five. Jeweler maker, we're mm. we're far too low tonight. But hey, it's Friday <laughs> night. Who's gonna stop me? Are the managers from back from India? I'm, not, I'm just gonna pretend I don't know the answer anyway. I don't know the answer. Nobody's replied. It's fine. <laughs> not that I'm aware of. Check it out. Check 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 it out. Who's thinking of? I I know. I shouldn't think about it. We don't have to do anything, do you? Put that on a chain, you can sell yes, it. Yes, <laughs> Put it in our Ganza bag. Yep. You could have um, both the names on the back of it. Stamped yeah. in. I'm sorry, Mike, but we're jewelry makers, and this is something that comes around every single year, whether we like it or loathe it, it still yeah. happens. So we yeah. can either embrace it and make some money out of it or not. <laughs> that is true. And <coughs> oh. Imagine that's that with the rose. Heart charm hanging off it, be lovely. What's next? Citrine, these will go with the citrine Hannah had earlier actually, on the mid show, the Rondells. We had them before, so you might have already got them actually before today. If you've opened an order today, you can always add to the same order. It's only one post and packaging in any one day, it doesn't change. Just once, open your order, you've got from midnight to midnight to get shopping. Love it. Love, love, love these. November's first, don't share his birthday with Topaz. Oh, these would go fantastically with that lovely clasp that we had of the topaz, the sparkly one from earlier. Might still be available if they are. Check it out. We've only got five of these left in the world, so this is going to be a really quick mm. opportunity. Seven by four millimeter, and they're totally genuine, all the way up to thirteen by six millimeter. So there's an option for you there on the web or the phone lines, whichever is most convenient for you. You'll know what you like if you want. If you've got the wee app open on your phone, or if you want to do it by calling us. It's a free phone number, Julian Maker uh, from a landline and many mobile providers as well. It's 0800 644 whichever is most convenient for you. Should be 2195, that's what you're seeing on the web. That's what it should be at. The citrine is there, the rondelles from earlier, so you can put these two together. The clasp still has some available, so you can put that together. And we are going down to 14 pounds and 95 pence. Somebody's having a kid on, I think. Can't believe it. I can't believe this is 14.95, and I can't believe the start, the squares and the amethyst, or the diamond shapes and the amethyst went to 14.95. It's a lovely combination, isn't it? Bear in mind, there's a lot of citrine on there clustered, so you don't have to have that many. It doesn't need to be that sort of big a look. Yeah, together, you fancy that? Yeah. Maybe with the, the purple ribbon that you've got coming up, actually. Yeah. Ooh. For fourteen ninety five for that citrine. With five of them, as I'm sure you can imagine, they will not be there um, for much longer. Enjoy it. There's plenty on there. The quality is just fabulous. Well done, you. Really? Have we done the whole hour? Okay. Uh-oh. I'm in trouble. 
I was playing with this earlier and I know I'm not allowed it. They're real carnelians. Totally genuine. Two, four, six, eight, nine on a strand. Look at the strength of colour. Amazing. Mm. Do you like them, Willie? I think they're lush. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. <gasps> they, the colours, it's just pops orange. It's beautiful. So mm. special. They are 12 by 10 to 19 by 9 now. You've got to trust me right now and find your phone. 0800 612. to hear Rob my producer is like Ali I can't hear if you're speaking to me that's the point <laughs> should be I can't look should be should be 11.95 for totally genuine carnelian I can't I can't oh oh it hurts really <gasps> this is Halloween in a nutshell isn't it in a gemstone, autumn. Yeah. It's just perfect. It's that perfect pumpkin colour. Yeah, turn them on the front. I made little pumpkin faces out of um, some 0 0.4, 0 0.6 wire. And then we'll make little pumpkins out of them. Oh my necklace. Gosh. Oh, I'm so excited. If you're delaying on this one, I will not be able, I've never seen carnelian of this size, of this carat weight. I haven't seen that. I definitely haven't seen them at this price. Um, I counted them, but I can't remember. What's that? Nine? Two, four, six, eight, seven. Sorry, seven. It's a pound each. Just shy of a pound each. <laughs> this is phenomenal. <laughs> um, enjoy them. Do you know what? Just one of those and a little bit of length of chain on each year, yeah. they'll, look like, they'll look like whatever you want them to look like. Whether you want them to look like pumpkins, whether you just want that colour. I'm just getting excited for Halloween because it's <laughs> the first year I think it ever. I'm off for Halloween. I probably won't do a thing. Probably hope my next door neighbour comes round with their child so I can watch some trick or treat. And other than that, I might just duke for apples by myself. Oh. It's all good. I enjoy it. <laughs> I'll enjoy it. I'll do what my old next door neighbour used to do. My old next door neighbour was amazing. I better be careful though, because he's still my parents' next door neighbour. He's so cool. Um, he has a flag outside his a flag pole outside the top of his house, yeah. where he sticks a different flag for each season, whether it be Easter or Halloween or whatever it might be. Halloween, he dresses up as uh, as Dracula, <laughs> and you walk up his driveway. He has a real coffin, and he oh. got his brother to lie in it one year and like sit up when all the kids came up the driveway, and you just hear all these screams. Little cats, lanterns when you walk up the driveway and they go ha 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 ha. Oh. And then as soon as you get to the door, it all screams and everybody runs. We have an estate near it's amazing. Us, and I took my take my littlest, I've still got the little ones yeah. eleven. And this estate we went around there and there's a big rabbit. And the gentleman was American and, and buys these outfits and they were like screen ones. But it's like it was like a um the rabbit was blood and, and he's standing there oh. thing, and, and it went at the kids ran a mile and I've never seen an I've never seen an outfit like it he must have paid a fortune but he got it from America I and love it some people just do loads outside everybody houses. gets involved I think it's yeah. fun um, right we used to get involved at the girl guides I used to love it duking for apples these are amazing. these actually remind me of what I was thinking of treacle there I didn't like the treacle duking for apples but I like the, the toffee ones Mm. These are amazing. You know how the treacle scones? They hang the scones from the, the thread and they dip them in treacle and you have to bite the scone and then you have to dip your face in the flour. <laughs> oh, that sounds messy. Yeah, you're not supposed to eat it really, you're just supposed to, I don't know, it's a race. <laughs> 9.95. These reminded me a little bit of what I look for in my uh, 
peacock color. B wants to lose together. Golden color. Co Golden color coated plain pairs. Ah, it's because they're black, isn't it? They're black underneath and the golden on them was almost like um it's almost like a making it look like a petrol colour or mm. a peacock colour more so than actual like a bright goldy gold, if that makes sense. Love, they're ever so shiny, aren't they? You're getting that sort of gold. Can you see it's more of an antique gold than a sort of 24 carat yellow, yellow gold that we might think of. They are different, aren't they? Se Whoa, the six ninety five for Spinel. Come on now, far too low. Shocking. Is it time for our sapphire? We've played everything in there, haven't we? Goodness me! Right, let's get some sapphires in them. <laughs> Oh, these are naughty. Now, in all fairness, you've seen these, so you're probably prepared. <laughs> you're probably prepared for these. But just a Rob wanted us to wait, wanted us to have plenty of time to, to be prepared. We have a good quantity of them. There are, well, just shy of 50. Um, we are getting genuine sapphires. Now, these aren't any old sapphires. Totally natural. And they're from Burma. Burmese natural sapphires. The mm. price on them is phenomenal. L like, gen remember what happened when we had the amethyst earlier? Yeah. You, the, you felt like how I felt with the pearls, as if, gosh, I feel like I, I, I have no idea what prices are these days when, when you see that. Did mm. you feel like that earlier? Yeah. yeah. Well, you, we're going to feel like that again right now with these. The quality that these are, personally, honestly, me looking at them, knowing they're natural, knowing them from Burma, Burma Mm. I'm thinking $69.95. That's what I would personally, as an accredited jewellery professional at this channel, think. Yeah, natural. Got to be. Uh, no, no, no treatments is definitely, definitely at that, that level. Now, yesterday, producer Rob had totally natural Burmese sapphires. Uh, a couple of days ago, he said not too dissimilar to these. They were $79.95. So we're thinking around £60, £70 mm. pound mark. Well, £80, £79.95. Print out your authenticity card. Thank us later. Oh yes. Do not wait. 0800-644-655. Trust me on this. This is ridiculous. This is not the strand price or the price you would ever put a strand of totally natural sapphires from Burma. Please, 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 please do not think of this as implying a value or worth. The price that we're going to is a giveaway price purely because Rob's not meant to be in tonight. We were, that was supposed to be our final shift together for, for the moment um, on Tuesday. Well, clearly it's not because we're working together today. Um, and that's only because of illness, unfortunately, for our poor Sean. But it's all right. It's okay. Rob's going to drop the prices anyway. This is so low. I'm going to have a look on the web and see if you can see what the web... Oh, you can't see. Oh, the web's... The graphics are in, so you will see the web. Oh, my word, right. You can see it already. Oh. Look at this, Wendy. Can you see from there? No. Is it too far away? Let me turn it around. Well, it's our website. We must be allowed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at it for allowed. That's oh. what it says. What? I don't know. But anyone watching at home wanted to know what everyone in the web can see. That's what they can see. Start clicking it in, logging in, checking out. It's lending. What? I mean, that's, what do we say to that? Oh, that's an amazing price. Uh, you've got to have that. That price, you'd be. You'd be silly not to. They're natural, they're mm -hmm. Burmese, and they're beautiful. And they are. The colour is gorgeous on them. They're tiny, they make perfect for silver jewellery. Gorgeous. You have sapphires. I mean, just September's birthstone. Mm. I know it's past, but it's still a gem sincerity, still a gem faithfulness. It's a gemstone. Many people are fortunate enough 
to get engaged with it, which is such a beautiful luxury, such a wonderful treat. I know my mother has um, a half eternity band of sapphires and diamonds, mm. classic sapphire. It's just, for me, it's traditional, it's, it's divine, but something you would think you'd have to be getting something very special that must be a I mean, retirement gift or a very special anniversary to own a gem like this. It's £35. Can you pay more for a pair of trainers these days? <laughs> and I like more, yeah. trainers. I'm not saying don't have shoes, but... Yeah. And it's... Um, it, I, I love um, sapphires. I really do. And that has got a beautiful colour to it. And it's, um, it's natural. Yes. Very, very, it, Does that mean off. something to you? Because yeah. for me it means a lot, but for, for yourself, I mean, it's part of the world's 5% of gemstones in the sapphire family that are natural. You're getting one of that 5%. It's incredible. I think as soon as you say natural, it, it means there's no treatments, there's no fillers, there's no chemicals involved in it. And, and the colour and the um, brilliance of it mm -hmm. for a natural stone is amazing. Isn't it? Yeah. For that depth, I mean... What I'm amazed by is the uniformity. They're all the same exact. I mean, because they're that close together, mm. you would think there must be some sort of. Um, well, you, would you wouldn't think they would be identical, would you? You would think no. it must be. It must be the odd one that doesn't look quite right in there. You can't pick out any. There's not one in there that doesn't deserve to be there. No, it's, I, I looked at it earlier, and it's, just, it's a beautiful, beautiful strand. Just to accent um, your really high-end pieces with silver, amazing, and that—that's a silly price, Rob. Uh, well, <laughs> I might have something to tell you, but see, at thirty-four ninety-five, uh -huh. possibly not going to stay there. That's a great price. That, that's a really good price. But can we do what I wanted to do earlier? Okay. Serious but from no, no, no. Yeah. You give it away, give it away, give it away now. You'd be a com well, you'd be idiot not idiots, but you would be ridiculous not to put that in your basket. Get it home, have a look at it. <laughs> Do we have many? We had fifty four, I think. Forty five, got the numbers the wrong way down. Forty five. <laughs> I'm not gonna get one. £24.95. <gasps> I'm really sorry, Wendy. He's giving it away. He is giving it away. But he's not meant to be here, so he doesn't really... He's not fussed. He doesn't mind. Oops. He's not going to be held to rant. He's not going to be told off. In County Tyrone, in Cheshire, this is allowing people, which is, I can't believe I'm saying this right now, it's allowing people to multi-purchase sapphires from Burma that are totally natural. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I can't wait for you to go to a shop one day and try and find a natural Burmese sapphire somewhere, Rob. <laughs> and then for them to say, oh, no, we don't do it. And then you won't be getting fired. Oh, actually, you've not passed your probation yet, have you? You have. <laughs> Congratulations. When did you get that? Come on, what are you doing? You kept that quiet. Oh, and that's why he's going so low tonight. He's got his contract. He's signed. He's done. The sign seal delivered. He's, he's chuffed. Oh, congratulations, Rob. There was no doubt in my mind anyway, but it's really nice of us for it to have that, to have that signed. That must be lovely. I've still not had mine signed. It's nine and a half years. <laughs> <laughs> still making the mind so. Yeah. <laughs> still putting my, my P45s in the post every week, I'm sure of it. I just refuse to accept any post from the mailman I have to sign for. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't receive it, wasn't me. I showed past somebody's <laughs> parking ticket today. You know, like the yellow ones that you stick on your windscreen. It was just like on the road. I was like, somebody's clearly just driven off. No, I'm not paying that. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes, I'm going to have a go with the Cal uh, Chelsea Sydney. The what, sorry? Oh, yeah, the pink ones. Pink ones are gorgeous. Right, I've got some Chelsea Sydney for you. It's funny, you say Cal Sydney and I say Chelsea Sydney. What do you say? Cal Sydney. Do you? Yeah. You're not wrong, else. Ooh. Either way. <laughs> this is true. I am GIA trained um, from the GIA. The GIA from the GIA. Well, that's funny, isn't it? What do you think? Look at the size of these. What I love about these is some are a little bit hotter than the others. Some are a bit more fuchsia and some are a little more um, hmm. deeper, aren't they? You've got a lovely mixture there. Oh, Rob's got a very big smile on his face. Yeah, we do have 200 carats. I wonder what producer Rob's got him off his sleeve today. This is my final one for this hour, right? Ooh. 
should be 200 carats at 1995. Graduate, ooh, we're going down 19 by, 19 by 10 mil to 32 by 12 mil. We're going down. <laughs> oh, that was not what I was expecting, but I'm not going to disagree. 12 pounds and 95 pence, what to see? Amazing. They're gorgeous. They, they are. really pop, gorgeous colours. And the difference in shades is, is quite a nice thing, I it's think. It's lovely, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. It gives you a bit of variety and it allows you to do a bit more with it. It's, it yeah, that's lovely. Girly. Oh, yes. twelve ninety five. Just one of those on their own would be superb. I've got mm. two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven approximately on the strand. Just over a pound each. And they should have been nineteen ninety five as a great jewellery maker price. But, of course, it's my final one of this hour. It feels like it's a clear show. It feels like it's back to the original late show. <laughs> Mmm, love, 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 or love, love, love. Fantastic. Enjoy those. We've still got, oh, the Mary Light coming up. That's an amazing, amazing strand. In fact, let me bring these over. We've done the pink pearls. If you want them, have a look on the web. There might be some left. Spinel, um, we had earlier over there. These are your sapphires, your amethysts. Some of these might still be available. Do try and check them out if you fancy them. Mary Light is amazing. Biwa pearls and the peacock variety. Can't wait. Appetite, one of the longest strands and most vibrant strands we've ever had. And then Tanzanite in the next hour, plus a kit in the next hour. Should we do ton Tanzanite Rondelles for under £10? Mm, why don't you tune in and find out? I'll see you in just a sec. Join guest designer Mark Smith with his fantastic DVD, Chips and Nuggets with Wire. Mark guides you through everything you need to know to create these stunning pieces. From the tools that you will use, to different types of wire and the gorgeous gemstones featured, it's like having a personal tutor in your living room. Book now to take part in the Gemporia experience. Take a behind-the-scenes tour of the TV studios, meet the presenters and learn about gemstones and jewellery. The price of £169 includes an overnight stay at the picturesque White Swan Hotel, a buffet lunch, refreshments, a £20 gift voucher towards your evening meal and a free glass of bubbly. In terms of summarising the course, um, terrific fun, extreme, um, learnt so much. Um, feel like I've gone away, got a massive, even greater passion for jewellery. Very good value. Very well put together, and yes, go for it. <laughs> Dates are limited, so call or email us now for an experience you'll never forget. If for any reason you're not satisfied with your purchase, you have the benefit of our no quibble 30 day money back guarantee. Just complete the returns form enclosed with your goods and send them back for a full refund. So you have a modern drill now, but we were talking earlier on that cavemen or 6,000 years ago, they were making jewellery and you were telling me how difficult they must have found it to, to drill the amber. Yeah, the amber is, uh, is, is really very soft to drill, but drilling it from one side to the other, you, you get your chip test on another side. So optimally, uh, opti how do you call it? Is optically, you, yeah. Yeah, you, you, call it, you have to drill it from the both sides to meet the drills in the middle of the stone. Mm -hmm. And that was difficult in old days. Yeah. Uh, so, so a lot of stones were broken and uh, one, one's drilling from the one side. Yeah. And we found uh, the remaining from old shops, old workshops doing amber uh, in the ground from uh, 7,000 years ago. Wow. It was that, that long ago. And that was in this area of Poland? In or? this area, in the Gdańsk area. The, the oldest we ever found was about 7,000 years old. So, sort of 5,000 BC. It's a long, long time to... Yeah, yeah. Sarah Elvin brings you her DVD, Friendship Bracelets. This fantastic DVD is filled with excellent techniques to create the perfect friendship bracelet. This includes the chevron style bracelet, the knitted style bracelet, and the crisscross bracelet. Friendships are forever, and so are bracelets. 
To get your hands on a copy of this fantastic DVD, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. Sapphire is an incredibly important gemstone. It actually comes in a vast array of colours. I think commercially we always think of gemstones like sapphire as being blue, but it is available in pinks, yellows, greens, purples, and even vibrant tones such as orange. Sapphire itself is the birthstone for September, making it a really beautiful, unique gift if you want to personalise your collection. It's also nine mohs on the hardness scale, which means it's incredibly durable if you want to wear your jewellery pieces every day. Sapphire has been revered since ancient times for its beauty and its lustre. It's been used from the Middle Ages right through to modern day. Today's modern day piece in Sapphire, which captures the nation's imagination, would be the engagement ring given to Princess Diana. That ring is now being worn by Kate Middleton, and we have seen a surge in people buying Sapphire as the ultimate love gift. I just want to say a massive thank you to Anne who has very kindly taken the time um, not only to write me a little card, a beautiful note, um, but also to, to send me one of the most gorgeous pairs of earrings. Anne, thank you so, so much. Anne messaged me a while ago on Facebook to say she was struggling with them. Um, with doing a little bit of chain wheel. And I'd said I'd just made a chain wheel bracelet and Anne was telling me what she liked. Um, and I said that I would try and make one for her. Now, albeit it wasn't very good, <laughs> but I tried and made it and I sent it off to Anne. Um, and Anne has sent me a pair of earrings to thank me. How fabulous are these? Aren't they gorgeous? She made these in a silversmithing course. How brilliant is that? What beautiful, and they're, they're interchangeable as well. So you could put these sterling silver flowers or these silversmith flowers behind anything. And you have just made my year. Thank you so, so kindly. Oh! <laughs> love it. Love, love, love. I had no idea what was in the box. What was that like? Yeah. What was that? <laughs> I was, oh, yay! Love it. Thank you very, 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 very much. Right. Sapphires, let's get these on. Mm. Oh, tanzanite, sorry. We've just done that. I was looking <laughs> at the sapphires, going to get the tanzanite. These are huge! These are not under ten pounds. How many? Oh, right. Call me now. Everybody can own Tanzanite, and this strand is about to prove it. Beautiful rondelles. Wait till you see these. These are fantastic. What do you think? Uh, oh, they're the little plain bubbles. Plain rondelles. Yeah, absolutely. They are so versatile. They're gorgeous. I've. They are so versatile to use in silver pieces. Beautiful. So what I would say to you is, think of this not as tanzanite, price point wise. Think of this as um, maybe quartzite. Mm. I love quartzite. Price point wise, this is more what you would expect to pay for a, maybe a smaller rondelle of quartzite. Never a tanzanite. Never, never ever. Never no. ever expect this again. I, if I was you, I would just enjoy it and then imagine delete the price from your memory because once you see Tanzanite again it will not be with me I don't imagine ever not that price at the price it's going to oh it's going even lower than you think it, it's ridiculous oh no Tanzanite 4x2 to 5x2 trust me call me I'm not asking you to press your button one it's no oh I'm not I'm not working with Rob anymore he does this every time I want it please I have two or three. <laughs> so if there were forty. There. You gonna check these out if you've got it in your baskets? I can't believe this. Oh. Seventeen baskets. Well, we have forty, so good luck with that. <laughs> you never know. If you don't try, you'll oh. never know. Yeah, if anybody's watching in the pub, please, or, or any of my friends. In the pub. In the, I live in a pub. Oh, sorry, <laughs> Only I, I live in the pub. Only watching from a pub. <laughs> you can buy it if you're in the pub. Yeah. If you're not in the pub, I don't want it. Sorry, Ali, I've got a pub that I live in, so it's not about in there all the time. <laughs> <laughs> no, I do say that. It's it funny. Like, if you're not watching from the pub, don't yeah. buy me. If you're watching from anywhere else, you can't buy it. Only want it if you're yeah, currently only from the pub. having a drink in a pub, then you can Anyone, buy it. Anyone, buy me some. <laughs> um, right. Can't believe that. Right, kit wise. Wow. Love this kit. 
Oops. If there's any of it left by the time I brought it over, it's all falling off. Right, here we go. Hello, hello. I'm going to take this away because this is just ridiculous. I can't believe you've got this. So we're getting five hair combs. Sterling silver. Oh. <coughs> they haven't made a picture for us. What have that other ship side been up to? Clearly not much. Um, I've got your head pins. No, I've not. I've got your head bands, head combs. Third time lucky. I don't know what size they are, but they'll be our standard size. There we go. I've got my specs coming through. Here we have it. So, <laughs> still takes me half an hour to read it though, because they're all over the place. Eight by four millimeter, and you get five of them. The silver coloured on your, I imagine your brass. Doesn't tell mm. me that either. That's handy. Um, I've got. <laughs> Two different nails and wire, you've got 0.4 millimetre gauge, 10 metres, and 0.8 millimetre gauge, 10 metres. So there you go, they're your silver plated wire. So copper with silver plating, 10 metres in each one, giving you a total of 20 metres of wire. Two gauges, 0.4 and 0.8 mil. Then you've got 140 carats. Oh, these sparkling like there's no tomorrow hematite. I was going to save these to last, but they're, and they're so sparkly, I need to show them to you now. They're like little disco balls. They are gorgeous. Did you enjoy working oh, with these? Oh, yeah. That's, I don't normally get the shiny, really, really shiny stones like that, like that. But when it came through, it was, they just glitter. They're gorgeous. Aren't and they? And I did use all of them. <gasps> they, they are lovely. Well, you have made. Yeah. I can't believe how much you made. Seriously, it's blown me away. When you see what uh, Wendy's made, she's literally <laughs> going to be pulled over. These are just perfect. These three strands together of pearls. Have a look at these. Three strands of pearls in a kit. When, when, whoever gets three strands of pearls in a kit. I know you're just, as we were saying, we're just starting on your kits. Three strands of pearls. Well, it was a bit of a surprise when it came. Well, you'd actually, I, I know this story, because you were actually a little bit disappointed, weren't you? I was. Because they hadn't arrived when you thought they were going to arrive. Oh no, the postman came and went, and there was no package, and it was the first kits I'd had, and I was really bit upset by it. So I said, that's it, I'm going to go and clean out my art studio. So I went out and I pulled everything out. I was really down. And then um, Hayley, who works in my bar, came in and said, um, when there's a package. And I went, oh! And sh she said, what was Wendy, it she said? I have never seen an, an adult that excited, not even on Christmas Day. <laughs> so I was like, oh, my kids are coming, my kids are coming. And when I opened it, it was it was like Christmas, I'd, and there's two kits in there, so um, it was it was amazing. And I that I couldn't believe that they gave me the amount of um, pearls. pearls. <gasps> You've got three different colours from your silver colour. You've got your champagne, and then you've got your teal. This is this is more of a gold to me. Is it called gold? Champagne, mm. champagne, teal. And then these lovely blues. And then hold on a minute. Could it be that I have a totally natural longest strand ever of rondelles of pearls, which are phenomenal? This strand steals the show for me. Look at it. Oh, hello. They are. They are gorgeous. I didn't like to say anything because I, you, I could see you hiding. I was like, you know, behind the. Rob was like, yeah. where are the pearls, Ali? You saw me. I was like, shh. Yeah, there are, there are four strands of pearls, and that last one went on forever. It does, isn't it? It does. It's gorgeous. And they're all the same size? Mm, they're just really perfect little. You can lay them flat, you can put them on the side. They're kind of like buttons, together. but they're, they're, yeah. they're size enough to be rondelles at the same time. You yeah. don't have to make your mind up, you could use them as either. On the side, yeah. So, and you can, you can run them down in a channel bracelet. Um, they were lovely. And they, they have an amazing knacker to them. They're really lovely, they're aren't really, they? They're good, they're really nice quality, good quality pearl. And then they're totally natural, which yeah. is probably why you're, you're seeing that nacre so perfectly, because they're totally natural. You're getting mm. that, I mean, that quality for me blew me away when yeah. I first saw them. Um, woo, baby! says Joanna in Norfolk. I love yeah. that. It's a Friday night, <laughs> you say, isn't it? Whoa, baby. Um, whoa, baby. These are fabulous. I would get them just for this. Yeah. Whether I wanted to use a wire or not, whether I knew what I was going to make with them, just to get these white freshwater well, culture pearls. The rondelles are eight by five millimeter. They are fantastic. Should be only 42 pounds and 60 pence. Have we seen the jewellery yet? 
Can we see the jewelry before you change this price? Wait till you see this. Because you're going to see this and you're going to say £42, £6, happy with that price. That's the price it should be if we just bear in mind everything we would normally... You don't get the lady's face, no. So everything that you, you see there was made from this kit. Are you ready to see now the reduced price? Because it's Friday night and we just feel like it. You don't have to reduce the price of the kits. You are aware of this. This is just producer's prerogative. <sighs> we had 67 kits. I'm pretty sure they're going to be fully allocated. I have to be honest. I love all of it. But for 27.95, I would buy yeah. this Definitely. on its own yeah. at that price. Yeah, totally I'm natural. Totally fabulous. Would you, on its own for that strand, bear in mind you've had the chance to work with it, you've had the chance to see it on your own? Definitely. And you knew it without a price point as yeah. well, I, I mean, we don't get price points, we no. don't get, um, we don't get that they're natural. Or no, anything like you don't we get any get information, you just yeah, get them. Just yeah. like you would at home, really, you just get them. You get the kit, and you don't, you, you, well, when you get at, at home, you know what you're buying. Sort of of course, but, but if we'd sent one to you, you would have yeah. to maybe look into it. Um, but definitely, I opened those and I was like, I can't believe this. And they've sent those. And the amount that's on there, it's a long strand anyway for pearls, because they're all compacted in. Yeah. There's a lot on that strand, and you can do so much with it. Should we count them? <laughs> You'll be here all night. Oh, I'm happy to be. <laughs> <laughs> Approximately 38 centimetres. You've got... Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, ten. One, th is that what's that? 40. 30 or 40. Yeah. Thanks, Coral. <laughs> Coral's the <laughs> only <laughs> person in this building who actually <laughs> listens to me when I count. <laughs> Everyone else is like, see, Rob, how many have you got? <laughs> Not telling. Listen. Two, four, six, eight, ten. That's me on 40 now, right? Two, four, six, eight, ten. You don't need to sound too enthusiastic, Rob, but it's 50. Two, four, six, eight, ten, right. 60. Two, four, six, eight, ten, seventy. One. Two, four, five. Seventy-five. Seventy-five pearls. If we sold these at 50p a pearl, we'd still make profit. Gosh. Wouldn't we? Yeah. A lot. £27.95. Are we having a kid on? Can we just... Um, Rob, Rob, can you please... Mate. Um, <laughs> can you please divide my £27.95 between my 75 pearls, please? I would like to know how much I'm paying just for that. And the rest is all you get. Th 37 pence wow. per pearl. And that's not counting any of these three strands of pearls or these beautiful hematites or any of the silver wire or any of these. So if you're happy to pay 37 pence pearl and then get all of this for, well, no, no pence, Sorry. then, then we're, we're looking at something pretty special. I am really surprised at that price. When I yeah. saw the kit, um, very Sheila. Very yes, boutique, boutique style, boutique isn't style. It? and those have always gone for a, a greater cost than that. Uh, so that has shocked me. It's an amazing price for that. And the, those pearls alone, the, just those pearls alone, and the colour on the other ones that are gorgeous. That's oh, ridiculous. It's an amazing price. Not ridiculous, and people out there are really lucky, lucky to get them. Yeah, I yeah. know what you mean, though. It's funny because when you think of something, you think, well, what? 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 Oh, that's from, um, what's it called? Sword in the Stone. Archimedes. What? 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 Is that what it is? <laughs> what do you mean you don't know? You never watched Sword in the Stone? I'm sure it's from that. You know the owl? Yeah. Isn't the owl I... called Archimedes? Yes. And he starts tidying up. And he's got everything tidying up. Sorcerer. Everything's been away and the sugar's going out and out and out. And oh, that's the young lad, isn't it? That's yeah. the uh, apprentice. That yeah, I think so. Oh, maybe. I think I've not. watched so many of them in my time. 
<laughs> anyway, what, what? Should we go and have a look then? Um, because you've been, we're going to come and join you now. Oh, you asked me that earlier, and we, I didn't have the answer because I was too busy opening my parcel. <laughs> And I said I would ask Rob, and then I didn't, because Martha came in and she was having a look at your jewellery, so it all went peep tong. Right, sorry, Coral, I'm walking a wee bit fast. I forgot I was on the telly, and I was forgot you were coming with me. <laughs> I just thought I was walking with my friend. Um, right, as you can see, it's very, very busy tonight. Yeah. Lots and lots and lots of you getting involved. How much did you enjoy working with this? Loved it. Yeah? Absolutely loved it. As soon as I got the first piece I did was the dragonfly. Mm -hmm. um, the colours were just... Uh, perfect for it and I, was, um, yeah. and I literally on each of the kits I've had wanted to work with the whole of it and I've worked it but I did still have some pearls left um, that's incredible isn't but it but my wire ran out so I, and because you're not allowed to add anything to it I was like okay but I could have made another few pieces mm. um, with it as well if I'd added my own wire to the stash. Isn't that unreal? It was gorgeous. It's, it's just opulent and it's pearls. Um, there are a few children's ones in there for bridesmaids because mm. of the headpieces. So I made a few necklaces and smaller bracelets. Um, it, it went on and on. Mm. And the pyrite's just glitter. I, 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 haven't, I haven't bought pyrite with a sparkle like that before. Yeah. Um, and it was a real surprise when they come through. Do you think I, you would use them now? I definitely now that use you've them, had them Yeah, definitely. It's funny that, isn't it? Maybe something you wouldn't ever normally get, but because it's in a kit, well, you have to really work with it. You don't have a choice. Yeah, you kind of get into a, um, a not a rut, but a, a, a system of buying Yeah, well, you get into gems that you, you like, like yeah. Um, and now and again, it's really nice to buy some, or have something even nicer. They've sent me. <laughs> yeah. I just got to play with it. It was um, beautiful. I absolutely adore this piece in particular. This is mm. one of my favourite favourites. That one, if you've got a bun at the back, mm. that one would just sits in and just sits on top of it perfectly. It's just stunning. Makes me think of Ariel mm. and Triton. Yes, yeah, that crown sort of uh, mm. effect. So gorgeous. Right, and we're allowed to have a wee look, are we, Rob? Yeah, no, I had to make something. Mm -hmm. Yay! Yay! Let's go for it. Okay. What would you like? Because we were talking about the hairpiece earlier, weren't we, with the flowers yeah. on it? Um, yes, we're going to do the... This one. That Oops. one. Knocking it all over. Or I can make the headpiece for you. It's up to you. Oh! Well, I'll stick with what you were going to make, because I know a lot of people at home will be thinking about this, but okay. I'll never say never at doing that another time. <laughs> Just bear me a second. No worries, this is fantastic. So you've got a wee bit of hammering going on, if my eyes see correctly yeah. in here in this one. We've got the hammer coming up in this hour for you. Seven o'clock hour? Yeah, this hour, isn't it? The hammer. Hmm. <laughs> What's that, mate? You busy there, Rob? He's really busy. I wrap this so well I can't get it out. No. Oh, can I help you? Sorry. Do you need anything? Yeah, I just what need, do you need? Um, the 0.44 because I ran out. Do you want? Can I use up mine, Rob? Is that allowed? Yep, I've got mine if you want. Sorry. No, you're fine. What one's not quite There we go. Ah, thank you. If you've just tuned in, hello there. I'm Ali. It's great to have Wendy on the evening show. Thank you. It's lovely to be here. Isn't it lovely to have her? And thank you for all your lovely messages as well. It's great to have you taking the time to drop, well, taking the time to even tune in on a Friday night when there's, I imagine, maybe lots of things you could do. You've taken the time to join. I know many of you watch just because Wendy's here, which is fantastic. So thank you. Thank you for tuning in. Okay, the first. Yeah, let's do it. I'm ready for this. Okay. okay, the first part I did was to make the flowers up. Yep, do you want me to take that off for you? Yeah, please. Yeah. Do we pointage? Yeah. So the first part we I'm gonna do is the flowers. And um we've we've previously made these, so I've shown you the Yeah, we had we look at those in the first kit. Don't worry if you missed it, you can always look back on YouTube once <laughs> once it's uploaded. It will be uploaded on the repeats. <laughs> but I'll just show you again how to make these because the little pearls take a little bit of jiggling to get them in place. Jiggle it. <laughs> just a wiggle little it. Bit. <laughs> okay, my son just hate me dancing on Sally. Ah, I embarrass my family all the time, I'm sure. They don't tell me I do, but I'm imagining. Oh, mine tell me. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to thread on five of the pearls. And these are the ones all came in the kit. So if you've got the kit, you've got the pearls. Yeah. And these are the darker teal ones. 
So you made a darker teal flower and then the lighter teal yeah. and the lighter blue as well. The darker one comes with five petals Ooh. and the lighter one with four. Ooh. So the one with the, the five is in the middle, yeah. the largest part in the centre. And then on the end, I'm just going to thread in the... Ooh, rondelle. Yep, the little ah. rondelle pearl. That's just gorgeous. They, they are. It's, when you're working with them, they're so easy to work with. Are they? Um, yeah, they just so they go together perfectly. Okay, so once we've got to this, and I always tie a little knot in. Sorry, I tie a little knot in the bottom of my coat, my wire, and that just stops everything falling off while you're doing this. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to wire wrap. Uh, I leave a tail, so I can, sorry, I leave a tail so that I can add that on when I uh, wrap it onto the comb. Of course. And then, let's see, I twist, only needs a couple of twists, the first one. Bring up the second one, just leave a little bit of a gap because you don't want them too close. Um, you won't be able to move them into a flower shape after. So curl it round, like that, and then twist. Just twist the pearl and keep, if you hold on to the, the two points of wire with your nails um, and then twist, it'll stay. And then again, oh, my pearl just flopped off. Hi, Ruth. <laughs> Inconsiderate. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so no, no, we're live TV. <laughs> What's it thinking? Oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> it could have done as it was told. I know, right? Again. <laughs> Just wire wrap all five of these. Do you want to find your pearl for you? I found it. It's okay. It's all good. There <laughs> it is. Thought you could get away. Nice try. Yeah. With beady eyes on it. On the. On the. Oops, hang on. Okay, sorry. Um, again, that's your fourth. And then your fifth. Oh, did the fifth one go flying as well? I didn't see that I one. I think it did, yeah. <laughs> Dropping things everywhere. Okay, so once you've done that, wrap the fifth and last one. Okay. And then you should have like a little starfish effect. Just like that. Okay. Wire wrap around again like I did before and take these so the petals over each other so they shorten slightly. And when you're happy, once you're happy with the outcome, take, there you go. The center doesn't, at this point, doesn't have to be um, neat or tidy. If that's the way you like to work with them, that's fine, but um, it just needs to be together and bound. Okay, then you take your pearl, and again, I go through the bottom of this one. The bottom being the flat part, yeah. so the more domed part of the... the yeah, these are very cabochonish. Yeah, they're kind so of they, button pearls, aren't they, they really? Yeah, they sit, whereas the wire's sort of a little bit bulky, these just sit perfectly on right top on of top. it. Yeah. Um, push it through Ooh. the bottom. So perfect for the middle of flowers then. Yeah, it is. And then when you're putting these on, don't push it right to the very end of the wire and push it in because you won't have room to move it over after. So just leave a tiny um, half a centimetre, not even that, enough to give it um, some movement. And then you just pop it onto the middle and wrap. Okay, wrap around, and I go in and out, just like one of the weaves. Um, whichever way you want to wrap these to make them stay in place and be secure, you can either, you can just go around one, around the back of the other, around the front and the back, and then you just bring the two tails down like that and you've got your flower. So you need one of those, 
and you need one set of four. And then oh, with the lighter. Yeah, of the lighter. So everything you did there, but use the lighter pearls and just use four. Yeah, and just use four. Awesome. And then the same twist te twisting technique um, is used for the pyrite, silver pyrite. Oh yes, so your sort of tiara twists, we kind of tend to nickname them. Yes, yes, tiara, tiara twists. So basically you just need um, a line of tiara twists that are about an inch long. Yep. Um, and then I wrap them in after. Okay. Your neck. Oh, sorry. No, no, you're fine. Just while you do that, I'm just going to bring you some different coloured combs because I've got some different coloured wire. Because, um, well, somebody was thinking that would go together, wouldn't it, really? Okay, <laughs> Julie. Sorry, I was looking for another thing. It's okay. <laughs> I thought you had something in your hand. I was like, oh, what's that? Nothing. Right. Comb wise, we do have the wires coming up which will match with the colours as well as having some extra colour in there too. They'll be coming up in just a second. Mm. But we're going to do the hair combs first. You're getting, did you say five of each? Well, I've got more than five. Well, yeah, clearly. One, two, three, four, I've got ten. Five, mm. six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Are you getting ten or have I got a, have I got a second sample joined in? Well, that's 40 pieces. Oh, no, 20. Yeah. Is it? But then the price is wrong, no. <laughs> it sounded really sad there. It's not. <laughs> it's really low even for Rob's standards. £11.80 for 10 of each. Oh. It should be. It's not going to be tonight. Oh, my word. It's gone. <laughs> Rob, I don't know how you're getting away with this tonight. It should be 11 40 or whatever, it's six ninety-five. Oh. For Wrap twenty. Them Wrap them now. That's amazing. That's, that's amazing. That is supposed to be five of each colour. I don't know what's happened. There's somehow twenty of each colour. Uh, no, so no no, ten of each colour in total twenty. <laughs> <laughs> You're giving away more. Oh my word, Rob was excited at the price six ninety five when he thought there was five of each. Now there's ten of each. He's worried. Sorry? No wonder they were flying out the door. He's like, they're exceptionally popular. <laughs> <laughs> you were so hefty. Uh, head combs before. You've never have you. He's never sold a head comb in his life. <laughs> 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 he looked at thought that's a good price. For five, the graphics he's got said five of each. We've actually got ten of each. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I think just take advantage of these and enjoy them. And um, he wants to move on swiftly, clearly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's still available. It's on the web. Phone us. It's still there. Sorry, Rob. You can't move on that quick. It's all still there. You'll find it. And then the wire. Yeah, I've got the wire. Don't you worry about that, sweetheart. I've got 0.6 point... Ooh, lots of different gauges, right? Let's have a look at what we've got. 2.6s in the antique and the silver. So they've both been copper originally, then silver plated with sterling silver, and then either antique plated or silver plated on top of that. And then 0.8 mil gauge. Again, you've got your silver plating, then your copper colour. And then same with the gold. Gold plated on top, or, or gold coloured, sorry, on top of your sterling silver, on top of your copper. Boom! So there's plenty there, there's 30, oh no there's not, there's 40 metres, sorry, 10 of each one, and then you're getting a variety of gauges from 0 0.4, 0 0.6 and 0 0.8. Gold 0.8, antique and silver are 0 0.6 and the copper is 0 0.8. So should be looking at £14.80. You c I love that. I'm going to match the previous price because I can. I don't know how much you can for how much longer you can. <laughs> wow. <gasps> so four reels of wire, 40 metres, 0 0.4, 0 0.6, 0 0.8 and then another 0 0.6. Mm. And mixing colours, that's, that's the same ga um, gauges that in the, in the, the kit. kit. So you can add into yeah. the kit with the silver, you've got then got the gold, you've got the copper, you've got the antique bronze and then you've got some extra silver. Yeah. As I say, because you'd ran out of wire, you had a few yes. gems left. So. Yeah, that, that, that definitely, I get that. And, and you can actually mix the metals um, anyway. I'm thinking Russian wedding band style, yeah. I adore that, I love that mix metal. I mean, you can make up those pieces with just different... Um, colours. Colour metals. And it would, each of those go perfectly together. And they all go with the pearls. 
hundred percent. I really would. Mm. So yeah, yeah. Fab. Really good. I'll leave those with you. If you need any assistance on those, please do either speak to the contact centre or drop us a message. I can help you, um, and I'll let you carry on with I'm where back. we are. Okay. My next section. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to make these small swirls. So these are the ones that have been hammered? Yeah, they're hammered. Lovely. And then they're bound together and then they're wrapped to the comb. Right. And it just gives that little bit of detail um, to the comb. And it just gives a little bit of stability to your flowers because you kind of yeah. weave those in. Stopping it. them dripping. Sometimes mine have dripped yeah. because they weren't yeah. solidly You wrapped. just need that. Uh, Almost like an extra frame. Yeah. Frame or like work. a canvas for you to put them on. Yeah. Fab. So, I cut... I believe it was six. One, two, three, four. Sorry, five. Mm -hmm. Lengths of wire. Five lengths of wire, and they are two. Oh, I've got a ruler now. Yeah, two mm. inches. Two inches long. <laughs> yeah, you've got a ruler, but once you put it on it, you can't <laughs> you get it can't off. Get it off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, these are quite simple little spirals. Basically, uh, you take your pliers to the end and do a little turn. Okay, so you're getting a pea. Now, I always, I take a little bit off of this, and these pliers are perfect for it. Just take a little piece off the end, and it'll stop it going that wrong shape. It'll give you a nice little curl. Okay, so then curl it, curl it, and just widen it. You don't want it a complete spiral. Um, you want it to start widening out and come back this way. So once you've done that, you take your finger, put your thumb underneath and your finger on top, and just smooth it like that. And it'll start going into the shape that, oops, sorry, <laughs> that's too high, into the shape that you want. Yep. Okay? Take the other end and you want to curl the opposite direction. So if you curl this one down, this one needs to go up. So take your pliers and twist. Like that. Take a little bit off. There. And turn. And again, you start the turn, but you want it to come out. You want it to be a little bit wider. There you go. Now, once you've got five this shape, you need to hammer. Sorry. Oh, don't apologise. I love it. Rob, this is for... This <laughs> Rob got really excited. Yes. Went, oh, we've got the hammer. This is for the time tonight. Should we get a job? to go and get that? I'll go and get yeah. it. I'll leave Coral, because Coral's on the camera. It means you can look at that, and I'll go and get it. Okay, can I hammer now? Go for it. Has Rob left the room? Okay. Oh, you've got the hammer. It's just the block, I need. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Basically. And the anvil. Ooh, it's heavy. It's a heavy block. As I showed you before. But if you move it out, instead of just hammering down, um, just move your hammer to the sli slightly to the side as you do it. Okay, I'm going to carry on straight now. Otherwise, it'll take quite a while to do. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> that was nearly the glass. Oh no, it's not. It's okay, Fat Eye's fine. I didn't just drop an anvil on it. <sighs> it's fine, that's what they should. Oops. Are we okay? I, it slid out the box. I I'll just keep hammering. And once they're flat, okay, you have two little spirals and they're nice and flat. Lovely. Okay. At this point, I'm just going to do this one quickly. <laughs> I'm a producer, say, Ali, I haven't put this bundle together. I've just looked at what it's supposed to be and then what the start price is. I've no idea what's happening. Oh. So maybe... <laughs> so 
the night is the latest. Rob hasn't made the schedule. He's no idea what's going on. I have no idea what's going on. Rob's crying in the gallery now. So we're, we're he, it. he just went, I was supposed to go out for a pint with my friends. <laughs> we'll get through, Rob. We'll get through. All right, Rob. I'm just going to quickly have Oh, he's enjoying one. it. He's just concerned about my job. <laughs> He's not all concerned about his. His, his um, he's past his appraisal. Yeah, he's fine now. <laughs> okay, so once I have these, I'll take a little bit of the 0.4 wire. Fabulous. And I quite often have um, offcuts oh, yeah. in a box. Yep. So if one of our storage boxes that we had earlier. Yep. Yeah, perfect. I wonder if any of those are left. Just. I usually just will, um, wind up the ends a bit, and they're perfect for doing things like this instead of using your kit wire. Oh, we've still got some of those boxes. They're £6.95, and, and the code is HWGC04 if you want it. Okay. What you want to do now is take your two... Uh, sorry, sorry. Take your two flattened spirals in your hand and put them both the sa go in the same way. Then take your right hand and your left hand and move them around and pop that one just in to the crevice there. You see that? Yep. And then hold it. Now you want to wire wrap these. So just a couple of little wraps. And is that the point 0.4 maybe? Yeah. Yep. Awesome. Yeah, I usually use point 0.4. I don't use point two uh, five. 0.25. It's too fine because these are structural. So you want them to hold together. Fab. So just wire wrap those together at that point. Okay. And then again, at this point here, I don't know if you can see, where they, so you want the two central ones together, and then you want just as the circle comes around and goes onto the framework there, wire wrap again. And you'd only need about two or three wraps to hold that. Okay. And then again, bring it over. Cut this off. And this one tail there. Sorry, can you see that? All right. So you've got the center piece and those two pieces. And then finally wrap the last link so where the circle touches the main part of the soil there you just wire wrap those two together as you do it you'll see it gives it structure and then at this point you take 0.4 again oh <laughs> it's okay Ali <laughs> I need it on the floor um, and you simply wire wrap onto your comb just once or twice to secure it and then take your swirls that you've put together okay and you need to attach them just attach them to the comb so you go around and in through the teeth in through the teeth and it will wire wrap this quite neatly to the frame keep going around until you come miss two teeth and then come to this part and then just wire wrap and as as you go along you'll have had each of your little swirls and you'll wire wrap at the base onto the comb once you've done that now you have to forgive me because producer rob was panicking in the gallery um, and i've now understood why what we're about to do with the hammer mm -hmm. and the block and the anvil mm -hmm. It was due to be forty pounds and eighty-five pence for the three of these on the web. It currently says this, and Rob cannot change it. Oh, oh, okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'd grab this if I, if I was you. Rob is currently crying. Yeah, a little bit, um, and I'm laughing, which is not helping the situation very much <laughs> at all. This was supposed to be forty. But he's literally got his hand in there, as you can see him. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> this is supposed to be forty pounds and what eighty pence. So 85, so what are they individually? Is that just making it hurt more? Let's just leave it. Let's just leave <laughs> yeah, it. Don't, don't, don't um, it's not that price today. Um, you get the hammer that, of course, Wendy was yeah. using. You get the block. You also get the anvil that 
Nearly broke the pad eye. It's fine. It just chipped the side of it a little bit. <laughs> it's 17.95. Rob had to do the price because he put the graphics in and then realised what was happening. Um, yes, I can hold the hammer with it for you, Mike. If I had a hammer. <laughs> We're doing well tonight. Sorry. <laughs> you get the hammer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's because I was looking at it from the TV point of view. I wasn't looking at it myself. You get a hammer? Now you know how I feel. <laughs> oh, I know. That's why I can never do your job. I have to say this is amazing. Is it? This why is, do you love it so much? Uh, when it's really shiny and it's lovely. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> we, that is a reason to buy an shiny. anvil. It is shiny. Um, my, little, my youngest son came in and went, wow, what's that? That's so cool. But it, it has so many indents. That's that you can indent um, piping and move it. So oh, I thought that yeah. was just for holding. No, you can put pipe around that so Ooh. the pipe fits in and you can bend it. Um, that you can form shapes with. So if you wanted a bracelet that raised, you mm. can do it that way. Um, you can, this part. And you can thread your wire through it as well. You've got a yeah, hole in it. You can hold the wire. Um, it, <laughs> Rob's like, just leave it now, Ali. Yeah. Stop talking about it. Leave it. I want to pretend it never happened. I'm leaving it. We're going back to the demonstration. Okay. It's fine. I'm moving it. I don't know where I'm going to move it, but I'm moving it. It's all right, Rob. <laughs> you can take your head out your hands, sweetheart. It's okay. <clears throat> okay. I'll be going back. Oh, I'll move the anvil. Sorry. No. There you go. Right. Okay. So, <laughs> at this point, you need to attach your flowers to your comb. All right? Yes. So, <clears throat> so you literally... Take one end of your raft wire over the top and then take the other end under and through the teeth. Okay, pull slightly and you'll start wrapping. And basically, do that again. Take it over the flower, I find, because that will give it far more substance and it keeps it in place. Uh, round and back and then back with the back one and down. Over the flower, down through the teeth and around and back. So you basically sew it onto the frame. You take your second flower which will be your four petal flower, um, the lighter colour, and again wire that on just after this piece here and that'll graduate it for you okay and then once you've done that which is fairly simple take some more 0 0.4 which is why I ran out of oh I dropped it didn't I excuse me <laughs> sorry no that's fine we've got a couple of minutes what is it two, yeah. what, two minutes that's okay right I'll do two of these for you one fabulous oh and these are the the humid uh, the pyrites aren't yeah, they and fasted then, right. and coated sterling Take well, one sterling silver, sorry, silver coated. One pyrite, I make tiara a tiara twist. twist. Now I go along about. Oops, 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 come on. Oh, it's hematite, sorry. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay. I picked up from what you said and I didn't even read it. <laughs> I, put, I put my finger in between, my hand in between, and I'll. Oops, 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 oops. Oh. I wrap. Uh, if I have my glasses on, it helps. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting new ones. Hi, Martha! <laughs> okay, so take this up. And she I'm just waved. going to do... I'm going to do a few. Just, I'll just do two, because we're just about out of time now. Uh, and it looks like that. Okay. Right, once you've done that, uh, once again, anchor your... Anchor your uh, 0.4 through your comb and around, around the front, so it anchors it, and that's that bit. And then you literally, you see, pull through, the, pull your wire that isn't twisted through the teeth and back around, and then through the teeth and back around and then you'll get your wires sticking up so there's your little tiara twist wires and obviously you'll have a lot more on this that you'll have done yes 
and then you literally you just go along so you'll have another one there and you'll add it to it and that will give you the very pretty little it's stunning. sparkle so stunning and that's not i mean that can be bridal that could be daytime prom. that could be prom it yeah. could be a huge ride christmas parties yeah i mean this like that's, these are very um the colors of a certain frozen program disney movie yeah but, um, my nieces would love these mm -hmm. they're little and they would love them I love them <laughs> <laughs> and the really good thing is that I've got really fine hair and these stay in they do don't they yeah the, the quality of the combs I know we're wrapping around them and it's all about the gemstone it's all about how we wrap and the design on top of that but as you say the combs even though you just yeah, we just got 20 combs for 6 95 <laughs> but probably shouldn't mention that because that was no. nothing to do with Rob. That's just where it was. Um, yeah, definitely. Those are, um, these, I know you've got to play with. You could uh -huh. drop them in within oh, this. Oh, yes, 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 yes. In the centre. Mm. Mm, maybe I'll have got that. Enjoy well, those. Done, <laughs> Saying nothing. Absolutely love them. Um, Wendy, thank you so much. Thank you. Love it. Uh, all of Wendy's pieces will go up on Facebook in due, due course. Don't worry if you're not on Facebook, if you're not uh, in social media wise, I'm going to jump over here. I'll leave you with that. Brilliant. Um, as I say, don't worry if you're not on Facebook or YouTube or, or whatever it may be. You can always have a look at the social media treats on the page without actually being a member. So it's not a problem at all. Right, I've got lots and lots to bring you in a very, very, very short space of time. So let's shimmy on into. Just in case you're wondering what, oh, they came out in a black pouche, what I've just got. Now, that's not, this isn't the, the purple sari, but let me just quickly show you this, because this is what I've just given to Wendy. They're amazing. Mm -hmm. So Wendy's just got these. How gorgeous are these? Clear quartz. Double faceted on each side. I'll tell you all about them in a second. They're stunning. They're coming up. But I'm going to jump in these because you've actually had a play with these. Yes. Brief. A brief play. Oh, you missed the pumpkins earlier, Martha. Carnelian pumpkins. <coughs> $6.95. Wow. They might have, I do apologise for the bands of the elastic nature, but just holding them in place. Thank they would be everywhere, which is, is where they are currently. And on your side of the, t on the, of the studio. Oh. oh, you've got a bigger bust. Yes. To show <laughs> off. <laughs> but the higher height. Rob! Stop <laughs> <laughs> Do you want it there? And then that one is bigger than the one to the right of it, which no. shows off better. <laughs> Carl, can you show the one that we were going to put it on, just so you can see? It's clearly, that is clearly bigger. Love it. Makes me think of him um, aboriginally, also like fire yeah. dragons. It's a really, it's a lovely burnt orange kind of uh, colour, and but it's really sparkly and bright. It was lovely to play with. I literally just wrap, wrapped it around the um, framework um, to bring it, bring it around, bring it through, and then tied it off with a bow at the back. Love it. And it's quite soft. It is, isn't it? Mm. It's fantastic. But showstoppers coming your way. Obviously, I just straight away want to put it around my head. <laughs> Because it reminds me of a uh, fame. Yeah, it's what we're doing. Oh, it's a thinner one. Ooh, I've not seen this gauge before. All the gauges I've seen are bigger. This is lovely. If you have a look at it, it's like a figure of eight with the ribbon. Can you see? It's a figure of eight throughout the whole piece. It's so fabulous. If you know anyone who does disco dancing, this would be perfect. Six pounds and 95 pence. They're brand new. Oh my gosh, I love it. Fame, I want to live forever, yeah. I want to learn how to fly high. Oh, all, it's all, all unraveled now, <laughs> 10 metres. <laughs> Fame, <laughs> I'm going to live forever. What do you mean move off it? I was really enjoying my little <laughs> song. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm like a kitten with a ball of string. I'll take that. Have a minute. You didn't want you didn't want the purple one back, did you? Have a minute. This wasn't the showstopper. Right? Marry a late time. You do need quite a lot of this, don't you? 
Right, should we do it? Sorry, if you wonder what I'm doing, I'm literally just looking at myself in the mirror. She's <laughs> using the TV as a mirror to look at myself. <laughs> should we do it? Oh. Mario Light, let's do it. Hello there. This is beautiful. This is the first time I've ever brought anything like this oh, to your screens. This is a premiere um, for me, for the show, for the evening. My producer has never seen it before. I've never ever offered um, this variety ever like this in this colour. The only scapulite I'd ever seen before was yellow and this you will know as Marialite but in the past you may have known it as scapulite. Let me show it to you here. When I look at it, I look at the optical phenomenon that I look for in the Feltzbar family. I look for, in this particular strand, and when you get it home, I want you to see sort of shillers. I want you to see the most amazing, almost, inclusions that you would expect within your, oh, hello, within your sunstone, yet the shimmer and the sort of winking cat's eye effect that you would expect throughout a tiger's eye. There's so much blue tea. I, just, I mean, just this one, for example. Uh, if I show it to you, this gemstone comes in a variety of colours. You've probably heard of it. You, well, I'm hoping you'll have heard of it. You might not have, though. It's um, This is a really, really special treat uh, for here at Jewelry Maker. As I say, it's probably the first time you've seen it. Scapolite, you may know coming from the, the Greek word for... Um, Scapos meaning, uh, well, it means sort of rod or shaft, like due to the way it, it forms. It's a long sort of prismatic crystal in, the, in its natural shape. Originally it was found in Burma. Um, it was in 1913, or of course Myanmar at the time. Um, what we've got for you here is a gemstone that is really, really rich in sodium chloride, uh, but also rich in calcium carbonate. So your Marialite is more of the sort of calcium carbonate, whereas your Sodium chloride is more of the scapolite. It might be something you're interested in. You might not be absolutely, you might not care at all. It's very autumnal in its colour, the variety I've got here. But can you see what I mean about what you expect forming a tiger's eye? That individual sort of cat's eye effect, that chatoyancy is very, very, very rare. Uh, so rare, it's the first time I've ever brought it to you in this variety on, on Jewelry Maker ever. I've brought you scapolite before, but I haven't brought you the Marialite, which is from the same sort of family well, it's not sort of family, it is the same family. It's really, really special. You've got the chatoyancy there, as well as those inclusions within it. The crystal structure in it is tetragonal, um, dipyramidial. Doesn't matter if you know what that is or if you can ever pronounce it or never to say it again. It's just for your knowledge. You might collect particular gemstones with particular crystal structures. You might not at all. Doesn't matter. But you might be one that you look at and you think, oh, I've looked at the, the history on this gemstone or I've looked at the... Um, the the information on it and I've realised that that type of gemstone is one that I buy quite a lot. I must like that crystal structure so if it's the same one I might try it. Um, as I say it might or it might not. You can get a variety of colours, pinks, oranges, greys, yellows, pinks, purples, um, goldens and browns and that's more what we've got here. The greens, the goldens, the browns. $14.95 for a gemstone that if you love the Feltzbar family, if you love sort of sunstone, moonstone, in fact it's quite uncanny and the pink variety of this is sometimes wrongly described as pink moonstone. It's really, really special with the chatoyant to cat eye effect at the same time as well. There's so much going on with this gemstone and it's that wintry colour as well. It's quite autumnal. I think it's ticking all the boxes and for $14.95 to try a brand new gem you've never heard or possibly never seen before. I think it really is one that's totally natural that's worth giving it a go. You've got a 30-day money-back guarantee, and I think it's one that you will absolutely love. You're getting greens in there, you're getting burgundies in there, you're getting lovely, rich, almost chocolate browns. Then you're getting almost hints of dark, dark olive greens, almost verging on black. But for NCRU 21, 8 by 6 mil all the way up to 14 by 7 mil for you to get that 14.95 what is steals that's supposed to be 27.95 my memory serves me correctly wow wow oh no it was 17.95 i was wrong fantastic we have pearls coming up as well as these have a looky looky here put them together you don't have to put them together we're doing them separately so it's completely up to you i quite like them together to be fair i think they're quite different Mmm, this will go with Wendy's previous kit, actually. 
would go amazingly. Do you see that? Mm. How far would that be? You totally would, wouldn't you? So would. So we've just had that kit. If you have got it already, the whole kit went to train 795. I'm still struggling as to understand as to how or why, but it did. These are coming up in the next hour as your showstopper. Um, and I'm allowed to choose the next treat. Oh, I want, I want to do these. Can we do these? Or are these in the next hour? Do them now. They're fabulous. Don't worry, you don't need to rush. You can use them later. You still use them. just want to do them now, because otherwise you might not get to do them if they're in the next hour. Might not have... Well, they might lose them from the schedule, is what happened the other day. That would be horrendous. <gasps> Love them. They are clear quartz. They've got a concave facet, and that's on both sides. It makes me think of a little top, um, spinning top in its shape, but much better looking. No disrespect to spinning tops. 10 millimetre in their size and a 16 centimetre stone. Love or love? Absolutely love. Without a shadow of a doubt. What do you reckon? They... Uh, when, without a shadow of a doubt, these are the sort of calibre that you would have in those boxes of three. You know, the packs we have are three with one individual gemstone with a drim ho drill hole at the top. Yeah. That's what I'm looking at here. Uh, but you're getting a fair few amount here. Hold on. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven, approximately on a strand. Sorry, it was just moving. It was tickling my leg. Having been seen once before, coming in a black pouché with 55 in stock. Is it? 1995. I was thinking much more than 29.95 minimum, 34 or 29. Oh, these definitely the 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 cuts. Um, I've had some of the the ones that you're talking about. The, the in threes the boxes. are really expensive. These are I they're clear, and I was really surprised that it's got the points on both sides, yes. which gives it a lot Double of versatility. Um, beautiful, definitely Love get them at that price. Mm. 1995. I'm oh. really, really pleased. It's giving us a chance to try a strand that should just never be this price, really, in any month of Sundays. But it's Friday, so we can do it. It's fine. Uh, 0800 644 You can join me on the phone line. You can join me on the web. Dillonmaker.com, whichever is most convenient for you. SWZC01 is the code. Join me when you can uh, and enjoy it. Everything on the website is going to be there available. Uh, we're just about to move on to the next hour, we're about to have a short break. If you are watching the repeat and it is not 8 o'clock p.m. UK time, uh, then of course you will not be able to see the next hour, unfortunately, because it's only the first three hours of the evening show that are recorded. So please forgive us for that. But you can always go back onto YouTube and watch the rest of the show, but you won't be able to get it. So those of you watching live on 8 p.m. UK time on Friday night, I'll see you on the other side of a very short break. Get creating stunning designs in no time at all with this brilliant introduction to Kumihimo DVD with guest designer Sarah Elvin. These easy to follow steps on this DVD will make you feel like you have your own personal tutor and will show you the best techniques to get you started with this amazing medium. To get your hands on a copy of this fantastic DVD, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? The more you learn about amber, the more fascinated you become with it. Now we all know that some gemstones over many years will fade a little bit. It's just Mother Nature's way. She keeps it underground, it's nice and dark, it's nice and cool, but retains its colour. But leave it in the window uh, over you know, decades, you know, a, a really nice, even beautiful amethyst will lose a bit of colour. Amber's actually the opposite. When this was cut and faceted about 80 to 90 years ago, it was more this colour. It was full of oxygen. But over the last 80 to 90 years, as the oxygen evaporates out of the actual gemstone, it turns a darker, more rich orange. In fact, I've just been told that this beautiful box that was cut and made in the 1950s actually started off when it came into his family as an heirloom, more this colour. And as you can see already, the transformation.
chemical structure. The second group is your grandites, and these contain the more coloured varieties of garnets, and these are your calcium mineral in the chemical composition. Garnets themselves are actually a very, very well-known gemstone, um, instantly recognisable for their brown-red hues, and often used throughout history in jewellery pieces as well. They're very hard wearing, which makes them great for use in jewellery. And again, they are January's birthstone as well. And birthstones are always a favourite amongst jewellery makers. Did you know when you book on the Jewellery Maker Workshop, you are given exclusive access to our Jewellery Maker Shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. Bring it back, sing it back, bring it back, bring it back to me. Oh, I best sing it out. Well, it's kind of out of tune anyway. If it was in tune, we might get in trouble. Um, I'm Ali Defoy. It's lovely to see you. Welcome to you. I've got eight seconds. How many seconds was that singing for? Oh, I thought it used to be ten seconds. It's eight seconds now. Ooh, um, good good job, I stopped mid-song. I've got the gorgeous Wendy with me. How are you doing? Hi, I'm fantastic. You enjoying yourself? Yeah, I'm loving it. I always love it here. <laughs> it's brilliant to have you. Have you not had the chance to work together? This is the first time. I'm no, loving it's it. it's the first time, yeah. It's really cool. I love your coloured top. It's my favourite colours. And it's got a paisley pattern in it, which makes me love it even more. Yeah, it's quite, I like that paisley. It's very fashionable at the moment. Well, that's where I'm, I'm from. <laughs> <laughs> me neither. <laughs> but I'm from paisley, so I'm thinking, oh well. There we go. <laughs> something, something fashionable about me. Right, lots and lots for you this hour. I've got your Bebo Pearls. Oh, Coral, I haven't given you any of these star vines back. Would you like them? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Is that a no? Uh, <laughs> she's currently trying to bundle up my purple Zari rope. Sorry. Oh, she doesn't want them. <laughs> the elastic band is broke. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry, Rob. Sorry, Rob. I'm showing everyone our star vines. <laughs> He's just been Ali to be honest, don't mind what you do, you do what you want. <laughs> Can we get the Ali show? Ali and Wendy show? Yeah. <laughs> I'm in. Ooh, Red Aggie, is it? It's not Carnelian Winget. Well, actually, after what we had in the first hour, how mm. do you know? Carnelian of this size, totally natural. Goodness gracious me. I love the banding. I love how every single one's individual. Makes me think of a burning ember at the same time, it makes me think of um, sangria. You know, in the summertime. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. Lot of love for these. Quite lovely sheet. This is my. I want you to have a look at them and choose your favourite. I've chosen my favourite. I kind of slightly, a little bit, might have pointed it out. Have you got a favourite on this one? Yep. The deepest. What, deepest red or the darkest red? The darkest red, because it's similar to your feeling of excitement at this moment in time. Oh, is it? Oh, is that why you're so excited? My, can you guess my favourite one? Which one would I just be telling you? I didn't guess. No. Marmalade coloured one. No, I don't like marmalade. No. That one, that one, that one, that one, that one. That one, that one, that oh, one, yeah. that one. Stripey. Stripey in the middle. Loving it. What one's next? Blue fluorite. <gasps> oh, look at the colour of these. If you got the previous one, you'll be able to get this one, actually. Price point wise, yeah. Coral loving your work. That looks perfect. I think you should show everyone at home. <laughs> it does look like a little poodle. Can we, sh can we show everyone? Quick, squeeze it in. Look. Coral's wrapped up. It looks just like brand new. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. 
<laughs> you have Perfect. my job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I wish you used those elastic bands. Oh, Wendy, I'd be worried. <laughs> Sorry, Rob. Uh, I'm going off. <laughs> oh, I sound like a witch. <laughs> a little cackle going on. Here we go. 40 carat blue fluorite, totally genuine. We are totally natural, absolutely. They're 9 by 6 mil to 12 by 8 millimeter in their size. There's a 16 centimeter strand for you. And as I say, an uh, approximate gem weight of 40 carats. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Is that 13? I was trying to count that backwards in reverse. That was quite hard. I'm guessing. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Oh no, maybe it's 12. <laughs> slightly more than what you just calculated. About 60p a stone, approximately. Six pounds and 95 pence. Boom, boom, pow, loving your work. Love those genuine fluorites. It's not every day of the week we get those, although we've had them twice today. <laughs> Can I show you these? Appetite. <clears throat> Bear in mind our star buy of Appetite as well, coming up, Rondell's. Looking forward to these. Have a looky looky here. I love these. These are coming up. Not yet. These are the ones I was telling you about. Go, just appetite. Whoa, hello. Totally different, actually. Have it. They would go perfectly together. Look, appetite and faster drops, and then neon. Hello. I love that together. I think it looks perfect, especially if you added these. Would you or would you not? I totally would. Anyway, both of those are still to come. Appetite, totally natural. That colour is so rare to get, to get it totally natural in that colour. That, can I be honest? I don't understand why anyone calls it sky blue. It's not sky blue. It's that look of a Pariba tourmaline hue. It's, this is appetite to me. This is what I've always been brought up with. This is what I've always seen a jewellery maker, an accredited jewellery professional. This is the colour of appetite. This is the colour of neon appetite. Then you can get dark blue neon appetite. Then you can get green appetite. But this for me is traditional appetite. I don't understand why the word sky is in there. Or blue. This is appetite colour. This is what textbook example appetite should look like. I'll get over that rant one day. Not today though. No. But £19.95. If you ever textbook example looked up appetite, this is the colour I expect you to see. It's got other variants. Mm. It's got greens, it's got neons, it's got... But for standard, for your traditional, like when you look up a sapphire, you look up this colour. Will you drop it to 11 95 just to just to... Trying to undermine me, Rob. Just because you like to. Mm -hmm. It's amazing for it. I, I can't get my head around it. Lengthwise, it's 32 centimetres. They start at 6 by 3. They go to 11 by 6. There's 125 carats here. It's far too low. There's loads of stones on there. They're, and they're really nicely cut and a beautiful colour. A natural. Just, yeah. As we were talking about earlier. That colour goes with, like, with, the, with your skin, skin colour and that colour goes perfectly. Thank you. Does that mean I get them, Rob? Yeah. <laughs> Share. <laughs> Dips. Enjoy those. Kent, Cumbria, Michigan taking the time to join us. Love those. Love the dendritic opals. Yes, let's do them. Let's get it on. And they're really big as well. Ooh, hello there. <laughs> Almost boulders. They are very big. I mean, I don't call them a boulder, but they're gorgeous. Uh, two, four, six, eight, nine approximately in a strand. And 70 carats. It's almost sort of pebble effect to them. Quite love them. It's the first time I've ever really seen a caramelly colour. Usually they're more the, the white with the dark grey or the sort of blues. It's a little bit different, isn't it? 13 by 9 mil to 16 by 10 millimetre on an 18 centimetre strand. Lots of love for these. Yeah? Dendrite is exceptionally popular, especially in opal. A lot of people have seen it in agates, but very few people have seen it in the opal. Oh. That's... He's been naughty again. No tree will ever be the same. Totally natural. Dendritic inclusions, which are sort of fern-like and moss-like and branch and tree-like inclusions. Mm. That's what you want to expect. 
And the bigger the size, usually the higher the price. Yay, what? Six pounds and ninety pence. <laughs> Corals. Oh, you're gonna go off coral, literally just went. Gold-plated 925 sterling silver jump rings, and they're open. Nine mil, they are very sizable, aren't they? With over 200 weaves opening up in your chain mail, just by having the nine mil size, I think it's definitely one to get a hold of if you can. Oh, look at that one, having a wee party. I'll just leave it there. 20 of them. No, <laughs> they've just linked already. Um, now we're wearing 3.9 grams, it's more than an average wedding band. It's a lot of, lot of sterling silver there with a lot of gold plating on top. Uh, and as I say, they're 9 mil, which changes your weaving opportunity dramatically, doesn't it really? So with sterling silver as your base, gold plating on top of that, 20 of them, 7.95! Do you use much sterling silver and, and gold jump rings or just jump rings in general? Um, I use jump rings within pieces um, to connect things, but I do intend doing the chain, chain mill course. Oh my gosh, yes. I, I, I just need that, need that time, the, 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 the patience and somebody to actually show me properly the ways because I do get a little bit frustrated, but I do use them a lot within pieces for connections and I also use them around um, braids. Mm -hmm. So that if it's but like say a simple black black braid um, with just the rings in the centre and a stone either side, I do use them like that Ooh, quite often. Oh, that sounds lush. Very nice for men's jewellery. Yeah. Mm. Love those. Enjoy them. You make quite a fair few Mobius flowers with twenty. You make two at mm. least. Right. Let's have a look at. Ooh. Now there doesn't seem to be anything in my box twenty. What's it meant to be? Oh, Wendy's got it. What was it? Those big... Oh, wow. All right, let's have a look at those then. Can we do um, it? Oh, we can come to you, possibly. Can we? Yeah. Well, that's technically what I meant by come to you. I wasn't moving. I don't know. <laughs> They're all panicking. <laughs> oh, you mean you're going to walk? No, I'm not moving. Um, love it. How are they to work with? Really, really good, easy. Um, it's just a simple wire work frame with the large wire that I found. But the thick, what this thick wire is really easy to use. Is it's that the? Um, I'm not sure. Two it's mil aluminium. Yeah, I think it must yeah, be because the it's the soft wire. Yeah, it's really simple for that gauge to to actually move and manipulate. So Perfect. I'm surprised. Um, with the cord from earlier, and this one's but very simple to just set. Beautiful and just a um, wire wrapped cuff bracelet. Oh gosh, yeah. Um, and because they're, because of their shape, they're quite a large, uh, large stone for that shape. You don't often get it that big. So yeah, lovely. it's unusual in that size, absolutely. The I'd 40 by 25 mil rectangles, puffy I, rectangles. I really would love to take two or three and wire wrap them into a piece. Uh, like a grand piece like your neck, like yeah. Game of Thrones yeah. idea. <laughs> yeah, definitely Game of Thrones. <clears throat> Wow. We could have one coming up. So, for example, those people who are thinking, I love that necklace, I want Game of Thrones, Thrones style um, mm. design inspiration, would these be good ones to get? Yeah. Because obviously the one you got was something you picked up and you had in your stash, but for everyone watching at home, they won't have that. No. Is this something that you could get in preparation for that, maybe? Yeah, this, uh, you could, I would have, oh, you, sorry. I would obviously have to do a design around it because this piece is designed around that cover of course, shone. Of course. But yeah, if I was to do a piece and design it within a, a set of squares, um, you could do you could do that similar sort of piece. Wonderful. Um, with the wire work framework. Right, let's get the price in there. Nine ninety five, how many did you get? Is that the full strand no, on there? Two, two, four, six, seven approximately. Seven. And was there um, one there an extra one? How many's one? on there? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven I think. Seven. seven I counted. Seven and there's two left somewhere. It's approximately nine, nine on a strand. 
guaranteed 700 carats. It would have been a strand, obviously, we've, we've used it because we didn't have a second sample. So that's approximately nine mm. on there. Enjoy that. That's amazing. Well done, Wendy. Thank you so much. Thank you. It's fab. Should we do some lemon quartz? Oh, yes. Shake it why up. Why not? I've got it, Rob. He <laughs> thought I might. carrots for these for you. No, this is really bad. It's not really bad, it's really good. Um, I've got a lemon meringue in my fridge. Mm. I don't have anyone to eat it with at home. I might just make myself a lemon meringue when I go home and eat it by myself. <laughs> is that really bad? No. Well, I didn't say I was going to get into bed and eat it. That makes it sound even worse, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Mike would do. But this is making me think of the gorgeous golden lemon, yummy lemon meringue mm. in my fridge. Mmm. £9.95. Oh, that is... They're like little bubbles. They are. Mm. Bubble of sunshine goodness. With a lemon twist to them. Quite zesty. Mmm. It's a really lovely lemon that is really Isn't fresh. It? Um, they go really nicely in um, bracelets with just silver beads in between. The ones we had colour. earlier. Yeah. Those lovely ones. Yeah, and maybe with the blue. Did we have blue sapphires bubbles earlier? They were tanzanite ones. With the tanzanite. Mm. Mm. Six ninety-five. Amazing. 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 You can make a lot of pieces with that. Lovely in um, bridal headwear. Just uh, wired on, like, lovely? yeah. And even if you're just going to a wedding, because fascinators are something mm. that we, we make and, and we take with us, and maybe even a corsage or a, a little buttonhole. Yeah, those sorts of things, are that kind of price, they? add it to your order, put it in your stash, and at some point, if you're, um, if you're going into weddings or somebody asks you to do it, they, you will come that need that colour, and that price, six ninety five, mm. you've got it, and you can show people. I think it's lovely and they go really beautifully with navy. Some yeah. rich blue gemstones, deep lapis lazuli would go lovely with that. Green. I'll leave those with you, but six ninety five. So cheeky cheeky. Very cheeky. Swiss blue topaz is coming like the white quartz or clear quartz earlier in a black pouche. Oh my god. Gosh, these are incredible! Is this meant to be three figures? Okay. Um, this was supposed to be eighty seven ninety five. The reason I tell you that is because there's already been a reduction in the price, and we're going to have to match that. I say we're going to have to, but I'm not particularly. Well, it doesn't need to be put it that way. Wait till you see this. When you see it, you'll understand what I'm talking about. These are divine. Swiss, Swiss blue topaz. Thought to be reminiscent of, a, uh, of the sky in Switzerland on a beautiful, clear day. They're just divine. Do you like them? Um, I'm in love with those. Oh. They are beautiful. They're sparkling, they're clear, they're... Colour stuff. colour. It's like... I don't, I don't, I've never seen anything like it. It's beautiful. It's like a Disney sky. Mm. The reason I always refer to Disney is because I think it's just magical and perfect. I love Disney too. Do you? I'm yeah. so glad. Martha oh, hates Loads it. of them. I made, apparently Martha watched a, a Disney film and I made her do it. <laughs> don't believe it all, but yeah, she didn't like Disney. No, it, that is... I'm a little bit obsessed with it. And I found it amazing that Disney has a daughter and her second name is Disney, Ms. Disney. Ms. Disney. Ms. Disney. Disney. Yes, what's your name? Miss Disney. <laughs> How amazing would that be? Hi, Miss Disney. A, requ a, requ a request, a request uh, from Tina. Hiya. You've said, oh, mine sales says, whoa, baby, from Joanna. Right. Um, hi, please congratulate Michael and Go on the, br I hope I said that correctly. 
um, on the birth of their twins. They are 10 weeks, oh gosh, 10 weeks early, but they are doing well. I need an idea for a baby boy. Oh, Tina, a massive congratulations. Oh, all our lo everybody in Jillian Raker in the gallery and everybody here, mm. massive, massive congratulations and our love from all of us and, and keep well and I'm glad, I'm glad you're all doing well. Um, well, here's a blue gem, a Swiss blue. Let's see what we can do on this one for you. £87.95 was supposed to be your price. Um, this wouldn't have been reduced. Only reason we're reducing it is because it has been in the... No idea it was going to go to £59.95. That's... Is that what? £30 off? Just shy off? Just shy of £30 pounds off, off per person. Can't, we can't afford that. I don't, I don't even know what to say. The quality, just one of them yeah. as a charm. November is Bristol, just one of them as a gift. This is a strand I wouldn't... Well, it depends what you want to do. Everybody's different. Maybe you want to put it with diamonds or sapphires. But yeah. For me personally, I would just use one at a time for individual gifts. Yeah, I think if you're looking at um, stretching it out, um, a charm on a sim simple silver bracelet, um, just one, that's all you need. But um, if you wanted to be really extravagant, yes, you could use quite a lot in a brace in a necklace piece for yourself. There's <laughs> approximately 36. 36? Approximately 36 on one strand. Mm. I'd be tempted to use the, all of them for me. <laughs> 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 and not give them to anyone. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, I just found those, but they were in the other box. Oh. <laughs> um, what was meant to be in box 19? Oh, I've got them here. Sorry, that's why I took them out. <gasps> love, 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 love these. Oh, my gosh. How you doing? I'm doing fine. How you doing? Amazing. What do you think? Guaranteed 10. They're all the same size, 20 by 15 mil. What do you think? I want them and Rob never gave me them either. Nope, he wouldn't have done because there's not that many, is there? Ah, they like those bubbles. You know when you, you blow bubbles, the kids... Mm -hmm. Forever uh, blow. Oil and water bubble. sort of look. They look from here gorgeous. Sparkly. Really sparkly. Really orient, like the orient almost that you would expect from a pearl. What are you laughing at? We had a fun text message. Oh, you're just giggling. They're gorgeous. Mm. Just a ring, prong set ring. They're fairy tale, aren't they? Mm. Do you wear it that way? Look at that natural juicy effect on the surface. Obviously they've been yeah. coated to give you that colour, but the actual twinkle is, is the forming of the gemstone is totally natural. See on that screen it looks silver. Mm. But by, <laughs> by eye you can see from here all of the other colours. Yeah. You can't really see it as well on there. It's almost like white pearlescent mm. paint. Or if you've ever used white pearlescent um, sort of micro powders. Yeah. It, oh, yes, yes, I know, yeah. Should we get a wee price on? You get 10. Scenes as Christmas is on the way. 1995. I wouldn't thought I was bonkers today when I was mm. buying Christmas presents. <laughs> it's not long. Yeah, well, <laughs> well, I've got some money because I got paid. I'll use it. Until it turns up Christmas Eve and I'll be like, uh-oh. Then I'll be in real trouble because <laughs> Mum's birthday's on Christmas Eve, so <laughs> sticky bubble then. Oh. So 1995. Brilliant. It's quite funny. My Mum's birthday's on Christmas Eve and our neighbours is on Christmas Day. <laughs> 27th of December, Rob, is it? Oh, a December baby. 31st. 31st of December. Oh, my gosh, you get a party on your birthday every year. Yep. That's yeah. amazing. Oh, hold on. We're working the day after your birthday, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, oh. no! That sucks. <laughs> that could be an interesting show. Aww. Well, <coughs> but what happens if Coral phones in sick? <laughs> Sorry, Coral, I should have kept stum. I'm a rubbish friend. <laughs> right, lots and lots coming your way. Have a look at these. 
still to come. You've just tuned in. I'm not Ali Defoy. I'm, let's see, I'm Martha. <laughs> Enjoy these. These are coming up really shortly. You look really perplexed there, Rob. Everything all right? You are. <laughs> Oh, these would match perfectly with the previous kit. Oh. Slightly oh. larger. Um. They would be fab. They look like little footballs. Oh my word! Right, I have worked out what I'm going to do with all of this strand. I'm going to buy it. I'm going to make little football cufflinks for every man I know. You would wear them. They look <laughs> like little footballs. <laughs> They also look like fancy sparkling disco balls, mm -hmm. on the other hand, but purely because I'm thinking, what can I get? Yeah, golf balls. Do you know golf balls have approximately, is it 336 dimples? Is that right, Coral? Can you remember? I think so, yeah. 336 dimples in a golf ball, apparently. <laughs> exactly. Fun facts that I know. Um, these are gorgeous. I, want, I think they're the right size for a gent's cuffling, mm. for a sort of when a black tie event. I, I, yep, I'm there. Six ninety five. They'll wow. be the most inexpensive cufflinks I've ever made, and they're really heavy. The smaller. Five hundred ninety carats. Sorry, Wendy. The smaller strand when you pick it up is because it's hematite. It has a weight to it, so they're quite. Um, Twenty. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Thirty-two, four, six, thirty-six. That's 15, 16, 17, 18 pairs of cufflinks, if required. Ladies and gents, 19 pence a stone. Well, that puts those cufflinks in the other shop at £300 a pair out the window. Who's got three? Jill, I love your work mm. in Scottish Islands. Whether you get them for yourself, whether you get them for someone else, the weight of them is fantastic, which makes me want to wear them, make them cufflinks even more so. You don't have to, but I think it would be a brilliant idea. There's not one gent I know that I think would say no to them. I think they would absolutely be over the moon, and it would be a really good gift. You know when you give people gifts and they're thinking, thanks, you're thinking, oh, I don't know if they yeah. like that or not. <laughs> yeah. You know, these will be the ones that they talk about. Can always tell when my brother likes a present because he will go on about it. He's yeah. like, oh, that's really, really good one. See the way it does that? Oh, yeah. Well, like, oh, you see? oh, look, it does that. Yeah, he'll like those. Oh, I hope you're not watching. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh. Right. Is it time for a star buy? Yay! <laughs> Sorry, Mike. Mike had to hold the still for about five minutes because Wendy and I were giggling. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. I'm really sorry, Mike. I know you're not well. I'm really sorry. Wendy and I are really sorry. We're sorry, aren't we, Wendy? We are, very. We're really okay. sorry, Wendy. I won't do it again, ever. <laughs> <laughs> what are these called? <laughs> <laughs> Someone is trying to kill me tonight. It's a joke. I'm absolutely behind these. Let's just... Have you ever seen a pea Sorry. cook pearl before? Me neither. A pea cook pearl. Let's try them out. It's very pretty. What is a pea cook pearl? Well, <laughs> central drilled biwa pea cook pearl. You're getting the pea cook colour. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, more greens. <laughs> I'm 100% and like, the funny thing is I adore them like... They are beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry I might have laughed too much. AUGB53, get yourself... No, we can cheat. We will have it sorted. It will not arrive through your door as a peacock <laughs> pearl. It will be a peacock pearl. <laughs> But there's clearly a slightly typing error. 
Um, unless there's a type of colour that you know called pea cook that I'm not aware of. If there is, please do let me know. I would love to find out. But what I traditionally know as a peacock colour is the greens, the wonderful blues, those fantastic pinks coming through. I was watching a video on, on the tube of the U the other day with this wonderful peacock just opening its feathers and just parading around. It's incredible. They look beautiful. Mm. Stunning. They are the most beautiful creatures I think I've ever Aren't seen. They? They're so elegant with all their feathers and they just mm. turn around. I loved it. They're I just crazy. watched this peacock walking about. <laughs> it was really weird. It was a white peacock, but it was, it was just angelic. It was stunning. And this, I mean, this is what we love, isn't it? We love this colour. This colour never, ever, ever, ever can we have enough. There's never enough. And I say never say never, but today, well, the amount of people who have got these, um, and thank you very much. I do sincerely apologise for our typing error. Well, it wasn't any of our <laughs> typing error. Somebody else's typing error. I know they say don't play the blame game, but it actually wasn't any of us. Um, for your pea cook pearls. 30 have already been allocated, so thank you for... Um, accepting that, that there is a, a typing error. If you can get over that, we will be able to give you an outstanding price. I'm sure you'll be able to get over that, that spelling. We will re rectify it. We will rectify it before it gets sent to you. But for £14.95, a premier price for the Late Show for your pea cook pearls. <laughs> It's funny now, because when I say peacock, which is a real mm. name, it sounds rude. Yeah. <laughs> 14 pounds to 95 pence, 11 by 13 mil to 25 by 8 millimetre. I've now actually considered, is it really peacock? Have we got it wrong for so long? <laughs> um, you've got the quality, I mean, you can see those colours, everything you expect to see in a peacock. Mm. Um, you ever seen a peacock before, Emma? <laughs> a peacock, yeah. That's what we've got here, dyed peacock pearls. No. No? New one to you as well? Well, it's a premiere to everybody then. We've created something new. Something really special. Nobody else, unless those watching Jewelry Maker right now are going to get these. £14.95. The quality of them, the colour of them is magnificent. Mm. You're seeing the purples. If you put a purple gemstone strand with it, you'll see more of them. It's just the way this gem naturally works, especially with a pearl. The orient that you're getting, the nacres we were talking about, the layers and layers and layers and layers that you've got. Yes, it's been dyed, but that natural nacre is still there, it's still underneath, uh, and you can see it coming through in every single one. Martha, look, we've got some peacock pearls. <laughs> New variety, <laughs> just arrived. Really special. Did you? No. You launched them, peacock. Yeah, <laughs> not peacock. <laughs> She's leaving. <laughs> what the? I had one the other morning. Did you not notice that we're called peacock? <laughs> She's gone. She's gone. <laughs> new range of pearl that I've never seen it's before and we are the amazing. first and the latest one to see it but I mean you've already had the pleasure on the morning show of seeing this peacock pearl <laughs> <laughs> when we did them on Monday yeah when you did them on Monday I would put my life on it that they said peacock I don't think that Martha <laughs> <laughs> my it definitely does it says peacock <laughs> And we, sorry, we're not allowed to change it. We are. Do you know what? We get, have so many products and we're so busy trying to get them to air. We rush them through and sometimes the descriptions can be a bit wrong. So I'm sorry. I, if I could change it on air, I would do. But we, we can't, because that, that's, that's wrong. Now. But they are amazing. Do you think we'll be able to change it when we post it out to people? We'll Hell be able to no. change it we to definitely, peacock. I don't even know what a peacock is. Somebody that cooks peas for a living? <laughs> <laughs> You're killing me here. Petty pa, mushy peas. How many other types oh, of dear. peas? They're garden peas. That's three peas. There you Perfect. Go. They're adorable though. I'd like mm. them. We were talking about putting them in cocktail rings. Wonderful. Yeah. And then cooking them. <laughs> Not that in a pot. No. <laughs> what would you do with them? <laughs> Sorry, I'm still laughing. <laughs> um, I've lost all track. The ring would be very good. <laughs> Um, put, I would put them with the other kit, um, like the heads piece, you could put them in that, they'd go perfectly Definitely. with that. They would, wouldn't they? Are they centre drilled? Yes, they are. That's the one thing that's correct <coughs> on the graphics. Be what centre drilled <laughs> and that they're dyed, that's correct. Um. <laughs> <laughs> they would be beautiful with it as a necklace. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, wow. Oh. There we go. Enjoy those. Right, what's next? Oh, we're Cornelian. Wonderful. What a night. It's like three Cornelians in one night. Mm. Gosh, it's almost like a bus, isn't it? We never see them. And then we see three in one day. And all totally different shapes. They will go great with the previous shapes, great with the gorgeous orange Zari thread. They will go fantastic with the first strand of Cornelian that we brought earlier in the show. Have a Big look at ones. these. That'd be lovely, that combination, wouldn't it? Would that work? Yeah, and those big um, pumpkin ones. Perfect for that. Perfect. <laughs> oh, yes, the spacer beads. Those decorative spacer mm. beads, those sort of donut shapes. Oh, yes. They would be yeah, lovely, those gone. silver sort of pattern ones, reminding me a little bit of a Celtic pattern. Yeah, the, they'd be lovely in, in, in between those. They'd sit just nicely in there. What's that? Are they a 10 mil? Uh, 12. Ooh. Mm. But you're right, you never seem to see Carnelian for ages and then suddenly it'll come up on screen and in batches. Um, and I love Carnelian, it's a soft stone, Isn't really it? warm stone. Easy on the eye. Mm. It can be fruity in the summer or it can be warm in sort of wintry, if you, depending on what wire colour, what you put it with. 690. When is Carnelian 695? It's almost like that's the. the well, there you go. You'll know what sort of prices you'll see elsewhere. We are absolutely getting ready for autumn. Of course we are. You'll know what you, you fancy, um, and you'll know what you see elsewhere, and you know what size you're after. These are 12 millimetres round. They're really pretty, aren't they? Golden, rich, and then those oranges, like sun-kissed orange groves, like the sun beating down on the mm. orange groves in central Spain. I don't know. Beautiful. Yeah, really warm. It does have that warm, soft feeling. But likewise, if you put it with other colours in the su in the, in the summer, mm. the orange pops. Most definitely. Mm. <gasps> love, love, love these. 12 millimetre round, 350 carats, only six pounds and 95 pence. I'll just check your strand. Mm. Oh, we don't have very many of those. Um, 40 centimetres in length. I guarantee you 38, but you might get a wee bit more. Right, what's next? Sunstone! Oh, this is amazing. These are huge. <laughs> this has been in a clearance show before. Mm. Obviously that didn't work because it's still here. Um, <laughs> <laughs> 130, 140 carats of sunstone. Let's see, see what I can do for you tonight then. 7 by 4 millimeter to 11 by 5 on a 20 centimeter strand. They are fabulous, aren't they? Copper platelets within them are giving you this really unique and individual twinkling, this golden colour, copper colour, and totally natural for you. Really got a, love of these, uh, a lot of love for these gemstones. Oof, from the feldspar family, as you will know. Sometimes people know it as a venturine feldspar. You might have heard it as that. They're so sizable. Look at the ones in the middle. Really fabulous quality, and especially to get a rondelle that big, usually they're a little bit, yeah. well, quite a bit small in that. They don't usually go up to 11 by 5 mil. In fact, you're lucky if they even go up to 7 mil, and, and they start at 7. Quite... 21.95 is where we should be. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Um, 10 pounds off! Oh, if you insist. Mm. Uh. 11.95. I'd buy them. Ten pounds mm. off. Why would you go for them, Wendy? I just love sunstone. Mm -hmm. um, I've liked. Uh, I think it's one, one of the very first stones I read, saw when I was a, a kid, mm -hmm. and I actually thought it was glitter. Plus, mm. plastic kind of glitter than that because it, the way it shone um, and I've loved I love sunstone I've loved it ever since it's warm and gentle and just sparkly it's I think it's a lovely gem that you can wear of an evening but you can also mm. calm it down and have it during the day you've got that lovely option with this it is that caliber that you could make a very special evening piece yeah it, and like and likewise with the um, citrine that you had earlier oh god would put that along because the, the smaller ends of drops. it, yeah, and you, that would be beautiful with that, and it would lighten it. I like the sound of mm. that. How gorgeous! 140 carats of sunstone, all the way up to 11 by 5 from 7 by 4 mil, 20 centimeter strand, 11.95. I'll leave that with you. That's stunning. 
Righty ho. Goodness me. Woo. Right. Have a look here. Wow. Fluorite. Look at the quality of these. Woo. You've got zebra fluorites in here. You've got purples going on. You've got greens in there. You've got blues in there. Let me show you in my hand. It might come across a little bit easier. You see all the patterns in there. Oh, they're different. Oh, I love them. A lot of love for these. Goodness me, they start again, eight by six mil they start and they go all the way up to 14 by eight mil, 18 centimeters for you. Let's have a look at those. Really deep purples, aren't they? Oh gosh, you know, this isn't even slightly coming across on TV. The amount of wonderful banding in each and every single one in every single direction, up, down, sideways. Horizontal, vertical, they're just, I've just said the same thing, but two different ways. They're, they're just amazing. <laughs> Lot of love for these. Totally natural, 170 carats. Yep, love for these. QWRU60, multicolor, multicolor, multicolor flu, <laughs> right? 18 centimeters, 14.95 is the should be <clears throat> price. And is Rob going to drop it again? You are not reducing them like that. Oh. You sound so happy about that. Nine pounds, <laughs> 95 pence, five pounds off per person. I don't think Rob was intending on that. I think he's oh, quite happy, 14.95. That's amazing. I 100% agree with you. I don't believe it should be there. If you're implying value or worth, then, well, don't look this way, because I'm not. If, if, everyone used to say to me when I first met people, but when I started this job, they would say to me, oh, is that what it's worth? And I was like, no. Is that is that what you pay elsewhere? Yeah. I was like, no, it's just what we happen to be at. We, I'm never here to imply value worth, and if you ever think I am, then I've not done my job properly because mm. I've allowed you to believe that. I'm not in any way here to imply values or worths. I'm just here to have a look at what we've got, see what you can get elsewhere, and you make your mind up about what you like and what you want. But I know for a fact elsewhere, well, I know for us, we shouldn't be under 14.95. That's our target price based yeah. on how much it cost us to buy it and get it here and bring it to you. This is a 14.95, it's a super price. You know jewelry maker prices. We didn't need to go down lower, but it has been in the past, so we've just honored that. That hurt. <laughs> you won't let me pick anything else again now, will you? Um, wow. Is this... Oh, hello there. Oh, hello. Faceted drops. Briolette faceted drops. Have a look at these. Oh. I want them. Do you? I really need them. Really, really, Ooh. really want them. White, Topaz, November's Bristol. Why do you want them so much? I know why I love them, but it, work. Have it, I thought it was Moonstone initially when you bought it out, um, but it's got like a cloudy look to it, and I haven't got any Topaz. It's Aww. one stone I actually don't have. It's always on the shows when I'm on. Oh, no. So I can never get it, but oh, that is gorgeous. Because we have um, versions of the white topaz and then the clear topaz. Clear topaz, mm. of course, is where you have not one inclusion. White topaz is where you have the odd inclusion. These are totally natural, so you get that, as you were saying earlier, you love that natural beauty. Mm. You may have, the, well, you do have the odd markings in each and every single one, and they're just divine, divine. and then you get that moment of sheer clarity and brilliance coming through. <laughs> just thought it reminds me of gin, um, gin and tonic. Does it? <laughs> When you put the tonic in, sorry guys, I live in a pub. <laughs> 17 pounds and 95 pence, 85 carats, 8 by 5 to 13 by 8 mil. The price has been, re you are reducing it again. Oh my gosh. Oh, please. 12 pounds and 95 pence. Oh. 12 pounds and 95 pence. Wow, it's twelve. I can't believe the price from where it should yes. have been. To what was that, seventeen ninety five, and we're at twelve. But even at seventeen ninety five, that that was an exceptionally good price. Twelve ninety five is uh, buy them. Go for it. Twelve ninety five. Let me put these away. Wow. Oh, I'm not gonna get mm. one of them. No. <laughs> oh wow. Let me show you this. Multicolour Moonstone, one of my favourites. 
I, I just want to wear these strands the way they are. Just pop them on. Have a looky here. Wowza. <gasps> Makes me think of peaches and cream. I think it will go with your outfit I was exceptionally just say well. That. Where are you? I, I, I'd buy two of them and make them into it. I've got new glasses coming. I'd make them into the glass um, hanger. <gasps> and it'd go perfect with this top. It really like would. It you wouldn't see them. No. Nice little um, rosary link chain. <gasps> oh, how beautiful. That'd be done. I want them. I want them stretchy bracelets. That's what I started making at Jewelry Maker. Still yeah. made five years later, I'm still making stretchy bracelets. I love them. I pop them on when I'm going out, layer them up. I think they're fab. Easy. You don't really need any findings. A little yeah. knot and a blob of glue. Job diddly done. And know how to tie a knot tight. Yeah. yeah. Once you've done that, you've got yourself some elastic. Mm. Perfect. Um, these are fabulous. 40 carats. You're getting four millimetre rounds, approximately 38 centimetres length. But should I give it a good wee measure? Jai R, you may say J, I say Jai, R, G, P, 90. Well, there we go, 39 centimetres, so I'll promise you 38, but 6.95. Well, there you go. Would you, have, would you be happy with that price, Wendy, if you're, well, I know you're here, but. Yes, if I was at home, definitely. Um, but you have to remember as well, you lose a lot of the stone, the, when you're cutting small stones like that, you lose Absolutely. a lot. So there's a, they're actually quite difficult to cut. Um, and smaller gemstones are harder to come by. And at 6 95 it's amazing how we do it. It really is. I agree. Well, of mm. course I'm going to agree. <laughs> Quite like the peach, peachy pink pearls with them. With the peach ones. Plenty of options. But I think it's really time to bring you our neon appetite, our final star buy, mm. what do you reckon? Yeah, I can't believe it's the end of the show. Is it? It's probably the fastest four hours ever. <laughs> Are you ready for this? Mike might not feel quite the same way because he's not been feeling too well, but let's do it. Let's do your star buy. This strand, the length of it, the quality of colour. Let me give you 40 centimetres. I'm going to promise you 38. No, I'm not. I'm going to promise you 37 because that's what the information says. But I currently actually have 40. Phenomenal. What a colour. A dream or a dream. Mm. From here in the studio, my hand to the recording, you're looking at the exact same quality of colour. It's not been enhanced by recording it. It's not that we've put any fancy lights on it. It simply looks like this. It looks like this when it's spinning around. In fact, if anything, it doesn't look as sparkly when it's spinning around. No, that, that, that picture makes it look duller. From here, you can see it sparkle, even sitting there. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I'm not exactly moving it. It's just, no. I'll move it now, but mm. a dream gemstone. Quantity-wise, there's not thousands. It's my last opportunity of the night. It's been scheduled for us with a minimum or, well, a maximum, sorry, of 28 opportunities. There's not a lot, but it is very special. And we thought it, it doesn't deserve to be in the vault. It deserves to be seen. Whether you wanted to add one or two to a design or whether you wanted to have a full-on necklace of this neon appetite, that's obviously your prerogative. That's totally up to you. Mm. Personally, I love it like this. I want to put some smoky quartz with it. I think it'd be a little bit different. Maybe some antique wire. Antique bronze findings, copper colour findings, I think yeah, would look lovely. Copper. Wendy, what would you like to do? I took the, the, the cabochon that you had earlier. That's the blue opal. That got taken away. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, the blue opal. I would use that and I'd use those as accents all the way around it and I'd use it with the copper. Oh, yeah. Um, I love the copper and maybe uh, patina it Ooh. slightly and rub off in various different places. But that, yeah, I see, uh, some urines and it would go beautifully with those druzies. Oh gosh, Just yes. Just around the outside of those druzies, that would be lovely. How pretty. So the mm. druzies, and there's not, well, there's plenty of options. These. Uh those, those pearls are going with just about everything in the show. <laughs> they, they absolutely are, aren't they? Pick if you got them, well colour. done. Um, and I do that with that blue. And it is, it's a, quite a long strand. Yeah. With the amount, the amount of stones that you'll get on there. Absolutely, I with the rondelles. I channel a set into silver. Ooh. So two rounds, round rings and then channel set into it. You, you would get loads sort of with channel set 
ah. out of that and it's such a pretty colour. And the uniformity of colour is there for you as well. Yeah. What I love about Appetite is the same thing I love about Prairie de Tourmaline. It's the glow that it has. It has this outstanding glow and if I lift it up you might see some of that glow coming through and that's because it contains a high, really high content of phosphorus it gives it the glow which is what you have in a Pariba tourmaline the phosphorus gives it its glow I'm in love with them every moment the way the light catches it the brilliance that you get the luster that you get that flash of scintillation as well it's got everything I would look for in a genuine gem And then I have only 28, so... It's hard to believe that, mo that uh, Mother Nature can produce such an amazing colour. Isn't it phenomenal? It's in the rocks and it's just amazing. Rub off the dirt and that's what you get. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine. You want to put silver with it? Rob wants mm. to put silver with it. I want to put antique bronze, copper. You're for copper. I like copper and I like the antique. That would talk, if you want a softer look, it'll talk. Mm. But if you want it to pop, put silver with it. Yeah, absolutely. Well, Rob clearly wants it to pop. Mm. He's, he's just loving silver with it. I think, yeah, channel sight into, with silver into you two mean, like, silver. I basically what about silver jump rings? Yeah. In between, just. Yeah, Space. you could put your little little ones. So you could, but if you've got silver wire, you can actually wrap and make those yourself, so they're smaller mm. to fit those. Because some of our jump rings wouldn't would be too large. But um, yeah, just put, pop them in between little spacers. Sounds lovely. Rob's telling me he's got silver spacers. Mm. He thinks, and possibly one of his shows. Keep tuned for that. He saw them last night at some point and half inched them. He's not put them in a show yet. Keep your eyes peeled. Are you ready? 37 centimetres in length, oh. 39.95 should be, going to be. We're going to get a postcard from Martha shortly as well. Love that wee trip there. <laughs> oh. Oh. Are you for real? For the colour that you've got, the quality that we're seeing, the glow that you look for in this gemstone, Janet's in, Mary's in, Yorkshire, Elaine, Francis, Alison, Jane, Merseyside, London, Greater London, South Yorkshire, West Midlands, Wilt Wiltshire, you're all in and you're all getting involved and I can completely 100% see why. I've just seen that lovely orange ribbon, the Zari thread, mm. how fantastic would that be? It reminds me of the brew and the iron yeah. variety drink. Yes, <laughs> yeah, it is, isn't it? <laughs> it would be quite, <laughs> quite exciting, quite a distinctive piece. Yeah. And as you see, the luster on every single one of them, the way that light catches them, everything I look for in a Pariba tourmaline with that phosphorescence glow, and then you've got the neon variety, which you don't get in Pariba. Oh. It's so coveted. I can't offer you another gemstone as an alternative. It's the ultimate one, isn't it? $29.95 is 100% a treat and a half. Well, you saw it, it's £10 off per person. With 28 in stock, that's £280. Sorry, Martha. It's a reduction of £280. Enjoy it. DLNV93. Absolutely. Let's get this on. Mm. Do you think? That's lovely. Almost makes me feel like I've got a tan. It's that it's the colour and I don't have a tan. Mm. Anyone who knows me knows <laughs> I don't have a tan. So the quality and the colour that we're getting and how war how it warms the skin tone. Yeah, it does. It suits your skin tone perfectly. Thank you. And your that skin colour. tone is pastel. <laughs> yeah, you are. Yes. <laughs> um, as I say, lots and lots of you getting involved. More of you checking out. Dorset's coming through. Lanarkshire, Monica and Beverly are in. And Surrey, lovely to see you all. Good evening to you all. Worcestershire there, Deborah, Derbyshire. Eleanor and L'Example are showing an interest. Great to see you adding to that one post and packaging in any one day. A really, really special treat. And if we just have a look back at those peacock mm. and how... Per perfect they go together I mean they really do they match perfectly and it's something different I mean I don't know anybody else that has something with these together you might and if you have let me know I'd love to hear really really would whether it be on the show or whether it be on Facebook um, just drop me a message my name's Ali Defoe it's lovely to have you but £29.95 pence. that's a treat and a half isn't it definitely 
<laughs> Love it. And especially with those amethyst. Imagine those from earlier. Oh, or even the white ones, they've already gone back, but yeah. I believe the blue opal's gone back to the vault. Well, it's been packed away. We don't have it here. Sorry. <coughs> no. I fall off a chair. Mm. Just think about with the pastel pinks. Oh, of course I am. Rob's letting me know that on Monday he's going to have those sterling silver spacers he was talking about. How lovely. Stardust ones. Oh, I love those. A lot of love to those. Mm, I'm not going to lie, I'm pretty envious that Rob's got that. Martha, do you know anything we've got tomorrow night? I can tell everybody. Amazing things. Amazing things. <laughs> amazing things. So many things I can't mention. So many things, it would be rude to mention Hannah just one. Osborne joining us. Hannah yes. Osborne. Of her first workshop today about colour. Mm. Lots of Ooh, lots and lots of colour mm. tomorrow night. Should be fantastic. When did you know off the top of your head when you're next back with us? 23rd, 24th. You know what I would do? Have a look on jewelrymaker.com. Keep your eye on the website. We tend to update you as to what's coming up as and when. I guess designer wise, of course. Um, so, Wendy, thank you so much. Thank you. It's been lovely. It's been lovely having you. Um, I've just heard I've got some gorgeous zircon tomorrow night. Mm. Oh. Ruby Matrix Cavishans, Ethiopian Opals, Spinel, Sterling Silver. Yeah. Oh my word! Graduated bars that are stunning. Oh yeah. Rob's like, you've got an amazing <laughs> show tomorrow. Oh. oh, Rob, thank you for covering sickness tonight. You've been a superstar. Team, you're amazing. Mike, get well soon. To you, thank you so much. I'll see you live at five tomorrow night. Take care. Bye. Do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. Did you know that no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? Morning, jewelry makers. How are you? Do you know why I'm full of beans this morning, Jan? I think it's because because you're here. Do you think? Oh, I'm not too bad now. I was a bit sort of groggy this morning, but I'm, well, you, I'm you never there. seemed groggy. You're I, always I chipper. A bit groggy, but I'm good now. You're always now chipper. And we're all. I mean, we've established we're all quite local girls, so. We, could, we, we did effectively kind of roll out of bed, didn't we, and yeah. into the studios. <laughs> um, right, I'm excited about this kit because to me. It's that perfect kit to commission something for Christmas Day. It's that perfect kit to create something big, statement, something that's going to grab the attention, whether it's you that's wearing it, whether it is on a craft fair, whether it is the first piece that you send into the Wall of Fame, whether it's your first piece of jewellery that you make. Now listen, I never confess myself to be a jewellery maker. I'm not. In comparison to your incredible creations and certainly our guest designers, I'm absolutely rubbish. But you know what? It's a hobby. It's something that we develop. We enjoy doing. So who cares? Who who cares? If you're getting enjoyment out of creating something, then absolutely fantastic. But the point I'm making is within this kit, whilst there are some exceedingly high-end gemstones in here, it's giving you opportunities. It's going to cover your uh, very experienced jewellery designers and also your new beginners. It's called Get the Party Started, so I think, I think that's absolutely appropriate, don't you? It's, it's just a brilliant kit to work with. I'm in love with this Saru thread. 
I absolutely love this sari thread and I'll be talking some more about it throughout the course um, because Jan has actually done something which I was messing around with on air the other day because I'm quite a tactile person but um, what you've created Jan is way way beyond what I was referring to let's bring your should be price so if you were to buy all of these components which I will go through individually off our web uh, bear in mind individually they're competitive price points we already do a lot of research into making sure that they are ahead of our competitors um, as best we possibly can anyhow uh, then we put it in a bundle or, or a kit rather and you get amazing even more inc uh, incredible deals now you have got your uh, standard uh, standing uh, beading uh, pack so your threading material your beading material and your clear elastic so that comes as standard within your kit and it's the gold which works beautifully with all the other components then you've got three very large spools of your um, your zari thread zari thread is not like a normal ribbon it, it, it has got a structure the best way to actually compare it um, is to uh, is to a mesh um, a wire mesh so you can create amazing designs that will hold also and again 